Hello everyone and welcome back to POB Gaming here with Big J. We're going to be doing a live stream of uh, Hitman 3, finally. After <laughs> after many requests, I'm definitely going to finally go through. And we're going to start playing this. Now, this one to ensure. And uh, hopefully whoever comes in the chat can go ahead and give me a heads up of uh, whether or not the game audio is too loud or anything like that. Definitely just give me a heads up. I'm gonna go ahead and maybe in OBS here just put it down a little bit on the singles levels go pretty high. So let's go ahead and do that. And uh, yeah. So Hitman 3. Very awesome. Um, the last Hitman game that I played all the way through was I believe Hitman Absolution. Um, absolutely love that game. Probably my favorite in the series so far is Blood Money. Though I do have a lot of nostalgia for the original games too. Um, those were very fun back in the day. So, um, we're going to get straight into it. Now, I did not play the last game in the series, and I cannot, I do not know if there was one actually before that as well, but <clears throat> we're going to, we're going to go through, and I think probably the smartest thing I should do is go ahead and go through the training real fast here, because it has been so long, so the game, the game probably has different, um, it probably has different uh, mechanics than I did I remember. And uh, guys, if you uh, if you guys end up coming through to the channel and you're you're new here, go ahead and you know please give uh, the video a like, maybe subscribe to the channel. Um, and yeah, we're gonna get straight into this. Yeah, I'm just making sure the stream looks okay. Uh, before I do anything. Uh, should I should I use the mouse and keyboard? You know what? I guess I should. You know what? I had a controller ready to go, but I think I'm gonna go with the mouse and keyboard. Let me let me get used to that. Unless unless there's some something super crazy where, you know, my pinky needs to be on one side and my thumb needs to be on like the number pad for some reason, then uh, then I'll go ahead and I'll try to use a mouse and keyboard. Boy, this looks this looks great. And I'm not a, I'm not even running this like on the full. My my graphics card will not allow me to run this at the most optimal settings. Or it is. I have used the GeForce Experience to go ahead and optimize the game, but um, it still looks pretty good. It would obviously be better if I had like you know a slightly better graphics card, but I'm using you know um, a GTX S16 Super, so it's a it's a pretty good card, but um, it can't it can't really run everything at the highest uh, highest of the high. Oh yeah. Little grape, uh, little grape crush. Some ice. <laughs> Anybody who's watching, you guys gotta tell me whether or not the audio and my voice sound good. Um, just, just definitely give me a heads up. Okay. Second chances, Miss Birdwood. Not here. I choose him. Man, why or why? A blank slate, antisocial, apathetic and unresponsive. No doubt the boy shows promise, but perhaps I see a possibility we have a sea limitation. Isn't that what a handle does, sir? We'll see. Anyone can kill Miss Birdwood. He still remembers nothing? If he does, he's not sharing. We will check up on his story. 
to the hospital in Romania. In the mm. meantime, keep them under close watch. Some callbacks here. Okay, very cool. This is a uh, very nice. Uh, I thought this was gonna just be like a typical like little tutorial section. This is very nice so far. <laughs> this operation originally took place in Sydney. The target was Calvin Ritter, infamous cutwater, also known as the Sparrow. You will need to infiltrate the yacht, isolate and eliminate your target and exit suit, all without arousing suspicion. And remember, as an ICA agent, you are the most dangerous person in any room. But blunt force is a generic misuse, and a true assassin never keeps his agents in his head. Yeah, that's right. This this was in another game. I remember, I remember seeing. Um, I don't remember which channel it was. You exhibit an unusual level of enhanced sense of perception. Use your instinct now to sense the position and movement of people around you and identify your target. Use control to use instinct. Okay. Ah, see, it's a guy. Gentlemen, can't walk through here. Turn As suspected, security won't allow you on board in your current outfit. You should avoid confrontation and look for another way in. Oh, okay, access vault. Sneak up and subdue him quietly. Yeah, controller. <laughs> Pretty awesome. <laughs> that didn't take very long. I'm like, yeah, no, 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 it's going to be controller. Um, <laughs> okay. A whole day, okay. Tend to see uniforms, not faces. It's true. Very cautious, though. Some people. You know what, guys? I'm gonna have to do a quick pause here. Um, I am one of those people that do have to use um, invert. And I think it's is it the y-axis? People are more observant than others. They're not bad initiates. Before you move on, I suggest you hide your tracks. You have a much greater chance of success if your actions go undetected. The toilet should do the trick. Right. Oh no! Ugh. Okay. <laughs> um... Hmm, one quick second here. The funny thing is, now that I've done that, um... Oh, shit. Okay, cool, right bumper. <laughs> I was wondering, because I, I would not know what the, uh... Um... What that would be... Okay, save and load. The game auto-saves during gameplay. You can manually save and load from the menu. Okay, we can save scum, very cool. Uh, so, uh the menu... Oh, I see. Okay, cool. This is this is actually kind of interesting. Um, what I was saying in the beginning, um, while well, the mission was starting up there. I'll give you one second. Here. Oh, very tasty. Was I do remember a um, channel playing this mission, and you know what? It may have been Funhouse. Now that now that I'm thinking through, it may have been Funhouse when it was. I think it was Hitman Two. And it was like a proper thing. Hold on, that mechanic with his, his back turned. He's what we call an enforcer, okay? <clears throat> Enforcers are marked with a threat icon. You will find will find you suspicious. Make sure they're not they do not spot you, okay? Understood. Hold on. That mechanic with his back turned? 
Paul an enforcer. He knows his crew and he'll see right through your disguise. So stay out of his line of sight. Okay, easy enough. Right. Now for the tricky part. Start by locating your target. Intel suggests he's around the bar area. You're in. Well done, initiate. This is so funny, so they it's all made of plywood. Very cool looking. Um Very crowded too. It's a very crowded space. Sure. I suggest you follow him. See if you can't isolate him. Okay. Looks like all crabs are A-OK. -okay. Hmm. Whoa, hold to be this. expected. Don't Let us pry the deckers off limits for mechanics. If assimilation is the name of your game, you'll need a better disguise. Alright, throwing blood items, uh, people will knock them out and will not eliminate them. If they are found, they will be woken up. Okay, understood. Okay, pick up the wrench. Oh, I don't have to actually manually aim it. <laughs> Jesus. That's gonna leave a mark. Good thing we have insurance. Okay. Unlike mechanics, the cabin crew is allowed upstairs access. I see what you're getting at. Very unorthodox. And I like it. Man, it's it runs so smooth. I'm so happy that it's actually like running pretty good. Hello, sir. Yeah, what's up? I'm the only other bald guy here. What's up? <laughs> private deck. Now we get it. Ah, but according to Intel, Ritter is another enforcer who picks his own cabin crew. So tread carefully. I see. Okay. Okay. You know how to play a game of quick. The target will spot you if you get too close. Eavesdrop on his conversation. Try and find a way to blend in. Out of the game of life is hard. This sparrow is going to be a drag. Already? You're not Buddy, a superhero. Making us look bad. They don't Do exist. your food, why don't you not look Blending bad? Blending in, I see. Well done, initiate. Peace, my dude. Like Ritter is about to have a private meeting with the gentleman in white. This could be useful. Hey, how are you? Oh, that's his body guard, isn't it? Disturbed. Try sneaking around the back. You think you can use my uniform and stole it from a Georgia Star supplied with collection in Boston a couple of years back? Most of my clients are artist friends. So what do you do? Reactor? Well, uh, not just a reactor, Mr. Ritter. 
the controls have been changed too much. Legal items. Certain items are considered illegal depending on your current outfit. Avoid suspicion by concealing the illegal items. Some large items, however, cannot be concealed by your stuff. Your target is down. Now head calmly towards an exit. Change your disguise. Be advised, initiate. Oopsie daisies. <laughs> Not just a reactor. You're on the right track. Target is down. Now head calmly towards an exit. There we go, that's what I was trying to figure out. What it was the... Okay, there we go, jeez. <laughs> that's what I was trying to figure out was like, how do I holster it? That's weird. Oh, huh, strange. It's like now it's becoming like kind of choppy. Like out of nowhere. The red car marks your exfiltration point. Simply push the button and you're in the clear. Oh, strange is like jittery. I wonder why. Why did it start doing that? Is it actually good for that? Mission training complete. And may I say, elegantly done, initiate. I guess my hunch was right about you. I look forward to the final test. Oh, there's another test, cool. Oh, that stuttering will go away. I don't know what happened there. Oh, I got disconnected. Let's retry. Welcome back, Initiate. As an ICA agent, every challenge you face can be overcome in multiple ways. 
Complete this exercise again. This time attacking it from a different angle. Okay. Vary your strategy. Improvise. We will be watching. Free room training. Before the final test, you're allowed to uh, more time to practice the Ritter operation. You're free to choose your approach and you can use challenge the challenges that I encourage you to complete as many challenges as possible. Oh, okay. Board the yacht as a disguised security guard. Do you guys see what I'm seeing? Oh, like in the back? What's going on there? <laughs> What's going on with his legs? Do you see what I'm seeing? He's like right by the railing, the security guard. Um, board the yacht as a security guard. Okay. Assassinate the target in a live trap accident. Oh my god. Okay. Something's in the place. Place a weapon and have a guard find it. Feats. Uh, the cleaner. Hide the target in a closet. Find rat poison on deck zero zero. Join the crew. Raccoon in the skies and cabin on deck zero zero. Poison the target with rat poison. Strike the guard using a generator. Assassin the target with remote explosives. Disguise yourself as Norfolk. Beat with the target. Ooh, that'll be pretty cool. Great change. Yeah, resume. Yeah, what's going on with him? I don't know. Oh, that's not him. It was the straps from the. Yo, okay, that's that's pretty funny. Okay, I completely, I completely had that wrong. We have flash grenades. We have a lock. Let's grab that real quick. Is that coins? Here we go. And do I just? Oh, okay, cool. Uh, a thrown coin is an effective method of distraction. People who hear the impact will go to investigate. If they find a coin, they will pick it up. Hello, the name. Yep. I don't need that. Alrighty. <clears throat> so we're going to try to do this training mission a little bit different. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. The guy's actually a gray here. Now he's he's not like a security guard, so I don't, I don't know. Like, can I? Okay, I gotta be aware of that. I'm not, I'm not like snapped in place. That was my bad. That was stupidity right there. I need to like move him to like a different spot. Um. Oh shit. Uh, restart mission. <laughs> oh, that was like immediate. Like you're an idiot. <laughs> As an ICA, it... Okay, cool. That was my bad. <laughs> uh, we'll go ahead and grab a coin. Oh, I had two. I could have grabbed. Shoot. So my bad. Because I'm fairly confident I can actually get this guy like right here. Sweet.
There we go. Cool. So actually, the controls are not too crazy from the last, like, too crazy different from the last time I played. Like, in Absolution, I almost think this is the exact same control scheme. Somebody can definitely correct me in the comments whether or not that's true or not. But it's the last game I remember playing. And yeah, that's exactly what it feels like. Something I'm really happy about is that that stutter issue is now gone, which is great. Okay, sub nerds. Yeah, what up? What up? <laughs> oh, there he is. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't know how this is acceptable. Okay, cool. Cool, the game is pretty smart about like um, doing like the checks. For the for the for the um, characters to start moving, because he was he would have been down there for quite some time waiting for me as like a uh, as a different person basically, different disguised individual. Hey, how you doing, <coughs> Jackson Hers and Woodland Game is in the house. Let's see, we all gonna pop it in that soon. Good luck, Agent Forty Seven. Well, thank you so much. Um, I'm gonna try my best on this. I remember this one. From Hitman 2. Yeah, it, I, it is. I never played Hitman 2, but um, I remember watching it on, uh, watching Funhouse <laughs> try to play it. Um, but it's it's so funny because the whole thing is like made of like wood for like a training area. <laughs> so cool. Wait, where am I? Where am I gonna go? There he is. <laughs> Makes me wonder, have they ever remastered Blood Bunny? I would love it if they did. Hey, you. Mr. River, I'm telling you. Get out of my face, fool. Mr. River, I'm telling you. Mr. Norfolk, we meet at last. It's okay to be the fly guy. Hello, Mr. Norfolk. Alrighty, let's see. Gee, that sucks, bro. Too, too bad on that. <laughs> Mr. Norfolk, how are you? Good, dude. First big game in years. Damn it, almost there. Yeah, dude. Kind of funny, he's not really, not really talking about. Wait, was it glass cutter? No, no, but something work related. That's kind of interesting. So completely different dialogue, whether or not it's depending on the situation. Very cool. God, I am so bad with my aim. My God. You know, I had it before. How did I do it? There we go. Drop the item. Hopefully, you can get somebody to grab it. I'll kill them all uh, in the freezer. <laughs> I can literally do a ton of these at one time. Um, hmm. 
but I should get straight into the uh, main story here. Uh, which one did I come from? There we go. You guys, uh, security guards, uh, not doing a good job. I would definitely uh, would, uh, would have definitely give you a reprimand on that. You're working working alongside me. <laughs> Ladies. <laughs> You know what? I forgot which game it was. Was it Hitman? The original Hitman 2? Where it was? Where you could literally put on limited bodies like in one container? <laughs> Easy enough. Once again, great work, initials. This exercise is available for as long as you need. When you are ready to advance, you have only to let us know. That's so funny. The whole thing was made of plywood for like a training set. That's pretty cool. That that's a good way to do a um like a training level. I heard a guy put a whole town in a freezer and it meant to jeez. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh that's that's a damn good freezer. I need one of those. <laughs> uh, let's go to the final test. Let's see what the final test is supposed to be. I just got word. Romania was a dead end. They said that he landed? Place was true enough. Deserted. But we found no trace of the man there. Or anyone else for that matter. Someone erased his steps. Hmm. We'll keep digging, of course. But frankly, it's as if the earth just spat him out. Are you still determined? Does it matter? I was told there'd be no second chances. Don't believe everything you hear, Miss Burnwood. My decision stands. Very well. There's a video I need to see. See it. Probably a few fuses, maybe. That'd be that'd be pretty cool though. Like <laughs> just stuff a whole town in there. Based on an authentic 1979 mission. Hmm. The high point of training director Soda's career as an active agent. The target was just the knight. A famous US chess master exposed as a Soviet spy. Soda's caught up with Knight at a military airfield in Cuba and in Is this not also from Hitman 2? This will be your objective as well. Now listen carefully. ICA exams aren't normally this difficult. Not only was the airfield a virtual fortress, but he even added additional guards. Sodas wants you to fail. He considers you a threat, and this way, your unfortunate exit from the program won't raise any eyebrows. Well, if he thinks we're bowing out, he is sorely mistaken. Good luck, initiate. Cool. First things first, we need to gather some intel. Now, you didn't hear this from me, but I would eavesdrop on the two mechanics just beyond the fence. Some conversations are more important than others. Listen closely. Okay. Hey, hey, guys, uh, in the chat, can you tell me whether or not does the, does the audio sound okay? Like, can you hear the game audio all right over me? You have uncovered key information that will help you complete your mission in a unique and fulfilling way. Very fulfilling. Um, follow the guide and use this knowledge to your advantage. Press OK. Grant information. OK. So, Jasper Knight is leaving Cuba on a Soviet fighter jet. But first, he needs to test the jet's safety features. You could presumably get night game audio is a bit low okay okay hmm. that was just it. thank you
the reason why I'm so I'm wondering whether or not the audio was bad was that uh, Wicklam on the night that we were all playing um, uh, Rogue Company, I didn't realize till afterwards that the in-game audio was so low that you could barely hear you, you could barely hear the other people we were playing with. So I really hate when that ends up happening, where the game audio is so quiet. Right, let's get you inside. You'll need a fitting disguise. Okay, pretty easy enough. Hmm. A guard uniform should do nicely, but you'll need to draw him out and isolate him. Awesome. Thank you so much, Wicklum. Hey, are you there? I heard something suspicious. I'll keep you posted. Good. Uh, He's distracted. Work? Now's your chance. And they say cash is obsolete. So, this uniform should provide access to the hangar. Good job, Nick. Cheers. <laughs> Let's see if we can fit everybody in this thing, eh? <laughs> um. So something I found out, Wicklum, I guess while playing on the first mission there, is that if your game starts to stutter for some reason, I guess uh, I guess it has to do with the internet connection to their servers. Because I guess the game has to be online all the time. When I did the first part of that training mission, it uh, completely stuttered at the end, and it was due to a connection issue. So hopefully, hopefully when you're on your PS5, it probably won't do it on your PS5 because it should always be online regardless. But on the on the PC here. It starts to stutter really bad when the loses connection to their servers. How many can you fit those? <laughs> so that's an enforcer. Just go around him. Yeah, it was very strange because uh, I was playing the mission and it was super smooth, like buttery smooth, and then out of nowhere it started getting like, it almost looked like lag. But I was like, how in the world can I be lagging? Like the game was running fine, and then at the end of it, it said that I had lost my connection. Staying in Cuba, it's only a matter of time before Langley catches up with him. If I was Knight, I'd be long gone. If that was the plan. Then Knight pulls a fast one. Now he wants his girlfriend to go with him across the curtain. Naturally, Kremlin says no, wasn't part of the agreement. Knight says he's got documents on the other Soviet spies in the U.S. Documents that will leak into the wrong hands in case anything happens to him or his girlfriend. Interesting. Okay. Good work. Are we clear to go over the safety protocol? Yeah, go ahead. Hmm, I see. In order to make adjustments to the jet and perform the role of safety inspector, you're going to need a mechanic's disguise. Game looks beautiful though. I'm gonna say that. Looks gorgeous. Perfect. Now be gentle. He's an actor. Not like that was not the most suspicious thing ever. I'm just gonna, just gonna crouch around you, buddy. Oh, perfect. There's a box right here. Uh, 
Uh, shouldn't take much bandwidth. No, you know what? It really, sh it really shouldn't. But there's, it's definitely, um, it's a problem on my end. I have, a, I have a separate router in my room. That's not really from the internet uh, company itself. It's just something that I can get internet inside my space. And for some reason, it just does, it does really weird stuff. Uh, to be honest with you, it just it'll do things where like I'm online, I could be streaming something, and then I'll lose connection. Right. Now to like other online stuff while I'm online. Mechanism has been disabled. You may need a tool to re-enable it. Well. And now to confront your target. Knight's office should be somewhere on the first floor. The trap is sitting. I'll fetch Jasper Knight and guide him through the procedure. Understood. Well done, Initiate. I dare say this is an accident waiting to happen. Oh, there he is. See, like, right there? I'm getting a little stutter issue. I might have just lost connection to the service. What's up? Jasper Knight, we gotta go over the safety protocol. Follow me, please. Oh, must we really? Aye. I bet you the people at Eidos are so happy that they did not get rid of the original actor, voice actor, like they wanted to before Absolution. For people who do not know, the original voice actor for Agent 47, they were gonna actually remove him um, when they were doing Hitman Absolution. But then the community found out about it. That's such a massive outcry against them doing that, which is which is so weird. Imagine imagine getting rid of a voice actor that's so iconic as Agent 47, and not only is he iconic, the actual character Agent 47, he looks exactly like the voice actor. They basically made it after him. So it is so cool that after all these years, he's still being the he's still doing the voice acting, and I believe he's like half Canadian, half South African, if I'm not wrong. I just can't remember what his name is, but he's a super cool dude. Oh yeah, look, look, look at that stutter. Okay. When blending in enforcers, whoa. Your current stars are unable to spot you. This is indicated by the blank icon O over their head. Hey, Mr. Knight, climb in the cockpit, please. Step one, strap yourself in. Uh, okay, all strapped in. Step two, locate the ejector seat handle. Uh, yeah, we found it. Step three, pull the ejector seat handle. <laughs> I never thought they would use a functioning jet. Good thing you didn't disable this parachute. <laughs> anyway, you did it. Excellent work, Initiate. Bet Sodas didn't see this coming. Now stay calm and head towards an exit.
It's so ingrained in my head to to have the original disguise when leaving. <laughs> That's like a part of me. Congratulations, Agent. You are cleared for field duty. Damn, that was a lot of XP just for doing that little thing. That's cool. I hope you know what you just did. The chopper leaves at dawn. Now get out of my sight. <laughs> Peace out, Pup Scout. <laughs> so what happens now? You go back into the world, disappear, stay on your own and on the move. When we need you, we will contact you. And so does. He played his hand, and he lost. He cannot touch us now. <laughs> Still, I can't believe we beat him at his own game. If you know your enemy. <laughs> Quite right. I should tell you, the trail went dead after Romania. Our team found no records of any kind. No name. Nothing. I think they called me 47. That's not a name. So make it one. Right. Ooh, badass. Agent 47. Ooh, shit. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Is that the buffer fish, right? Flashbacks, this is sick. You were always the best. Nobody ever came close. You defined the art, and it defines This is from Blood Bunny, from our wrong. This could be from Agent, from number two, but some of this looks familiar from like um, the other games here. Pretty cool. Your actions have changed the world. Consequences. I have felt the cost. That's what defines me. Okay, interesting, interesting. Agent 47 and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the shadow client and learn about 47's past. 
But when 47 discovers that the shadow client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Together, they manage to capture the constant, forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. However, the constant has an ace up his sleeve. Very cool, I like that. Mm -hmm. Mission on top of the world. Oh, look at this. I see. That's what the... Oh, that's what that was. Okay. That's pretty cool. You know, I heard that you could actually play the old... The old, um... Uh, the old games all in one here. Interesting. Okay, well... The good thing is, with Hitman, even though I didn't play these two, I did keep up with the story, so I kind of do know what's going on. I just didn't get a chance to play them. They were, it was at a time, both those games came out at a time where I was not financially uh, very well. Um, and I was incredibly busy with uh, with working, um, moving around the country quite a bit, trying to, trying to you know, stabilize myself. So the, the thing was, I always did kind of keep up with the games though, because it is one of my favorite series. Um, it's definitely my top five. So it's, it's great to finally be able to sit down and... Uh, and actually do like actually play the games there we go best laid plans okay look close in the shadows behind the everyday world beyond the headlines and the seats of power a hidden hand kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away. To do the unthinkable, the unforgivable. And it never gave us a second thought until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back. Me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. We trapped the Constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learnt the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And just maybe look towards the future. 37. It's time. Man, this looks so good. Partners are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. Wait, is that a beacon? What the hell? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations, over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped 
He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking, and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War, and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Happy hunting. Sweet. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, so um, our objectives, let's see. Okay, oh, so this is just a recap of what they're doing. Yeah, okay, let's get right into it, right? Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the Scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Good luck, 47. that I can hmm. can you imagine by the way being up here oh man I would be freaking out that's gonna kill somebody Scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the window's controls from here. <laughs> That's like so Metroid Prime right there. Um... I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need absolute focus on this one. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. Nice snappy um, save. 
considered reload functions in this game are really nice. Okay, uh, nothing I can grab here. Oh, <laughs> I love it. I love, I love it. I love how that just transitioned like that. Very nice. Interesting. Okay. I'm gonna first go investigate what those are. And so he has bodyguards at all times, it looks like. That one guy would be perfect to disguise us. <laughs> ah, yes. Okay. What is this? Interact. Listen. I want to talk to the partners directly make them understand why all of this is happening and that terminal gives me an idea there's a server room near the sheikh's personal reception if you can gain access to it we might be able to recover useful intel from it we'll have to work together to hack the system but it's our best shot oh the mighty fall there's no one just okay okay It looks like the staff area could provide you with a viable route to the server room. a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area one moment all right try this four seven zero six there's quite a bit of security here one moment you ready for some more fresh air, 47? James Gordon's sick. Of all days, His Highness has everyone working. 
Yeah, I didn't. Re Why did I not see that? <laughs> oh goodness, how did I not see him? <laughs> oh my god, that's too funny. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get this is an easy one overall, boom. <laughs> That's what I get. That's what I get for not paying attention. I gotta be more <clears throat> functionally blind is what I am. Oh my god. Imagine me as an assassin. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got the target done. Everybody's watching me on their couches. <laughs> Listen. I want to talk to the partners directly. And make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. There's a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area. One moment. All right, try this. Four, seven, zero, six. There's quite a bit of security here. One moment. You ready for some more fresh air, 47? That's the part where I'm a little bit... Wait a minute. Ooh. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. How does that knock somebody out and not kill them, man? You threw a hammer at the bloody back of their head. Okay. Alrighty, there we go. Fresh. Looking good. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh... <laughs> but yeah, you can see blood there. Come on. Um, dump them. <laughs> I wonder how many people you can fit in there. Um, okay, cool. At least this way I can look. At least blend in a little bit. Let me go ahead and save. Jeez. <laughs> Confirm. There we go. Ugh. These games, so he's in. Okay, he's in a, an enforcer. So he'll know. He's also an enforcer. Wow. These guys all know each other. Okay. But this is awful. I mean, I'm in my boxers and you are a woman. It's just so embarrassing. Oh, it's nothing I haven't seen before. But you don't understand. I'm military. We military men are used to punctuality. I, I was supposed to be ready and present my papers half an hour ago. Yes, you men in the army with your papers. Super punctual. I get it. 
Yes. Are you making fun of me? That's so cruel. Do you do you know what a man is without his gun? <laughs> man in his boxes, crying like a baby. <laughs> you women will never understand. <laughs> and I don't think we ever will. uniform it would be pretty effective if you wanted to blend in what are you trying to be my mother my god no i need to dress professionally and show my papers do you not understand that okay i'll keep looking thank you okay so i understand now okay so that this wasn't actually that uh that important I think I can open that window remotely. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. with these people right here though. You know what? That gave me an idea. Okay, wait a minute. That really does give me an idea. If I was more quicker with that, because more than likely... You know what? More than likely, she always will leave before he will. The door closes. I can then throw. Yes, hold up. I might be able to go ahead and uh, um, take that dude's uniform. Can open that window remotely. Yes, okay. Scan the lock with your camera and I'll have a try. Okay, so we have the door closed. There we go. That's much better. Yes. Wait a minute. This is very good. Okay, let me go ahead and save that. That's pretty good. Ghazali is reaching out to his worldwide network of lawyers and financial contacts. 
attempting to restore the lost power base of the Providence partners. If Ingram and Stuyvesant were asked to a meeting, thinking they'll be told of new developments, I suspect they'd jump at the chance. There's a lounge area at the top of the building. It can be sealed off for private conversations. If we lure the targets there, they'll be trapped. Oh my god. Ugh. <laughs> Yes, okay. Oh, hello. Hold smokes, there's a lot of people there. You know how what type of endurance you would need to have to do this? Be incredible. Let me take a selfie. <laughs> the server room should be behind one of the doors in this hallway. Wait, what is this? So he's an enforcer for this guy then. Don't <laughs> hmm. a calendar function. We can use this to summon the partners to a fake meeting, forty sec. All right, I'm no hacker like Olivia, but I think you need to pull one of the racks here to gain access to the terminal. Damn it, a silent alarm has been checked. Security is on its way. Hide 47. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh Sorry about that, 47. Let's try again, shall we? Uh, I think I've got it. We'll need a key card to gain access. Someone in maintenance should have one we can borrow for a spell. Hey, it's me. I thought about what 
he said. Yeah, I changed my mind. It was an insane idea to start with. Exploding golf balls. I don't want blood on my hands. There we go. Get him in there. <laughs> Damn, you too. Oh, oh god, gotta love when games do that. Well, that must have done something. Can you see anything different in the room? Admin privileges. Wait a minute, like. Um, Sick of coming down here. System online. Oh, God damn it. to do is access the terminal and use the calendar option to summon the providence partners to a meeting good work the meeting has been booked the partners should be moving up here shortly huh. looks like the lounge can be sealed off for private conversations Andy? Andy. <laughs> excellent i see the partners moving you should join their meeting time to end this 47 Cameras are showing a lot of guards up here. They wouldn't suspect one of their own, though. I just want to remind you about the uh, lockdown drill tomorrow. That's right, 900 hours. And the key card for activating the alarm system is safe. The 
partners are alone now. Hello, I'll sir. activate the panel controlling the room's security features. When you're ready, use it to start the show. Oh, man, this is gorgeous. He wants to talk about? No, but I know that. What's this? Carl? Did you do that? I certainly did not. I have no idea what's going on. Gentlemen. What's the meaning of this? You. You are the one responsible for all this. Gray. What do you want? Something that's been a long time to you. Revenge. Revenge? How but now? You killed Cobb, Nana Cobb, Caruso, the Washington twins, everyone at Haven. You broke into our bank, and you outed Providence to the world. Whatever perceived slight we've done to you is insignificant to the amount of damage you've caused us. You've caused the world. You're a murderous terrorist. Nothing more. What did we ever do to you anyway? You specifically? Nothing. Providence? Everything. Providence made me, and at the flick of a pen, Providence broke me. I'm just uh, returning the favor. Providence has ruined the lives of countless people, expecting and facing no consequence for its actions. You take for yourselves and those who support you, and you burn everyone and everything else to the ground from the comfort of the shadows. No more. Your delusional exposing us achieved nothing beyond moving a few pieces around on a board much more complicated than you can fathom. The world believes we're dead. What more do you want? Me? Nothing. My friend, however, well, let's just say he's a bit of an expert. I'm just here to watch you die. 47, finish it. Seven. Finish it. Finally, Stuyvesant and Ingram are gone. Providence will soon be no more than a bad memory. 47. Thank you. I'll meet you at the rendezvous on the edge of town. And it's the best I can do for keeping them concealed when I open up these doors again. Oops, no, 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 no. Oh, I can't save here, okay. Check. I definitely saw that you could just kill them by shooting that too. That's pretty cool. And there's probably also a mechanism up there as well. see something if I was to go up here because this would obviously close it up here too right yeah it would have surely made it look like an accident right because I could have timed it probably Ooh. there's a person up here though Interesting. But it looks like I can just go out the way I came and then walk around. Oh, it 
quite the new story, right? Brand new massive mega building opened up and you got two dudes dead behind a TV. Shot by a guard's own pistol. I do like how there are multiple ways to get out though, that's pretty cool. Explosive golf balls, that's so cool. Awesome. Good little introductory. Let's see. Sweet. There's a lot you could have done in this though. Tons. Holy smokes, we definitely were well, we're definitely coming back. We're gonna do a whole lot more. New location mastery unlocked. Reached the Dubai level four. Oh, okay, nice. Starting location meeting room. Oh. Uh, what's this? Mealy snow globe. The novelty snow globe. Ooh, I can definitely. Ooh, that's non-lethal. Okay, I, I was thinking you're gonna just smash him with the glass, and the figurine was gonna go into him. What's next? Oh, uh, hidden stash kitchen. That's cool. So I liked I like that. I know like the the these games they definitely changed on like how many ways you can play it, which is really cool. Definitely a lot of replay uh, replayability there. If that's your winning face, I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the constant. Yeah, he's a glorified desk clerk. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. We caught him once. We can do it again. And. Well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did, She'll make it right. She always does. We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. <laughs> Don't you fucking touch me. I hope you like the rain, 47. Miss Burnwood. How did you... I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an agent of change. Surely you understand. <laughs> Alrighty, continue story, Death of the Family. So there was a lot about this this mission, if I'm not wrong. There was a there was a whole ton of uh, news about this story. So this should be interesting because there was a there was a whole lot of stuff going on in terms of uh, 
gaming media was talking about this quite a bit. Death in the family. Uh, we can replan, replan missions here. Oh, we're gonna go. We're gonna go right in there. Sweet. Oh, I love these games. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. True. Holy shit. Man speaking truths. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? How are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? <laughs> I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlisle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house. Meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. It began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the Constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Confused. Did, did I miss something here? Because um, okay, I am going in the correct order here. Okay, cool. Okay, I just want—I really did want to make sure because that oh, that seems so jarring. I like how I went from the Middle East to here. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, <clears throat> unlimited saves. So we're definitely gonna go onto the hardest difficulties once I once I kind of get the get a good feel of it. Um, I'm very proud to say that back in the day, uh, that's one of the few games that I completely maxed out on the 360. Was Blood Money. I think I had every single achievement you could have had in it, and um, uh, yeah, it was, it was such a good game that I just replayed it, replayed it, replayed it every single difficulty you could. The Revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, 
are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. <sighs> Alrighty. Holy smokes, look how big this building is. It's huge. Okay, so we already have the first thing here. Which is way over there. Behind the case. This is a private area. Phineas Whipper, private investigator. I have an appointment with Madame Carlyle. Please wait. Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madame Carlyle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carlyle this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. A famous private investigator summoned by Alexa Carlyle has arrived at Thornbridge Manor. If you take his place, it may be an opportunity to get close to Madame Carlyle. Definitely gonna do it. You know I am. It's not gonna be easy though. There's there's plenty of people around. Mr. Whitmer, thank God you're here. Can I take you to Madame Carlyle? Please do. If you'd follow me. I know I oughtn't say anything, but I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's just so strange. Preparing for Madame's funeral, and then she turns up alive. But then the awful business with her brother Zachary. And, and all this security. I've never seen a place guarded like this, and, and, and I dare say I don't like it at all. Oh, by the way, I told Kate about those texts. What did she say? Well, I thought she'd be mad at me, but she just thanked me. Said she understood the position I was in. Uh, we had a really good talk about it, actually. Now, what did I tell you? She's a sensible woman. And that stuff from your ex was like manipulation 101. I know, I know. I guess I thought she was gonna read into them and freak out. And say I must have done something to provoke her. Shit, man. Caroline really did a number on you. Wait. Those two people are talking about two routes to get inside on the scene. spot for him. A good spot.
There's an enforcer. Listen here, pal. I'm sorry, but you're not getting through. You say that, but I will. Where's the fan? I like to pry the dust off the thing. Have a call out of the fan. Maybe start in the city. If you'll follow me. Try me, sir. That sounds interesting. It's like planting seeds. Yeah, there's a lot of people here. Not hugely safe. Self-controlled and always safe. All choices of murder would benefit from it. Wouldn't you say? I would know, I'm afraid. If that is all, sir, please do come and find me in the most unexpected crisis. Just one question. Is there burned leather behind the curtain? Unusual. Stay Damn. Strong boy. <laughs> this car battery that's definitely it's definitely something for something <clears throat> no, oh I fucked up <laughs> how do I not see him sitting right there I feel so dumb Makes me feel so dumb when I don't see something like, oh god, okay. Anyways, at least I know I'm not that far, so that's the good thing. <laughs> oh goodness. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's try it again. <laughs> Remember, guys, functionally blind I am. There we go. Oh my goodness gracious. It's not going to stay off. Uh. <laughs> I got like so excited. I'm like, oh, he's by himself, dude. Guy's looking right at me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Functionally blind. Okay, well, I did see him walk over, he was trying to walk over this way, so let's see what happens. Uh, where did he go? There he is. <laughs> Look how many people were, like, looking at me. There was actually two. There was actually two of them.
Just wait a few days. I'm sure it'll sort itself out. You have strong feelings, Dorcas Manor. I beg your pardon. An unusual connection to the place, even though you married into the family. I do not. I mean, it is my husband's ancestral grounds. Of course I care, but what are you insinuating? Just an observation. All right, Tally out. Hey, Anon, how you doing, brother? Welcome to the stream again. Yes, walk this way. Gosh dang it. Do you think, do you think he'll go for it? Looks like he, he doesn't care much for the ghost vacuum. See where's it going to? There, yeah. I picked it up. Uh, I picked it up last night, um, right after the stream, and uh, and I ended up uh, downloading it for today. Splendid dynamics between the two, loaded with conflict, unsaid fears and desires. I could just stand. Oh, I can see immediately how this is going to go. Okay. Let's, like, let's keep that running. Yeah, man, like... And it's it's pretty good so far. You, you haven't missed too much of the stream yet. Um... I did not get the opportunity to play the first two in this arc of the story for the, the game. So, Madame Carlyle wants a picture taken. If you were to assist with the missing fuse, I'm sure the portrait would be one for the ages. But um, I'm, I'm still well aware of the storyline and everything. And yeah, this is this is great to actually finally get to play, play Hitman again. The game looks wonderful too. Got it. Finally. Finally got this guy to a spot, okay. If you're dressed like a Detective 47, you might as well act the detective. I suggest you go talk to the butler. There we go. <laughs> Agent 47 PI. Butler, you say? Oh, I see. Only saw the introductory mission for the first one. I see. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good so far. I'm really liking it. You know what? I have I have my uh, I have my detective's uniform now, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do that. <laughs> no, he's still investigating the distraction. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 This dude's right here, though. You could try. Rosie told me Rebecca has a really cool saying, though. It takes a damn fine man to replace no man at all. So, you've got your work cut out for you if you do try. 
Oh, sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to imply that you're not fine. You're definitely fine. I mean, I, I don't fancy you or anything. You're not my type at all. Oh, Christ, I'll... <laughs> Let's see. I'm fairly confident that person can see what I'm doing, though. Same with this one. Maybe not. Oh, I did not want to do that. Wrong, wrong button press there. Wrong button press, that's my bad. I don't want to actually kill anybody that I don't need to kill. It's my bad. My B. So, you've got your work cut out for you if you do try. Oh, sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to imply that you're not fine. You're definitely fine. I mean, I, I don't <laughs> fancy you or anything. You're not my type at all. Oh, Christ, I'll just shut up. They definitely got the mannerisms right for everything. For like English speakers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's try that again. Let's try that again. Let's go ahead and da 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 We're gonna go ahead and drag him over here first. All right. This is perfect. And then I have my uh, now I have the uh, perfect. Now I also have my detective's uniform right there that I can use. Find a fuse cell. Easy enough. I have a whole bunch of costumes now, which is perfect. Or disguises, not costumes, jeez. Disguises. Look how hipster I look. <laughs> yes, I do believe it's a fine day to take a, a photograph here in England. As you can see, it is the typical ugly rainy weather as we usually have. <laughs> At least over there looks gorgeous. I need a crowbar. Mm, okay. I need a crowbar. So, I wonder where is... Oh, wait a minute. Do we get lucky with a crowbar being right here? A shovel here. Crayon oil like missing wrench. I would assume that this great big mansion would have uh, would definitely have a uh, some sort of maintenance garage. Oh, hello, hello, gents. Hmm. Okay. Uh, that looks like a greenhouse, sir. Maybe the greenhouse. So let's walk towards the greenhouse, maybe. It's also very possible there's a crowbar just lying around randomly too. So I'll try to keep my eyes peeled as we're going along here. Uh, yeah, I know I'm a huge fan of like the Hitman series. It's probably in my top top five, I would say, for uh, my favorite series. Um, huge fan, massive fan of the Blood Money uh, game. Oh, here we go. This is promising. Yes, sure. But he, he was upset believing his sister was dead. I'd say worried about how things would be handled with Gregory and Emma taking over. I said they let him stay here, but Ethel was sure Emma would throw him out. I guess there was something where you dumped the body. Oh, was it really? Oh, I think I, I think I know what you're talking about. Uh, was it like a rake or a shovel of some sorts? Let's see. 
I think I know what you're talking about, though. Um... Yes, I see there was the fuse box right here that I was missing. And right around the corner here, because I did see something as well. What is this? Uh, blend in as a gardener. Oh, I see, I see, okay. It was like a blending thing. Wait, what is this? Ooh, some shears? That would be pretty deadly. Alrighty, let's get over there. Let's grab our fuse. That's the wrong button. Okay, here we go. I thought it might be the crowbar. Yeah, you know what, bro? Uh, <laughs> it's it's definitely one of those things where like, I I have done that so many times in Hitman games where it's like, where is the item? And then I'll I'll walk right past where I actually just did the objective, and it's like, after like a, an hour, <laughs> like looking like, where the heck is these items? And then it's like right there. It's like, oh man. <laughs> there we go. So definitely. Definitely, I know that. I know that feel. Um, I remember actually uh, playing the uh, playing Hitman Blood Money. Um, I think it's the first mission. There was like a way you could um, kind of like trigger trigger an event, but my goodness, I was so blind to actually how to do it that it was literally just like a little lever that was against one wall. And uh, it, honestly, going back going back and restarting the mission. It was achieved within like the first like minute. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Hello, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Alrighty, and you life. must have quite the portfolio. The Perfect. I'll call the family down now then. Excellent, 47. Madame Carlyle is on her way down for the family photo shoot. Let's see if any memorable moments will play out in front of the camera. You know how lucky it is that I actually had the screwdriver already? There's one right here, but that's pretty funny. goodness okay wait <laughs> will this accidentally kill a bunch of people in what's supposed to kill let's see oh boy <laughs> that would be too funny yes gentlemen and ladies go down below <laughs> edward you can't let mother get to you like this you always be mean to her how do you do it I'm the youngest. Oh yeah, there's tons of them. Oh yeah. Radar when it came to her attention. I don't think so. She really respects you. If you just stopped craving for approval, Oops. you're nearly fifty, Edward. I know. I'm such a little girl. But you're not. You're a professor. You're artistic. You've got your music. I mean, that's really something. Oh my goodness, is that her? Oh, this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> to see to today i'll do my best that is alexa carlisle unofficial leader of the providence partners and last one to be alive listen everyone i understand that you have a lot of questions please 
be patient for a little longer. I will address you in the sitting room afterwards. Right, get in position. Oh, especially Hitman 2 in this one. I didn't get the chance to play Hitman 2. Unless you're talking about the original Hitman 2, like the really old school one. I played a lot of that back in the day. But the uh, number 2 of this I didn't get to play. But apparently there's a pack for this game where you can play all, all three of them. Idiot, Gregory. I'm fine, Rebecca. Fine? You look like a nose wreck. Stop flickering. Well, Mother, you certainly know how to lighten the mood. This guy's looked terrible. Could we have one more? We're having such a jolly good time, aren't we? Just take the picture we don't have all day. That will be enough. No need to spend the entire day there. Please, everybody, go to the sitting room. Mm. I need to speak to you. I want to stress that I expect absolute discretion about everything you've Would you like some help writing no the eulogy? No one ever know I was here. I can draw oh. something up in 15 minutes. Are you coming, Mummy? I, I just can't. need some fresh air. I bet I you. I bet you. I bet you I needed the car battery or something for this, didn't I? Gregory is going out of his way to shock Mother with his laziness and neglect. Hmm. And you self-destruct and you are... Because I thought for sure that was going to be the killer blow right there. Anyways. Go ahead and grab my detective's uniform that I have over here. That I got so neatly stashed away, and we can go that route. I bet you, yeah, there must have been something I had I had missed right there to kill that person right off the hop. But uh, let's go ahead and disguise as private investigator. Where the hell are you wearing rubber goes, my dude? <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Okay, um, I believe I gotta go speak to the butler, don't I? I'm gonna go ask Jeeves real quick. Holy smokes, do you guys remember Ask Jeeves? That used to be like a website for like, it was like a Google website that was like really awful. <laughs> okay, I know she's right there, but I think I actually do have to speak to the butler properly first, don't I? Where did he go? Mr. Butler. Mm, maybe not. Right. Let's get started. I want to keep this short. I know you have a lot of questions. Wait. Some I will what is going now. On? The rest will have to wait. First, Zachary's sudden death is a great tragedy, but also a great inconvenience, as it happened just now. I'm dealing with the situation in a discreet and efficient way, and I expect your cooperation in all related matters. Second. The arranged funeral right, isn't it? will take place as planned. It looks cool. No one can what is a little troll bee hat? <laughs> still alive. I expect you all to act your part. Last, as you all know, I have a lot on my plate and need to focus on sorting everything out. So please do not disturb me with your petty concerns. You are all adults, and as part of the elite, you will eventually have to deal with difficult situations like this. It comes late for most of you, but this is a chance for you to show what you are made of. That will be all. Ah, uh, yeah, I do have to speak to the butler because, yeah, I, I, I can't just talk to her. No, it's not him. Where was the original butler? I, I think maybe he's in the front here. Let's see. Uh, let's go over here. Is this him? Hello. Mr. Whitmer, are you ready to inspect the crime scene now? I am. Very well. If you'll follow me, sir. Yeah, it's quite right, so. Oh, I always thought like the English butlers, like this type of uniform, super cool. Always very, very clean. I feel clean. obliged to point out that current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. 
You'll probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Madam's children were not informed until this morning that their mother was in fact not dead at all. So please bear with me if they seem affected by the rather unusual situation. I trust I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madam Carlyle is still alive. I'll consider her dead when I leave. There we go. That's so funny. Yeah, I'll consider him. <laughs> consider him dead. The case concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was found dead in his bed this morning. You know, there's a University of Butlers to get trained there. <laughs> that's 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 awesome. <laughs> that's so awesome. That just reminds me of like the university for like Santa Clauses, <laughs> where people try to become Santa Claus. Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> I know. I wonder how much a butler gets paid. They probably get paid quite handsomely. Suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. I've prepared some information for you, so please do come and see me when you've finished your investigation of the crime scene. This is Mr. Zachary's room, to my right. Isn't it funny how he does not recognize the fact that I don't look like the other dude anymore? <laughs> A locked room murder mystery 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. Why do I have a feeling it was probably the mother that actually killed him? Am I using my instincts in this room? Oh, there's, there's plants that can knock in. Oh. Could sit down for some reason. Why don't you use your camera to scan the dip? Thank you for the heads up, because I would have not Body thought of that. Throat markings indicate a rare, short lived plant poison killed him. Spread shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. <laughs> Whiskey bottle and oh, whiskey glass and bottle found in Zachary Cross's bedside table. Okay. The fire is still going though. We sure liked his booze. Is there anything I might be missing here? My goodness, there's a lot of liquor in here. Oh, what's this? Let's see. Do, 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 do. Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. It is wellies. Uh, as a Portuguese man, I respect having this inside of a room. Very nice. I have, I actually have like a wooden one of this. Much more simpler, but pretty much the same. Plenty of greenery, isn't there? Wait, what was that? A walk. A hidden door. It's a secret passage. This could explain how the door was locked from the inside. What's that? There's a peephole. Wait, why? Wait a minute. Hmm. 
Hmm, okay. Interesting. I have always been fascinated by buildings that have hidden corridors. Very cool stuff. Like hidden doors, like the bookcase door thing that always very cool. Oh, what the freaking hell? Oh, dude. Oh, there's a the magic floor plan. Hmm. A photocopy of the floor plans. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. Well, thank you so much for coming on through. Thank you for watching. I hope you were. In, I hope you enjoyed the stream. Um, so, where does this lead to? You've likely not exhausted the room for clues, forty-seven. Interesting. Let's see. Am I missing? Well, let's see. Let's go back in there. Very, very interesting. Hmm. I'm missing one clue. Okay. One clue is all I need. I wonder what it could be, though. Oh, what's this? Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, hello. Zachary's suicide note. Also, a sample of handwriting. It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish its authenticity. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene, 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Alrighty, let's see. My bad, my bad. Goodness, I wonder where he went to then. Hey, how are you? Good, man. Ray through the eye. Ray through the eye hole. The lady speaking to Agent Forty Seven. Also have a British accent. I do f I find it quite interesting all the different accents that the British do have. It's very very interesting. It's because depending on where you're in that country, it's, it varies wildly on uh, on how people talk. Ah, uh, mysterious switch is right there. There we go. Okay, cool. <laughs> I knew was about to walk right past him. He's probably went back downstairs, didn't he? She is right there. Oh, you're not the butler. Where did my butler friend go to? 
Well, Amiya wants connection to the server again. If you see like weird jittery or uh, like kind of looks like lag, it um, it's connected to them, uh, to the whole server thing that this game has going on for it. I guess the game always has to be online. And oddly enough, I've had it where it's lost connection before, and there's like this weird stuttering that'll happen. You're awesome at the butler. I'm gonna question him. Am I am I missing where he was? Was he still on the same floor? Because I, I may have actually missed where the uh, butler went to. Because it's not giving me an indication. Uh, maybe, maybe. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Where did you come from? Hey. <laughs> there you are. All right. <laughs> what the fuck? No, come back here. Mr. Fernsby, I'm done with the crime scene. Did you establish a time of death? Zachary died around 10 o'clock last night. Well, that means the staff were off duty. And Madame Carlyle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. That leaves Madam's family and myself as the only persons here when he died. And before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time of death. Here is the material that I prepared for you. It's a list of the possible suspects and their quarters. Hopefully that will help you keep track of your findings. Please come and see me when you've solved the case, and I will take you to Madam Carlyle. This is very useful information, 47. Oh my goodness. I actually have to like question Interesting. Okay, well, you know what? So how does one solve a murder mystery, 47? Motive means an opportunity, I believe. May I suggest you ask the suspects for alibis? Yes. Or perhaps you prefer searching the manor for clues first? How did this go from being Hitman to L.A. Noir very quickly? <laughs> very cool. Hello. Gregory Carlyle, can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? You're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Well, um, I left Thornbridge around half eight for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Quiz night at the inn. On the other hand, staying here with Zachary, my obnoxious sister, and a wife sporting another one of her headaches would have been a fate worse than death. <laughs> uh, the, the short of it, Zachary was very much alive when we left. I stayed for the last shout, and I was back here just before midnight. Anything else you want to pry from my intricate intellect? No. <laughs> Who's been at the pub with Edward at the time of Zachary's death? You know, to escape Emma's headache. An obnoxious sister, Rebecca. Okay. Oh boy, now I gotta go search for these people. They're probably all within the mansion, but I'm not gonna go find them. Literally, the person I need to kill is right here. Oh, there she is. Phil, did you find out that the vote was notarized? But how the hell did that happen? Nope. We all signed it. I gave it to him in person. Bro. Bro. 100%. 100%. Let's save. <laughs> he says he got it notarized the very 100%. You're, you're right on the money on that. <laughs> Cheryl. She's the best they've got. Tell her you want to see the records. Don't take no for an answer. And call me as soon as you've got them. Thanks, Phil. We'll get to the bottom of this. Okay, one moment here, guys. Just let me do a quick check. Hey, there we go. Uh, I'm 
not very good with Chinese. Tang? Oh, I have saved. Rebecca Carla, can you tell me about yesterday evening? We don't really see much of each other, my brothers and I. I suppose it takes our mother's funeral to bring us together, and even then, it's not like we sit on each other's laps. Now, let's see. Patrick, Gregory's son, disappeared straight after dinner. You know, I think he might be in some sort of trouble. Edward wanted to go as well, but Gregory convinced him to stay for a few drinks before they went off for a pint at the local at a quarter to nine. I swear Gregory enjoys Edward's discomfort over staying here. I had a conference call with my New York office at nine, so I spent three hours on my laptop in my room and went straight to bed afterwards. I don't know about Emma. She did act a bit strange. You know, I bet she was making a list for changes needing to be done once she gets her hands on Thornbridge Manor. Quite the shock she had when Mother arrived during breakfast. Is that everything, Mr. Whitmer? I do have a lot to see to. Tell me about Zachary. Did he act strange last night? You know, now you mention it, he was a lot more chatty than usual. He wanted to know about my connections in the publishing business. Apparently, a friend of his is writing a book, which strikes me as very peculiar. I didn't think he had any friends. Is there anything else you want to ask him? Anything else you feel like mentioning? I may be wrong, but I saw Mr. Fernsby, the butler, leave Zachary's room early this afternoon. And he seemed a bit startled when he saw me in the hallway. It's probably nothing. Oh, and one more thing. Mm. Please be kind to Edward. He can only take so much. This one's being weird, and this one. Let me speak to that guy again. I did not realize I can continue questioning. Let's try him. Hey. Tell me about Zachary. Zach? Huh. Such a sad old sod. A bit heavy on the bottle. Yeah. <laughs> don't blame him. Only company he had was his rare plants and mother, who travels more than she stays here. Honestly, I can't say which is the bigger ball. He's better off dead. Is that all? Not very thorough, are you? Anything else you'd like to tell me? Nothing, really. I'm just enjoying the show. Our perfect mother obviously fucked up, didn't she? <laughs> Faking her own death. You know, she's explained nothing to us. I think she's scared to own up to her own mistake. His music is about his apparent mistakes and describes himself as enjoying the show. Interesting. Okay. Gotta find the other ones now. What do they look like again? Uh, doo -doo -doo. Edward looks like the, the man with the mustache. Shades, and then this person. Okay. Let us look around. I'll play the piano. Let's go. <laughs> Professor Edward Carlyle, can you tell me your whereabouts for last night? Oh, yes. This dreadful business with Zachary. I stay at the local inn. You see, I prefer not to spend the night here at Thornbridge Manor. My brother Gregory came along for a nightcap. He would never admit it. I think he understands that I find this whole thing upsetting and wanted to provide some comfort. I believe we went to the Stag's Head around half past eight. If that's all, I have a speech to write. Can you tell me about Zachary's behavior last night? I certainly didn't expect him to commit suicide. Sure, he was upset by mother's supposed death. You were. But he seemed more engaged than usual. You should ask Rebecca. They had a long talk. 
Did you know that he hadn't left Thornbridge Manor in nearly 50 years? Jesus. His plants, mother, and the staff were all the company he had. Anything else I can do to help? Did you notice anything else out of the ordinary? You mean apart from the fact that we came here to bury our mother and she shows up alive and kicking? Zachary found dead in his bed this morning? Or perhaps that the planned funeral is still taking place and I have to do the eulogy? My mother will surely have strong opinion on it. Okay. A long talk. That was that, so that checks out. Interesting, so these these two are maxed out already. Wait a minute. So, if I go back, let me go question the, the other two. Let me go find them. I'm going to go back to her afterwards. Mm. This place is massive. Okay. May I add that the undertaker, I Mr. Faust, is not as just as bad as on a pretend funeral. A He's worried about his reputation if it gets out. Yes, I expected as much. But he was such a gentleman. He gave us his coat we'll and all. Rosie, it's you need to forget to question, about Madame Patrick. Charlotte. No, no good's gonna no. come of it. Stick to your That's own kind. Oh, you mean like Chris? He treated me like shit. All he wanted to do was play his stupid video games. Never any romance. I deserve romance. Hello. Rosie, tell me what you did last night. I'm in trouble, aren't I? I... I spent the evening with Patrick. We met after dinner and I went home at one in the morning. He said he needed someone real to talk to. When he looks at you, it makes you feel like the center of the universe. Like a real princess. But now, he just ignores her. Well, he's under a lot of pressure. He's an idiot. That's what he <laughs> is. Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? Any strangers outside the house? No. No, we saw no one outside. Except Patrick's mother, Emma. We were sitting on the bench behind the greenhouse talking when she came out and uh, we had to hide. You won't tell her about me and Patrick, will you? She'd insist Madame Carlyle fire me. I'm sure of it. Do right, she will. She's always going on about how things will change once she's in charge of Thornbridge Manor. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's interesting. Alibi has been confirmed already. Emma and you. Rebecca as well. I'm going to go back to Rebecca. Let's see. How are things coming along inside? Is everything ready for tomorrow? That is the door to Mr. Fernsby's office. It's a bloody saber sitting here. Awesome. Dead body before. Life can be tough sometimes. And that detective asked to come here. Madame Carlyle must believe Zachary was murdered. Why else ask him to snoop around? I feel weak in my knees from all this tension here. Don't worry, I'm sure everything will settle down. Okay. The last gossip Too bad I don't have a lockpick. On me right now. There's like a room right here, and it's too bad I can't get into it as well. I'm looking at the floor plan, and it looks like there's no secret way to get in there either. Dang. I'll keep an eye out for a lockpick. There might be one just hanging around. 
Um, oh, there it goes again. It's getting stuttery. Must be the internet connection again. Let's see. Another way to get upstairs from here. These are the bathrooms. What's this room? I've been talking to Madame Carlyle's daughter. Rebecca? Yes. She's insistent, that one. She kept asking all kinds of questions. Who had the other one? Why I gave it to her, that sort of thing. You did make sure she didn't see you give the other one to the butler. Oh, of course. Tokens for Rebecca and Mr. Frisbee. According to the bodyguards, Rebecca, Carousel, and Mr. Frisbee, the butler, have each been given a token. Uh, you combine the tokens, grant access to deposit boxes. Whoever holds the set, this deposit from the box may very well contain a copy of the case file on Arthur Edwards. Really? Really? Huh. So how do we gain access to that then? Okay, let me go let me go question her again. This is so interesting how this game just transformed into something completely different. Oh my god, this guy. Oh my god. <laughs> you. Patrick Carlisle. Can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Oh shit. It's that sneaky butler, isn't it? He ratted me out. Don't tell mother, okay? She's really tense these days, and the last thing I need is more hassle. I took that pretty blonde, um, Rosie, uh, for an evening stroll. I mean, how the fuck am I expected to cope for an entire weekend in this shithole? I'm bored out of my mind. If that's all, I think I'll get back to my slow death by boredom. What did you think of Zachary? <laughs> Creepy as hell. No ambition. Imagine deciding to live in a museum. You know, father says Zachary and Alexa used to be two of a kind. He had a great future ahead of him. Then suddenly, he just gave up everything. What an idiot. Thank God daddy chose looks and brains over pedigree when he married mummy. I don't have to worry about the inbreedings her customers in these circles. <laughs> so, is that it? Did you see anything suspicious last night? No. I reckon Zachary topped himself. I know I would have. Or perhaps Mr. Fernsby. I don't like him. He could have done it. Interesting. Wait, why won't it let me talk to her again? Wait, what? Yeah, I gotta find her. She's super suspicious already. Yeah, it's weird. Well, let me actually uh, speak to her. Whoa, stuttering is all hell. You're in trouble, aren't you, Patrick? No, I'm not. I can smell it. You know, you don't have to be like your father. You can do something real. With okay, whatever. It. That's obviously a little bugged at the moment. Let's, let's continue on. I wonder where the other one is, though. I'm, I think I've been all over the. Um, I'm quite sure I've been all over the bottom floor now. I don't think I've seen her. Okay, she's right there. Where in the world? Interesting. That was weird. Perhaps, perhaps she is upstairs. Hmm. This building is quite large, so and I don't think my instincts allow me to find anything, does it? 
Let me see a woman figure right here. Let's try this. Maybe, maybe, possibly. Things like that. I bet you've worked with a lot of high profile celebrities. I should get back to my. Right. Oh, ho, 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 flurry, flurry. Hey, Rebecca. Do you see this about old Wompy? He is handsome. Where the fuck is she? I'm actually quite confused. I saw. I don't think my readers care much about pictures of this shit. Oh, you're such a bore. Oh, no. There is another floor above me. Okay, I see. It looks like just security guards up there. Hmm. Looking good, man. Looking good. I am quite confused on to where um uh where Rebecca went to. Hey hey Tang, I'm not sure why, but your messages keep getting redacted for some reason. I'm not sure. Peace. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm not sure why um keeps redacting your messages. I am actually genuinely confused on to where um where Emma is right now. Like genuinely speaking, I do not know where she went to. Hmm. I sure hope this is not a situation where she was in front of me to begin with. Okay, there she is again, the old school lady. Hmm. Perhaps she went outside? So he's by himself again. Uh, maids over there. Strange, maybe she is outside. right now on where that uh, character went to. Oh, there she is. Oh my god. Yeah, come outside. <laughs> Does that make any sense? There she, oh my goodness. There we go. Oh, it's so strange that she was like the only one like all by herself. Okay, hey, here. Carla, can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Surely I'm not a suspect. You are? I need to account for everyone. Well, I spent the evening with my family, but I got an awful migraine and had to take to bed. Everyone can attest to that. I believe I went up when the boys sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. Anything else you want to know? How did you feel about Zachary? I might as well be honest. His presence was always I will always never again awkward. meet someone like Zachary. But how do you have I a meaningful conversation with a man who only cares plants. about plants? Come on, Oliver. In my opinion, Alexa bears some responsibility for how this ended. It's such a shock to all she of us. She supported his self-limiting behavior by letting him live here. Is that all? Have you noticed anything else out of the ordinary? Nothing special comes to mind. Except, perhaps, I did get a feeling that Zachary was depressed, not just sad. I suppose he realized that he had no one with Alexa gone. Even Alexa must feel the pangs of guilt over that one, letting him believe she was Very, dead. Very uh, accusatory. Then again, guilt isn't her strong suit.
Hmm. Okay, let me see if I can talk to her again. Very strange. Oh man, I really want to get into that office. I might do a save. I might do a save and um, break the door. And hopefully that won't get anybody to uh, get suspicious. Because we got to check out that laptop. I feel like there might, uh, might be some useful information there. It just occurs to me with this whole mission format, why doesn't Eidos actually do like a detective game? That'd be pretty good. Very, very weird that I can't talk to her again. Very strange because when I was talking to Patrick, it was uh, allowing me to do it. Oh, anyways. Okay, time to go to his office. And I will save prior to doing it, because, man, that computer. That computer makes me think. Uh, was it this way, right? Wait. Yeah, just do it, right? <laughs> Nothing to see here, boys. <laughs> the office that Mr. Fever uses is acceptable to storage. Okay. Last written. The handwriting does not match Zachary Carswell's suicide note. Okay, that's good to know. Whoa. Zachary's diary. This is big. It's huge. He was about to confess to the world that he and Alexa murdered their older brother Montgomery 46 years ago. And apparently, Mr. Fernsby helped make the murder look like an accident. And 47, the handwriting doesn't match the suicide letter in his room, proving he didn't write it himself. What's this? Painkiller. Lethal if you use enough of them. But not the poison used to kill Zachary. Of course, Madame Carlyle doesn't know that. Are you considering to frame the butler, 47? Mr. Fernsby clearly didn't commit the murder, but I think you have enough evidence to convince Madame Carlyle he did. Maybe you should tell him you are ready to present your findings. Unless, of course, you want to do some more detecting, 47. Look at that. Master key. We got the master key, boys. <laughs> oh, it was a good thing you told me just to break it, man. I had a, I would have been, I would have been kind of lost for a bit here. So, with that being said, okay, so I have the master key, and the only place I have not searched in this house is the very, very top floor. So, let us get up there. Oh, what an interesting format for a Hitman um, mission. That is the door to Rebecca's room. 
Rebecca is which one again? Oh goodness, gotta get used to these controls. That's Rebecca. Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. to midnight last night. So that would technically clear her. Oh, there is one more clue, though. Look at the stuttering. I don't know why it does that. From time to time, the, the game just starts stuttering like that. I don't know if that is a connection issue or not now. Is that considered clue? Probably not, right? No, it isn't. Venture. So where does this look out to? Ron and I haven't been briefed about shit. What the fuck do I say to Carlisle? I feel completely blindsided here. I have no idea what's going on. It's it's all gone. No, she's calm as ice. It's just not natural. Nobody's that calm. It's gonna end in murder, I'm telling you. And this way, what does this look out towards? There's a little room around the corner from this bedroom. Okay, uh, do do do. Let's go ahead and open that again. Open it up. <laughs> Let me take a selfie. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything that I can interact with, though. Unless I'm, like, super... What's this? Can I, can I interact with that now? Hmm. Huh, weird. Like, how strange is that? Like, we're in the room. That's interesting. But I'm assuming that this would just be another way to get in, right? Yeah, there's nothing like this. Hmm, I'm actually kind of stumped with this room right now. Probably best to move on and then maybe come back afterwards, because, like, I don't know why. I, I do not see anything that I can um, interact with here. It's probably it's probably like looking looking at me straight in the face and I just can't see it. Is there anything else on this thing other than this laptop? Man, I don't get it. Let's see. There was this little room that that peephole was looking through. That's creepy. That's creepy. 
Oh god, that's gross. Ugh. Gross. People into the washroom. That's pretty nasty. Okay, that room's a security room. The other room over there, that's just the bedroom slash balcony. So, I believe we gotta go up, I think. There is this area right here that's overlooking that library, so I can give that a quick peek. But I don't think we're gonna find anything there. Yeah, this is, this is nothing, right? Yeah, this is nothing. Wait a minute, what's this? Dump missing propane fly. What the fuck? Okay, that must be that must be another way to um, kill. That American lawyer in the small office. Did you check his travel documents? Everything's in order. Okay, well let's go to uh, let's go to the. Uh... Oh, you're saying no? There is something there. Should I go back? Hey, Foxy Girl, welcome to the chat. Hope you're doing well. That's a, that's a letter opener. Um, as mentioned, Steph, um, I don't see anything I can interact with. Other than that, though, there's like the propane tank, but. I don't know if your no was maybe to something else. I actually don't know um, where the uh, uh, how how bad the stream delay is because sometimes the stream delay is not too bad, but other times it's uh, it's it's pretty bad. So, uh, what game are you playing today? I am playing Hitman Three. Um, this is the latest game in the Hitman series. One of my all-time favorites. Uh, all all the all the games are fantastic. Massive fan. This is a restricted area, and I can't let you through. Oh, I can't go up there. Really? I can't go up there. Hmm. Weird. But I want to go up there. And I will get up there. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry, Tang, if you're telling me if you're telling me something that I should know, definitely definitely type it in there if you can, bro. A safe in Madame Carla's office. I bet that's where she keeps the file on Arthur Edwards. There's a dude already, like, right here. Wait. Wait a minute. Is he the only person in this room? Oh, man, I might have just... I might have just got lucky.
me drag his body. Put it over here. Boom. <laughs> Pick up my, my handy dandy crowbar. <laughs> All right. There is a hidden safe behind a painting. Which painting would it be? There are many a painting here. This one, right? Wait, what the heck? Peculiar icons about the safe. Yeah, I eh? okay. There might be some sort of a code. Maybe have a look around the office, 47. One. By the way, I have short-term memory, guys, so I will have to go back. Next thing was the periscope, so we got one. Where is the uh, telescope in this room? One nine. Okay, so one nine. One nine seven. And what was the last? What was that last one? The moose, moose head. One nine seven. One nine seven five. We got one of them because there's another one too is there not work 47 that's the file on arthur edwards secured time to take care of madame carlisle easy enough so i got that one that's for the other task i guess but at least i got that done let's do that boom put this on All right Save, yeah, 100%, definitely. Uh, let's go to uh, save. Um, we're going to do this. Yes, sir. It's going to be interesting, though, when I go to play this game afterwards and I'm going to do it on the hardest difficulty. Oh, 
Honestly, it's her. It has to be her. I don't think it was the... Butler had a hand in this, but... Talk about real family affairs. How's it going with that love life of yours? Still rocking the spinster lifestyle. <laughs> spinster lifestyle. Now, sit down. Oh, I love, I love that. You know, real cock up it was, yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh yeah, let's go speak to Mr. Butler. Man, I want railings with freaking light bulbs in them. That's freaking sick. Looks so good. So he's probably over here, isn't he? This is all the groceries arrived. I heard some of the delivery people were unhappy with the security at the gate. But there you are. She's safe with Ethel. She never I'm ready a step. to present my conclusion to Madame Carl. Both. Very well. If you'll follow me, sir. Zachary found dead upstairs today. Death is everywhere. I never thought of it that way. Oh, God. It's such a big responsibility having a baby. <laughs> I never did really understood, though, the whole... I mean, like, old school... Why is that... Look, that looks like Franz Ferdinand, man. I guess. <laughs> um, never understood, like, all the paintings. I think that's creepy, like, all the paintings and stuff. Now very, very creepy. Something. Let's see. I'll kill the people. I'm definitely going to be killing the, uh... I'm gonna be definitely going to be killing uh, the main suspect here. Or not the suspect, but the uh, main objective. Oh, it's most dark up here. Hi. Ooh, I like the uh, the coding very well in this game to now allow me to be up here. Very, very nice. This is Madame Carlyle's office. Please step inside. You talking about this one, Matt? Mm, fuck off. There we go. <laughs> There's just a gun here. Let me go ahead and pick that up. So it's not just sitting around. Safe. Oh shit. What is happening here? Somebody has taken the case file. So, Mr. Whitmer, you've reached a conclusion. Take a seat. Please, go ahead. Oh, it doesn't let me accuse Emma, though. What the fuck? What did I miss here? I guarantee it's her. He's a viable suspect, but I guarantee you it's her. I must be missing something within this. Uh, I have to be missing something here. Yeah, guaranteed. Guaranteed, I am missing something here. Because I know, I know for a fact, it has to be, it has to be, um, her. She's the one, the reason why I think it's her is that she's the one that has the most to gain from, uh, from him dying. That's the reason why. The, uh, butler, the butler for sure had a part to do with it, but I guarantee you, it has to actually do with uh it has to do with Emma. She's the only one that, that benefits from him dying. Nobody else does. 
Like I took I took investigations in real life for like three years, and I can guarantee you, like if the game was programmed correctly, it has to be that I must be missing something that would be um, uh, pointing directly to her. I must be. So now I gotta now I gotta figure it out. Um, It is funny though, I did take investigations for uh, three years, but I was not able to actually get a job in investigations, unfortunately. That's the only unfortunate thing about that. But if you have the opportunity to take investigations as a, uh, as a course over a period of, a good course by the way, um, it is incredibly useful um, for, any, for anything. Um, if you take investigations, you can actually learn when somebody's lying to you, right off the hop. A person talking to you, you'll know without them telling you that they're lying to you. Um, it is a very interesting trait to actually have in real life. And I have called out so many people in real life when they uh, when they ended up lying straight to me. And um, especially since I had ended up working security for so many years, it is incredible how many people you just get dumbfounded by the fact that I know. <laughs> like just off the hop, like, yeah, you're lying. <laughs> Why is this room like bugging out? There is there's something so strange about this. Like why can't I There has to be something that I'm missing in this room. And I don't see anything I can interact with. But it must be maybe the camera, perhaps. Maybe I'm missing something with the camera here. Maybe all this crap on the ground, maybe. Oh here we go. Hey blah, blah. Oh my god! That took forever. Uh, two clues found. Okay, so what was the other thing here? Right now, Consul's notebook was found in the bedroom. Which is saying the notes concerned assets at the board meetings as well as the night before. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, hold up. Emma and Gregory's room. The bedroom in which Emma and Gregory's room is staying is located on the middle floor of the mansion towards the... Uh, in the middle floor of the mansion towards the cemetery. Okay. How did I miss this room? Which way is the cemetery, actually? I don't even, I don't even know which way the uh, cemetery is facing in this, in this building. Oh my god, yeah, man, the feeling of actually finally finding that stupid oh, note to scan, right? God, it was, and I, I think I said it, like, what, like, half an hour ago? Like, oh, 100%, it's staring me in the face, and it was staring me in the face. Okay, so we're on this side of the building. Why did I not go into any of these bedrooms? That's a bathroom. So what's this one? That door leads to Emma and Gregory's There it is. Cool. And you know what? If I didn't break into uh, Buddy's office there, I would not be able to get into this room, so I'm very glad. Okay, so um, uh, there's four clues. What games do I play? Um, well, I was playing Cyberpunk for a very long time. Um, and then I, I, then I actually ended up uh, stopping that. Um, but I do play quite a bit. A lot, of Call of Duty, a lot of Call of Duty Cold War, for sure. I've been playing a lot of that lately. Um, Among Us, uh, from time to time, is very fun. Uh, I love playing that with subscribers. 
Um, let me see what else. What else do we got going on for the channel? Uh, pretty much anything under the sun. If anybody recommends me a game, like for the channel to play, we'll play it. If you can recommend a good game, we'll do it. Now this is interesting. Forty-seven. A letter from Emma's mother stating that Emma is the illegitimate child of Alexa's late older brother, Montgomery. And listen to this. She claims to have witnessed Alexa and Zachary murder him. The plot thickens. Interesting. Let's get into letter opener. There's nothing out here. Who has a bath just in their room? Like that's that's super different. Crappy old cell phone. Oh yeah, like I fell asleep while watching. I was pretty fun. I'm sorry, brother, if I'm if uh if I'm being boring here. I'm sorry. Like I love being thorough with games. Uh, my apologies. A keychain um, pendant for the greenhouse. What's that doing in Emma and Gregory's room, I wonder? And why is the key missing? So we gotta check the greenhouse probably too. Let's see. Anything on this side? So I believe we have probably two of the four. What's this? Pump missing propane. So once again, something to do with the propane flask. Agent 48. <laughs> Agent like 53 probably. Man, I, uh, my God. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Um, let's see, uh, camera. Let's start scanning. Starting to scan. Honestly, I can't interact with that? What's this? I remember I woke up so early. Yeah, like, it's... Uh, what time is it for you guys right now? Isn't it like... It's getting towards, like, the morning, right? Like early morning for you guys, right? Oh my god, the jitteriness is bad. Ooh, it's really starting to, to snag inside this room for some reason. It's 9 a.m. Oh, so you're almost... You are basically... Like 13 hours ahead of time for me. Hmm. But I woke up at like 4 a.m. Jeez. And don't you don't you still have to go like do school and everything today as well? Peace out, Tang. Thank you for coming on through, bro. Man, I am so, ah, I'm so lost in here. It's going to be, once again, something that's, like, staring me in the face. 
but I am going to go down to the, um, why is it jittering so bad in here? Oh my goodness. What is happening? Oh, no, it's fine. What the heck? Due to the lockdown now, attendance is not compulsory. Oh, are you doing it? Is it like an online thing now for you guys? I know, I know, like, there's a lot of people over here in Canada that have to do the same thing, too. Man, this this pandemic, man, geez, man, it's it's really has screwed up so many people's lives. The idea that you go to higher education and then you can't actually be taught by a professor is kind of, that just sucks. Like, what was the point of, you know, like doing all that hard work, right? Like, you, you saved up and you did all that to go to school and then that happens. What the fuck? Because, you know, like, online, I know, like, some people like the whole online concept. Like, that's great. Like, if you can, if you can teach your own, and then you can, like, teach yourself, I should say. And then also, you know, be able to learn the curriculum in the way, then that's great. But, you know, sometimes you do need instruction from, from professors, you know. Our handy dandy, uh, handy dandy crowbar right away here. <laughs> yeah, as, soon as, this, as soon as this dude walks away, we're gonna do it. Like, I could not imagine doing school. Like, I, I had also gone to, um, I also did, I should say, um, computer programming and computer engineering. And I could not imagine not being able to have instruction on that. So she could see that. Okay, good to know. Good to know. She was able to see that. So I'm going to go ahead and redo that. See? Yeah, like that right there. That's And it's not fair. That's not your fault either, right? Like you're, 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 you need the instruction, right? Like, and it's not just instruction. It's also the whole social dynamic of school as well. When you're with p other students, other, other pupils and everything like that, you have the advantage of being able to cross-check with other people, you know, being able to learn from each other. You subscribe the Underground DB. Is that a channel there, uh, Tang? Is that is that a channel I can sub to? Is that your channel? Definitely will. So that person can see everything we're doing right here. Oh, that kind of sucks. This guard is always right here. That person's sitting right there. I need that key. I need the key! Oh, give me one second, guys. I got a text here.
Okay, got that going on. Let's see. Excuse me, guys. Sorry about that. <coughs> Not the to top up off some water here soon. Hmm, I'm getting like frame issues. I'm not sure why. Oh my god, a unicorn horn. Oh my god, imagine killing something with that. That'd be cool. Open. Let's see. Ah, oh, man. I don't know. Like. Martin, Rebecca here. I need you to dig up the contract we have with the law firm Morf. And Yates and Cohn. No, oh, I no, man. A unanimous vote on prolonging the main street. Oh, man. Where the frick is Emma? You know what's strange? Hold up. Wait a minute, what? why don't I have that key? Yo, I just took in. Why don't I have the key? Like, it said there was the master key right there. Inside, um, the butler's on. What the heck? Uh, I'm glad I'm done with school, though. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Now that I'm thinking about it, man, school. School's rough. School's hard. Yo, like... Where... Where in the world did that key go to? Guys, am I not... Am I... Am I... Am I wrong here? But did I not grab a master key? Like, yo, I am, that blows my mind. I am so sure, unless the game just bugged out on me, I am so sure that I had a key before. Did I not? Like, I had a master key. Oh, goodness gracious. Because, think about it. Did I not use the master key to open the door to Emma and Gregory's room? Like, what happened there? Did, did it stay inside the door, like, when I opened it? Huh. Kill the pack. I'm only, uh, when I'm going through this run right now, uh, Tang, I'm only going to be killing the person that I need to kill. Um, I will be doing another run where, um, where I will definitely be going ham on everybody. That is strange. Strange and unusual. Yeah, that's that's so weird. I don't have the key anymore. After all, oh, what in the world? Now, does that make any sense? <laughs> is this an RPG game where, like, you use the key and it disappears? Like, wh what? Sir? Ma'am? <laughs> Oh, I am 
That's... Mm, I don't know if that's a bug or not. Bloody hell, could you imagine if you had... If you had your keys to your house, you use your key and it's gone. Now I gotta go find Emma again. I really hope she's over, over where I last found her. Because I need that key. I need to get in there. I guarantee you, there has to be some stuff inside there that's incriminating her. For sure. Because think about it. The guy, uh, Zachary, he got killed by an exotic um, plant, right? And that's a massive greenhouse. Please tell me she's out here still. This. Yeah, yeah, she's right there. She's right there. You. Oh, you startled me. I, I was just, I don't know, thinking about Zachary. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, come on out. Come out here. Yeah, yeah, get, get outside. <laughs> that would be a great bummer. Yeah, wouldn't it? Oh my god, could you imagine all this hard work? It's like, nope. <laughs> she is coming out, though. You. You, right here. Now no. Now Zachary won't get to see the rhododendron perigonium blossom. They were his favorites. Oh, come on, Oliver. I understand why you're so upset. It's such a shock to get all of us. I am so confused because I should be able to speak to her, right? Should I not? Like, I found that she had a missing keychain inside of her room, right? Oh, game. No. <laughs> no, game. Don't do it to me. I will never again meet someone like Zachary. I can't bear to... Oh my goodness, what is going on here? Inventory, like, what? It's right here, like. <laughs> Do you see this, right? Like, it's right here. Oh my god, I am so dumbfounded. We're, like, Hitman, open the... <laughs> search your pocket, my dude. <laughs> no. Emma Carlyle in the greenhouse. Emma Carlyle. Curious. Oh, you startled me. Okay, that worked. I, I was just, I don't know, thinking about Zachary. He spent most of his life in here with these plants. Not much of a life, is it? Anyway, I'll be outside if you need me. If you'd excuse me. <laughs> yeah, the game glitched me. Now I'm gonna glitch the game back. I'm in here now. I don't care. <laughs> lab equipment. It looks like it was recently used, though. Yeah. Wait. Like, yeah. Hello. This is a table showing lethal dosages for the poison used to kill Zachary. Something is circled, 47. Female, age 65 to 79, 60 to 64 kilograms. I'd say Madame Carlyle is next in line for a poisoning. 
You have uncovered enough evidence to tell Madame Carlyle Done. that Emma is the murderer. Done. Quite the detective, 47. I'm impressed. Done. I suggest you go tell Mr. Fernsby. Got it. Unless you think there are more secrets to uncover. There's no there's no more secrets. I know that Mr. Fernsby is a part of this whole thing. But yeah. Done. Got it. Oh man. <laughs> God told me, get out of here. <laughs> we got it. That's j oh my god, is that ever jokes? I wonder how Wicklum is doing on his on his playthrough right now. I hope it's not glitching for him like it is for me right now. Oh, uh, hopefully his stream is going okay too. <laughs> That's too funny. The reason why I think the mystery is solved is that, just from my own intuition, my own intuition here, it has to be Emma, due to every gain that she has to make from this. I The thing was, um, I don't know if you saw it last time, because uh, you may have been asleep at the time. Um, it gave me a prompt to allow me to incriminate either her or the butler, but the thing was, Emma was blanked out. It wouldn't let me. I didn't have enough evidence to do it right so that was the piece i needed to go ahead and you know um point the finger towards her so now i gotta find that stupid butler there he is i am ready to present my conclusion to madame carlyle very well if you'll follow me sir yeah because he's he's definitely had a part like he has a part to do in this as well but he was not the one that outright killed him uh the the old man was killed by poison from a plant the fact that she has still been inside that room for such a long time right uh inside the greenhouse i should say and she already has circled another person which is the uh lady that we're supposed to kill and we are going to kill her um her um yeah it all all of it makes sense like he, the only thing that the uh, butler had was poison inside of his room, but that's not the poison that ended up killing um, uh, Zachary in his room. Oh, it looks like we don't have to wait very long. She's literally like right behind us. Cool. How are you, sir? I'm fucking awesome, dude. I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> It's huge, right? Please step inside. It's also like, you know what? It's like really well done too. Like this actually looks like a proper mansion. Like it, it makes sense. Like the way it's laid out, it's very nice too. Like it's gorgeous. Like people spent some serious time designing this, uh, designing this mansion for this game. Yeah, there she is. Sit down. It's so funny because we're doing all of this to go ahead and tell her <laughs> that this person is dead and then we're going to kill her. <laughs> what? Being at this stage. It was me, lady. Is that a weapon? Jesus Christ. It's also very strange that it's so stupid that I'm not allowed to like Somebody close that. Has taken the case file. So, Mr. Whitmer, you've reached a conclusion. Take a seat. Please, go ahead. Perfect. See, this this was where it was. So, here we go. Your niece, Emma Carlyle, murdered your brother, Zachary. It could be. My niece? Emma is not my niece. She's my daughter-in-law. And your niece. Emma is the illegitimate child of your late older brother, Montgomery, who you and Zachary killed 46 years ago. That's preposterous. You asked me to find out what happened to Zachary. Would you rather not know? No. No, go on. I found a letter from Emma's mother, Jane, who was the fiancé of your older brother at the time of his death. She witnessed how 
you and Zachary pushed him off the balcony. She believed you did it to steal the Carlisle Empire from her and her unborn child. And she raised Henry to reclaim what she lost. Marry your heir, Gregory, get revenge, and secure the Carlisle Empire for her bloodline generations to come. Emma is the daughter of Montgomery and that local girl, Jane. She is. Well, the girl got it wrong. I didn't steal anything. I did what was necessary to protect the future of the Carlisles. Montgomery wasn't cut out to take over from father. <coughs> Heart and no balls. Emery used the funeral gathering to speed up her installment as the lady of the house, seizing the opportunity to stage Zachary's suicide. She did her homework, used a poison made from one of Zachary's rare plants, found old floor plans from Thornbridge Manor to gain access to his room through a secret passage. That scheming bitch. More than you think. I found proof that she will try to poison you next. Well, I'll have to take care of that. Thank you, Mr. Whitmer. You have not disappointed. I promised you I would reward you generously if you solved the case. So, what do you suggest? I'll send you an invoice. Thank you, Mr. Whitmer. I trust you'll see yourself out. I interesting. Privacy. Thank you. So the part that's interesting about that is that I guess I could have actually got the case file from doing this uh, this as well. Uh, so here's the great part. So she's going to go outside. Like a dum-dum. <laughs> All righty. I wasn't quick enough. I need to do it quicker. Maybe I could... No, oh, I can't pop her, though. That's the only thing. I need to... Oh, I guess I could push her, but I don't know if I'm going to be seen or not. I probably am going to be seen doing this, so let me try. What happened? Mission complete. Well done, 47. Wait, what happened there? Why did, why did that go so weird? No, no, go. Go this way. <laughs> go this way, please. Alright. Here we go. Boom. I was hoping to actually just do it from the edge, but I guess I didn't need to do that. That's cool. Now, I have challenges for this mission. Um, and one of them I'm wondering. Do, do, do. Where is that? Challenges, there we go. I just want to know, do I need... To, is there one? Um... See, there was one here to electrocute her. So there was a way I could have done it super early on, too, as the uh, photo shoot. Oh my god. <laughs> we could have fucking thrown her into the grave. That's so cool. Um... Yeah, what's the classics? It's probably the classics, right? Um, complete the Assassin's Challenge. Holy, you could do the whole thing in suits? That's amazing. Actually, Tang, that's the only person that we actually have to do. Do not get spotted. Do not get compromised. No bodies are found. Only kill the target. So they do not have it. Ah, okay, I'm kind of surprised. Because I remember, like, a lot of the Hitman games, they actually had, like, an extra thing. Like, it was a bonus. Um, if you would uh, leave the mission area with your suit, 
But I'm thinking of blood money, I think, where it would charge you money if you actually um, didn't leave with your suit. But I guess that's not a thing as a challenge. Sup, Tang? But that was it. We got it. We got everything we need to do on this one. Boom. I'm kind of surprised that they don't have that, though. But the suits only challenge, that would be quite interesting to... My goodness, imagine um, trying to get her with just the suits. That would be that would be pretty hard, I would imagine. Because getting in is not particularly hard. I was able to get up to that area right there, no problem. Nobody saw me. But the other part, like... There's one there that says, like, oh yeah, assassinate her with the sniper rifle. Well, man, you'd really have to be quite lucky on where she would be at that time. So there's definitely a lot of challenges to be done on each of these missions. But I am happy. They're everywhere. Go, get out! It's the Constantine! Shit! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what's going on to him? What is going on to him? Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at me. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> yes. Twenty three thousand XP. Look how much we still got we can still do on this mission. That's pretty cool. Let's you play many different ways. And I do appreciate that these games do that. We got the short baller now. Thank you. We can now have a lockpick when we come into missions. That's pretty cool. Agency pick up the bathroom. Very nice. Deliveries. I'm actually kind of excited. I can't, I'm the most excited to play back this mission. I, I really am. Because it would be cool to go ahead and do the electrocution thing. You owe him nothing. But yeah, I'm, I'm very, very excited. Stay down. Boss wants you alive. Yeah. How about now? Over here. Cover me. Walk away. <laughs> or what? You gonna take us all on? Don't. Yeah! Tell the Constant to start running! You think you've won? 47 is out there. And 47 never misses his mark. Neither do you, Miss Burnwood. That's what makes you valuable. You're delusional. You think I would betray 47? Trust me. You owe him nothing. What is this? I told you we could help each other. And I meant it. I'll look forward to your call. 
Yeah. Gray is gone. Go to Berlin and stay out of sight. We're all that's left now. Ooh, the plot thickens. The plot thickens. Whew, okay. Guys, I'm going to take a quick breather here. I'm just going to go use the washroom real quick and grab some water as well. And I'll be right back, okay? Be back very shortly. Within probably be about 10 minutes or so. I'll be right back. And thank you for the love, Tang. Thank you so much. I'll be right back, guys. Thank you so much for watching so far.
Oh, Tang, you already left. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, man. I had to had to take a quick break there. Oh, no, Genius, did you watch any Hitman movie? Yes, actually, I've watched both of them. Um, I think that the first Hitman movie was an underrated masterpiece that was really well done, and it's and it's really too bad that it didn't do well. Um, I'm I'm actually really disappointed. The actor, uh, Tim, uh, I think his name is Timothy Oliphant. I think he did a great job as being Agent 47. He was great. Um, it's just it's just unfortunate that critics panned the movie. I thought it was great, and it did a great job represent. He did a great job representing Agent 47 and how the stories are told in the games because they left it on like on a crazy cool cliffhanger. And then the second movie, it was it was okay. It wasn't anything too crazy. Um, but yeah, it's too bad. Honestly, I think they should have done another one with Timothy Oliphant. It would have been great. I oh, know, genius. Did you like um? Did you like any of those movies? Like personally, personally, I do like them. I, I think the first one was just the best, best out of all of them. Apex Predator. Here we go. What is going on here, guys? I'm gonna just do a quick stats check on my on my computer here. It's being a little bit weird. It's acting a little bit weird. I just want to check something. Just gotta check Spexy. I just want to know why, why is, why is the computer kind of stickering there? Ah, very strange. Yeah, it's definitely, it's definitely not to do with my system. My system is running A-OK -okay right now. So that's, that's all game related. You guys are seeing stuttering. It's going to either do, it all, it all has to do with, um, it must be this server thing. Their own servers that are doing that. So sorry if you guys are seeing some stuttering here and there. It, it must be tied to the internet connection. Um, so <clears throat> yeah i hope you guys are uh so far enjoying it i am loving this game um definitely regretting not playing the other two and i'm almost depending on how well the uh, streams go for this i will definitely unlock the other two i'll lock that content and yeah, I definitely will play it because yeah these were these were some of my faves Yeah, and this this game is uh, fantastic. And I'm so glad that they they kept working on them. There we go. Oh, we got that going there. Okay, so unknown, unknown. I'm going to say this to you right now. Um, the first movie, the one that you have to look for is the older one. Look for the one that has Timothy Oliphant in it. You will not regret it, trust me. It is, it's so good. Um, if you enjoy, like, Hitman games, he they did such a good job on it, too. Like... It would have been super cool if they would have got the actual like voice actor that does Agent Forty Seven to do it, but um, it's it's a very very underrated film. Um, yeah, I definitely would recommend the first one. Uh, very good. I forgot what the first one's called. I don't remember if it was called Hitman or if they called it Agent Forty Seven, um, but it's really good. And you'll 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 certainly not be disappointed. I'll tell you that right now. It's a great it's a great film. So definitely, definitely, if you have time, 
I know you're busy with your school and everything, but if you ever have time to sit back, relax, and watch a good movie, that's a good one. I don't know where I don't know if they stream that movie or not, but I'm sure you can find it by many means. <laughs> No, I'm not saying anything. You could find it for sure online. <laughs> oh, let's see. Uh, we got a lot of challenges. I don't want to. I actually don't want to look at the challenges because it might it might tip me away. Uh, tip off what I'm supposed to do here. Um, difficulty. I'm, I'm gonna be. What is the what is the mastery skill? I, I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna do that. That's, I think, actually, the one that you're thinking of is the second one. Um, that's with the other actor. I call him Putin. The guy looks like Putin, the, the guy for the second film. Um, I think that's the... You're thinking of the one that has, like, all the grappling hooks, like, like attaching to the cars, right? You know, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be a real one for you. One second. Okay. You know what? Um, the film that you want to look for. It's just called Hitman. It's from 2007. It's it's too bad, and look at that. It still has such a bad rating. All all these like raw and tomatoes and Metacritic. I hate those sites. But if you look at Google reviews, 89% like the film. I like I like the Google reviews because that's just that's just regular people watching the film. It's it's you and us watching a movie and going, yeah, it was a good film. <laughs> yeah. So 2007. That's the one you're gonna look for. I think the other one was that one was not that. Actually, the, the second one wasn't too long ago, was it? Just a few years back. Alrighty. Let's do this. Into another one, guys. God, that last, that last one was so good. So I'm excited for this. Whoa, what is going on? Yo, my vision. Fountain view. <laughs> awesome. Okay, it wasn't the car. I thought it was going to be the car. Nope, nope, okay. How jokes would it be if it was the front door I was supposed to go through? Jokes incoming! Are you for real? I gotta look for a coin! No! Frau 
their whole how mm, I'm already stumped guys I'm already stumped I'm sure I'm sure I have to grab a coin to put inside the machine to open up a secret door yeah just got the camera that's all I got hmm Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Wait, what? Dr. Pop. <laughs> Guys, what's going on here? You know what the weirdest thing too is I can't scan. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, like how do you not have a few coins in the pocket, right? Um that's a joke in and itself, exactly, right? <laughs> Maybe... no. Are you for real? No. Wait. You didn't tell. Something's off with this van. Why is an unmarked van parked behind this bus stop in the middle of the night? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ja, ja, ja. You know what though? I might be I might be missing something here. Zipatsud Hor Tree. Oh man, this guy's busting out the classics, man. Super Mario Sunshine? One of oh my god, one of my favorites, man. Oh Lee. That when I was a kid, that was one of my favorites. Like uh, the nostalgia connected to Super Mario Sunshine for me is amazing. Yeah, you know, I I got that game when it was uh when I was pretty young, um, and it was a time in my life where you know you didn't have to worry about bills, there was no jobs, nothing like that. You just, you know, and I got it for Christmas that year, and oh man, it was so good. You know, I I I love that. I love that game. <laughs> what the fuck is going on with this? You know what? I, I, I'm, I'm going to be interested to see when Wicklum gets to this point, too. I'm going to watch the stream back. I would love to see what he gets here. Like, if he if he figures this out quicker than me, because I have no clue. I have no clue. Like, the fears are whole. Like, I'm thinking that it would be, like, a tree. Like, I'm supposed to go look at a tree or something. But, like, um, so good, right? Like, one of my favorites. Um, like, Nintendo GameCube. Uh, love the console. Um... Uh, actually, yo, hey, uh, Tang, um, just recently, I don't know if you played it when you were back in the day or not, but, uh, we actually just recently did a Metroid Prime 1 on the channel as, like, massive streams. That's also one of my, another one of my favorites. Super Mario Sunshine, uh, Super Mario Sunshine, Metroid, Metroid Prime. Oh, we got a missing texture here, boys. We found it. We did a Reddit. Got a missing texture. Um, Time Splitters, the whole Time Splitter series, very good. Time Splitters is probably one of the best games series ever made. Man, that, that whole era of video gaming was so good. Guys, I'm stumped. I'm actually, like, super stumped right now. Probably 
this here. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh. Guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> Oh my god oh my god man oh man i uh i'm gonna be doing a compilation video of this game 100 percent. there's been some funny moments so far and this is gonna be one of them i'm gonna do like a compilation of me fucking up on this <laughs> nintendo 64 yeah man Woo, jeez, nintendo 64 I, I didn't have a Nintendo 64 when I was a kid, but we had a neighbor that had one, and uh, he had uh, he had a like GoldenEye and Mario 64 on it, and Super Mario, uh, uh, what was it? Oh, Smash Brothers. Yeah, Smash Brothers, the first one. Give me one second here, guys. I'm just going to do a quick little, quick little nibble here. I'm quite hungry. Hmm. Put her both in. It's your trip mine. I'll piss off, really. Oh, hurry up, hurry up. what they do how many one prime asset in a whole pack of up-and-comers they've infiltrated the club searching for us christ i think i killed one of them get out now before they spot you no they found us once they'll find us again <sighs> keep your head down i'll take care of this whoa this is huge Apex Predator, Berlin, Germany. Yeah, ja, guten Tag. Oh shit. Hello. Sorry, reception is bad out here. I got nothing to report, Gal. Gal, you hear me? Yeah, it's still quiet out here. No sign of them. I can't hear you. Price. Shit. This is like looking for a needle in a haystack. Just keep trying, Agent Montgomery. Our client considers Agent 47 and Olivia Hall as a serious threat. You can't underestimate them. I never do, Joe. We'll find them. We're all in position. Good. Report back to me if there's anything. Don't worry. Oh, it's Thraniat. We must eliminate. That was a, that was a, that was good. It's weird. I actually, you know what, Tang? I don't think this mission is gonna let me take disguises. I think I, we actually get to kill people, like a lot of them. Oh shit! That's oh man, that thing's sick. That's so good. You know the part that's really weird. There we go. Now I can do it. Now I can actually scan for people. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, there's nobody else going to be like sneaking up behind me here, is there? I don't know. Let's do it. Limit the agents one out of how? Oh, jeez, there's a lot. Um, search the compound and locate ICA agents. Sounds good. Sorry I'm delayed, but uh, someone must have moved my bike, and I can't find my, you know, allergy pills. 
Wait a minute, what the fuck? Yeah, I'm looking. Uh, very annoying. But I'll, I'll meet up with you inside. Once I find them. Okay. Yeah, I'll see you there. Garbage here, please find a nearby trash can. He's not considered one of them. No. It's very strange though. I cannot I cannot um take disguises right now. It's very weird. It's a nightclub, yeah, right? Yeah, it is. But you know what? When you see something like this, you're like, the last thing you're thinking of is it's a nightclub, right? <laughs> Holy smokes. Why does this give me like why this gives me like some uh Call of Duty zombie vibes, doesn't it? <laughs> okay. You're going to see a little bit of weird movement. I have to move my mouse away because it's going to interfere with everything. There we go. Let me just put that way over there. <clears throat> Locked from other side, okay? <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> Okay. One at nine nine three. Yeah, I think you're right. I'm I'm you're one hundred percent correct. You're this is definitely a nightclub, but it's just so weird looking, right? Okay, we got some uh, thought living around. We're gonna go over there right now. I don't want to do that. I don't want to kill. That's the thing. My first run, I do not want to kill non non targets. That's the whole thing. The second run, I'm going to be going ham. That was my bad though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, whoops. Let's do this. If anyone is there, show yourself, or sure. you will be in a lot of. Fuck, man, it's too bad. I had it before. I had it before. And now, dang. Do you have a sniper? You know what? I think I haven't unlocked it yet. I definitely want. I definitely want it though. Boy, you know the sniper with tranquil tranquilizers? Perfect for this. You get to live for now, comrade. I'll be right back. Must be done, yeah. The part that's really weird to me right now... Ooh. There goes the stuttering again. The part that's really weird to me is that I can't, uh... I cannot, um... Change into other people's uniforms and stuff. Oh, Walker. You see that? Like that's some bad stuttering going on right there. I got my PC monitor open. That is very strange. It is definitely tied. It's definitely tied to the uh, 
Could even be the game security. This is. I wonder if this game is running de novo as its uh as its security. Because if it is, this is definitely it. Because <laughs> like my my computer has more than enough uh, power to be running this bad boy. Look at this. Like ooh, it's like chunky right here. There we go. Let's go over here. <laughs> Very weird, eh? It's so weird that the uh, game stutters like this. Isn't that strange? There you go, no, it's fine. Nope, 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 there we go. Guaranteed, I can go over there. Yeah, it does. It does. Actually, I don't. I don't exactly know. Oh, I can't go this way. Shit. Yeah, it definitely. It does. It definitely feels like it's buggy, but not like in the way that most games are. It's buggy because of. I think it has to do with one, its server connection issues, because this game for some reason really does want you to always be online, and then number two, it, it, it's possibly due to to, to de novo. Which is like a security program to prevent um, people from pirating the game, and that program is notorious for actually screwing up on um, people's uh, uh, people's games from just trying to play them. This is a bad spot. Okay, hold up. Jesus. Oh, you're gay. That's cool, bro. If you're gay, that's all good. I'm not, though. <laughs> Who I am? How do I move? Oh, man. How do I get past this? This is actually really well guarded. Like, that person's right there. I just need to get right there. That's all I need to do. We're gonna drag her off over here. Just a wee bit away from everybody's prying eyes. Alright, let's go ahead and uh There we go. I just need like a little break. little break from uh for like not a break but i needed like a way to get through there uh sometimes moments like these are so stressful that a non-gamer can just oh yeah oh yeah that's crazy oh it's crazy 
Because because <laughs> all it takes is like one slip up and that's it. That's all it takes. That's all it takes. It's like one little whoops and everything goes wrong. Yeah, see, I knew, I knew it. See what I mean there, guys, right there? Like, you guys can see the game, for some reason, said I was offline, even though I'm online. Very strange, right? Got another coin. Look at, look at uh, Headman here. Agent 47 making some, some cash here. Okay, let's go ahead. I need, I need her just to move a little bit, so let's just get her to go like radar. Maybe uh, radar. Who's there? It's Big J. That's who's there. <laughs> You know, Big J might be big, but I can uh, I can sneak up on you. <laughs> Let's see. Let's go ahead and throw that right here. Okay, we're gonna go over here now, and let's go ahead and go. Oh, got a coin. Oh, what's this? We got a st we got a staff key. I believe that warrants a, a little save. Let's do that. Why wouldn't I trust you, man? Just because you're gay doesn't mean you can't be trusted. I have plenty of gay friends. Actually, one workplace I used to work with had like three dudes that were gay. One chick was a lesbian. Do whatever makes you happy is what I say. Don't let nobody tell you otherwise. Ladies and gentlemen, we may have fucked it up. I guess I must have left her in a spot that somebody else seen, so let me check. Oh yeah, it's gonna be weird now with the uh with the connection. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh, did we bug out? We may have bugged out. Oh, boys. I think it bugged out. I think she bugged out. Yeah, it bugged out. Give me one second, guys. We're going to go ahead and restart this. Oh, 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 oh. Did that work? Oh, no, no, it didn't. <laughs> yeah, hold up, guys. I'm going to have to, um, I'm going to go ahead and have to restart it. It was bound to happen eventually. You know what, though? Um, so far, that's my only, that's the only time it's dropped for me. The, um, the game is dropped, so that's pretty good. I, I heard that it's, for some people, it's pretty bad, like how many times it will actually crash for them. So, considering that's the first time it bugged, not bad. It could it could have been worse. It could have been worse. At least on PC, I don't know I don't know how the consoles are faring. I don't know I don't know if they have the same issues as the PC, but um yeah, it happens. You guys will see the game come up right away here.
Kind of weird, it's not letting me um, load. Let's try that. Hey, Anon, when is your final exams? Is that coming close for you? Damn, it's super close then. Should I call a doctor? Go go back. I put her in a bad spot. I guess that's my bad. Put that body in a bad spot. Jeez, you're super close to to getting your all done. That was not the way I wanted her to go. I don't want to <laughs> Get the fuck down! <laughs> oh my god, he just slugged her! Oh my god! God, what does unconscious witness mean? <laughs> no way, does that count as her seeing me? You know what? That's what you get. <laughs> oh my god. This might be the last day I watch your streams until the exams are over. Yo, bro, I understand, man. All the concentration that you need. Oh, goodness. Education first, streams last. No, sorry, you know what? No, 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 no. Family first, your exams, then many other things, then the stream. <laughs> Don't you dare. <laughs> Don't you dare turn around, lady. <laughs> oh my god. That just honest to god killed me. The way that went. Oh man. Just slugged her right in the face. I don't even know how she was a witness to it when I destroyed her so quickly. Okay, pick up coin. We got the staff key. We also had a hammer I was going to miss. Never can never uh, forget to have a hammer. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do this real quick. <laughs> I still don't have a uniform. Uh, yeah, I know. I need a disguise. I don't think I can fit in her clothes. Can I, I don't know if uh, yeah, I don't think uh, our buddy here can fit into those uh, tight legging pants. <laughs> there we go. We will definitely get a uniform. I'm going to hope that we can get something in here. Uh, there's two people in here, though. There is one. Oh, there is quite the crowd. And that's the whole club. Oh, that's the pamphlet. That was the pamphlet that we found in the parking lot. Okay. I 
have an idea. Hey guys, look, it did it again. But I don't have the key. It's your good friend, Mr. 47! <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. How did she see it? All she would have seen was a hammer slamming her in the face. <laughs> I still don't understand how that uh, how that does not count as um, a kill. You know, I want to see something. I really do. I'm gonna go through here. Brown. We got a computer on this this corner here. <laughs> hey, you can't be. No, please. Oh, God. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> this, I don't know why I'm like slipping so bad on this. <laughs> Like, technically, wouldn't this kill you? Like, like imagine. Imagine this. You're unconscious. Eh. You know what I mean? How does that not kill somebody? Like, come on, man. <laughs> okay, you know what? I gotta go this way. Screw it. Let's try. Now it's stuttering again. Oh, my God. It's so bad. Ooh. Why do I keep getting stuck with females? Like, I just, I need to have a uniform. I need to disguise right now. So it's not a bug, guys. That wasn't a bug. I still have the key on me. So it was for that one specific door. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Don't come back. You weren't, you weren't supposed to come back. Oh, God. He's going to see me. Damn it. I need this guy's uniform. Oh, do you do you think do you think the reason why I couldn't do it to the first guy is is that there's no headgear for um, for 47 to put on. That's probably the reason why I couldn't put on anything. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Guys, give me one second. I'm gonna actually try to get the person outside. You know that one that like isolates himself? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be getting a disguise right away here. He's gonna see it. He's gonna see it. Guaranteed. Damn. What? The hell was that? Man. Oh boy.
Oh my god. You know what the funny thing is too? So he walks by her. No problem. Like, what is this? What is this thing? Oh my god, whatever. Oh god. Come on. I want to throw it at him so bad. <sighs> That's probably the funniest alert I've ever heard. I'm a pacifist, and I don't want to get anywhere near it. <laughs> so he just stands there. Oh, look at this. Oh, let me subdue him real quick, right, guys? Just blah. <laughs> Go, go, leave. Okay, here we go. Let's try. Again. 15th time's the charm. I'm a pacifist. Pacify that. you seeing this dude that's come on guys look i grabbed the weapon did i not okay i'm gonna i'm gonna bum rush it i'm gonna bum rush him as soon as i oh my god this is so frustrating come on It's his weapon that he's seeing, isn't it? It's bloody his weapon. You'll see this, dude. <laughs> God damn it. Thank you. Oh. Oh my God. I just need to grab my hammer real quick so I can go ahead and quickly do that again. One more time for bloody good measure. There you go. So that's what it was. I, it really, truly was. Oh, God, it's so annoying. Okay. We did it. Oh, my God. Christ. <laughs> Give it to me. Trust me, guys, if I wasn't trying to do, like, just strictly missions only, I would have lit them up by now. I would have shotgunned them right in the face. We're back on track. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. So I need to I need to just eliminate agents is what's going on here. Here we go. Finally, guys. Oh, man. Who would think that somebody would spend like 40... 
40 minutes, like trying to just do the first like two two minutes of the mission. My goodness. God damn. <laughs> I know it's on the receipt, right? Ring the doorbell at the drop off. Wouldn't have killed the guy to meet me outside, but what the hell do I care, right? <sighs> Listen, I don't want to be on the phone when my dealer shows. I'll talk to you later. Yeah? Bye. Um, hello. <laughs> Open. Actually, uh, Tang, if you want to go, if you look at the actual channel videos, I have done a lot of videos on uh, Cyberpunk. We did already a full playthrough of the Street Kid. Um, some of them were done as episodes, and other ones were done as live streams. And we did a lot of tips and tricks here. Actually, our most popular video on the channel was was a Cyberpunk video for doing um, for cars, which had like 30k views. But right now the channel we're taking a small break from cyberpunk um it's still not in a very good uh playable state yeah exactly as unknown said i've already completed one playthrough of it i i will go back to cyberpunk guys don't get me wrong i'm, I'm going to but it's it's gonna be a bit it's gonna be a bit like i did the hell out of cyberpunk that was like a full geez that was like almost a month worth of content was cyberpunk for the channel so we're taking a little break on that right now hopefully they can patch it still it still needs a lot of bug fixes it's still very unstable and uh apparently we're getting a dlc pretty soon so Once we do the DLC, you know we're hopping on it. Big J with the tips. Every day, every day. Some of these agents have to be on top of this roof. Guaranteed. Shishwan pork right now. Tasty. That's tasty. I love these dudes. These fucking pictures are great. Why is it so buggy at some points? Holy smokes. Let's get a copyright strike now because this has music in it. Oh, these guys are jamming! <laughs> Bro, and you know what? It's I'm I'm so sad that it didn't do well. Those good videos didn't do well. It's too bad. I love those I love those games and I'm, I'm shocked that they didn't do well. Like, a Yakuza game in English. Ugh. In English didn't do well. That just blows my mind. I did plan... I am planning on streaming Yakuza 0. A very fun game. Very good. I'm going to have to have a lot of water next to me because that whole game I have to actually... Green reporting. No sign of 47 yet. Be careful or you may not spot him until it's too late. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, boys. Okay. Whoa. Hold up. 
Wait a minute. Big J's already in it. Fuck off. Come on, game. Respond to my, my inputs here. Goddamn. One's there, one's on the other end too, right? Jokes I can't dump his body in that, okay. Yeah, I'm getting very unlucky here, guys. I'm sorry. I'm getting very, very, very unlucky. I'm getting so unlucky with this mission right now. It's too bad. I don't even I don't even necessarily even know where that dude even seen him. Oh fuck me. To me, it looks like he's just chilling, doesn't it? Like he's just relaxing. No, we haven't played Fall Guys yet. You know what, though? We've heard a lot about it. Um, definitely got to get on that. There's, there's quite a few people who have requested Fall Guys as well. You're, you're definitely not the first one. We're going to get on that uh, pretty soon. Looks like a fun game. Fuck off. Man. Get that out. takes Rook. That's another one down. Do not let him turn this situation around on us. I gotta find whoever this woman is that's like kind of coordinating all this. Oh yeah, we're gonna do that real quick. Does this mission screw me over? It's too hard. Is it a hard game? 
Don't get me wrong, I like hard games, by the way. I can I can proudly tote that for uh, Dark Souls 3. Dark Souls 3, one of the hardest games of all time. Never played any of the Soul games ever. I rocked it once, no problem. And then I just did new... I don't know how many New Game Pluses I did on that freaking game. All the DLC smoked it. And... Um, you know, something, something that I wish I would have had at the time was some recording software because I did do a complete, absolutely no freaking damage run on that game. Which is incredibly hard to do. It was like a self-challenge as well. You played with four guys, yeah. Um, I've seen the game now because there's so many people who recommended it. Oh, there we go. But yeah, we haven't we haven't had an opportunity to play it yet. We're definitely going to though. You know what? Let me let me continue searching this room. I'm gonna see if we can find some more of these people because it's still giving me a uh, question mark for how many people are left. Look how many people are trying to get in here. Crazy. Uh, guys, I have to do it once. I gotta do it once. I have to do it once. It's saved. I gotta do it once. <laughs> That's how I feel about this mission. Kill them all. <laughs> oh my god. This bloody mission. It says eliminate five. It says five, so... Fair to say, there's still quite a bit. There, there might even be that one dude all the way the heck out there. Might even be one of them. Which the good thing is, um, we can actually probably go over there. But we're gonna try to go back down into that club. Go down to the club. This was the dude who'd seen him. Really? Okay. Oh, cool. Hey. Coming up, Millhouse. There we go. Got it. The next mo morning star. Hey, welcome to the stream. Can you all go to my channel subscribe? Let me check out your channel. Hold up. Give me a second here. Hold up. Hey. Lennox. M Morningstar. Let's check you out. Let's see what you got. That's Morningstar. Lennox, are you streaming right now as well? Oh, damn! Look at Lennox here! Yo, Lennox, I'm dropping you a like right now, my dude. I'm subbing to you. Got you right here, bro. What mission are you doing right now? Oh, you're doing the... You're do, are you doing the mansion, aren't you? Oh, you're doing suits, aren't you? You're gonna do suits, eh? Oh, dang, man. Dang. Yeah, it's up to you, bro. I subbed on... Uh, I got my alt account right here on my phone. It's up to you. Are you, are you like doing like the crazy hard difficulty right now? Is that what's going on on, on your end there?
You guys gotta check out Lennox. Lennox Morning Star. Give the boy a shout out. Give him some support. Give him a look, see guys. Are you my dudes? Bad guys? Are you guys good? Look to be alright, let's see. Yeah, I see he's playing the man. I'm watching him right now. I got I got my phone open on the side here. And I see he has he's using suits right now. It's gonna be, uh, I'm sorry, brother. It's, uh, it's not the one. Yeah, sorry, brother. I don't, I don't like that. You gotta give support to everybody, little and small. It's a community. You gotta help everybody out. I gotta show love to the small guys. We're all, we're all small. We all gotta support each other. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, I see it. He's going hard. He's going hard right now. <laughs> He's playing the exact opposite of, of me right now. I'm being like very hey, passive. I only got visual on stoned idiots. No sign of target. Stay alert. We don't need to give him an opportunity to strike. <laughs> a little poop poop. A little, little pop pop. <laughs> Agent Tams, report. Are you there? And that makes three. The math was on our side. This shouldn't be happening. <laughs> I don't know, I'm staking. I'm good. <laughs> doesn't feel right about this. He's good, but he's not psychic. He's been listening in. God damn it. Dang. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the club. Apparently, mm, apparently there's gonna be what was it five? So we just have two more to go. So it does give me a question mark though. So there could be more. Okay. 
Oh, I love these little <laughs> these like goofy pieces are amazing. there look at this oh my god I'm not even in control right now holy what just happened there what's even happening right now Whoa, that was the strangest thing ever. What is going on? Wow. It was like the game was lagging and then also my controller was like, nah dude, you're not you're not doing nothing right now. <laughs> my goodness. Oh my god, it was all over the place, my goodness. All right, let's continue on. Only got two more to go, so that was our main entranceway, so we're good there. I don't, I don't think they're gonna just leave some dude just hanging out in one spot like that. <coughs> Yo, how big is this? This place is massive. Solid bro, dude. I knew it was gonna happen. I knew it was gonna happen. The disconnections are, are wild right now with this. What's he gonna have a car battery to interact with? It's, it's strange, right? It's so strange where um, where the game just completely just goes off. Now what's that tank? Do you want to play the Car Master? What's Car Master? Is that another Car Master? Let me check that out. Tank by chance is it a is it a mobile game? Is that what it is? That's the only thing that's coming up right now. Good thing I, uh, it's a good thing I save quite often. I, you know what, to be honest with you, it has to probably do with one, the connection with, um, with iOS the servers, and then two, it has to do with Novo, uh, the Novo. I guarantee it has to be those two things. Because, like, it's, it almost seems, like, un, unnatural, like, when it happens. Because, like, you know what I mean? Like, this is not too graphically hard to render, right? 
like, my game ran pretty damn well with uh, Cyberpunk, and that game, there's so much happening on the screen at once, and I didn't have no hitches with that. Um, and that game doesn't use DeNovo, and it doesn't require you to be online all the time. But this, yeah, this game, it's like the weird security measures that they have put in place, uh, and it's it all has to do with people trying to pirate the games, like, for sure. That's, that's, that's the reason why they put this stuff in there in the first place. But yeah, it's... It's a huge performance hit, and there's so many games where Denovo does, does that, and then it seems weird, like, um, I can almost guarantee this will happen. Um, there's so many games where Denovo was first introduced into the game when it launches, and then people complain enough, like, yo, my game keeps stuttering, they won't be able to fix those problems. Then they get rid of Denovo, and as soon as they do that, boom, it works fine. <laughs> Security. Looking good today, sir. Looking awesome, aren't they? Oh, the mole cups are here. Bro, I'm wearing the same uniform as you. Are you kidding me? The guy burned himself. What, what's like? <laughs> the mole cops are here. Bro, you're wearing the same thing as I am right now. What, what's up with you? Two more, two more. That's all I need. It's two more. So that one room was a no-go. There's this. This goes down. So let's check this out. Oh my God! This dude right here. Oh yeah, he's just he's just ripped out of his mind. did it again. Nope. 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 <laughs> nope, I don't care. I'll run away all day. I'm gonna reload it. I'm gonna reload it, but I'm gonna see if I can find these dudes while this is happening. I'm gonna reload it, no worries. Like, I'm not gonna have that as a, as a uh, thing against my XP. <laughs> but I do wanna know where these guys are, so as long as, like, I, I'm already been found technically, but I will try to find, uh. Okay. Damn, I wonder where these guys are. It's not bad. It's not alright. It's alright. It's alright. Let's thump a little bit to it. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> that sucks though. Wasn't paying attention to the uh, enforcer. I'm a little bit of a loss though because the map is so huge. It's like massive actually. So, trying to figure out where they are. So, I had the one on the roof, um, the one that was in the very beginning. 
Uh, and then this dude right here. But my goodness, I do not know where the last two are going to be. So I just got to be a little bit more careful about the enforcers and where they're looking. I'll uh, start again down below and continue on. You winged the callmaster. Please stay back. Oh, uh, you winged? I am so confused, man. Like, man. You too, bro. Unknown. Thank you so much for coming out again, man. Always appreciate you in the streams. Lock that door, but I can't lock the other door. Isn't that strange? Weird, isn't it? So I'm back at the spot where I was at before. Is there a map in this? I wonder. Is there a map? Yes, there is. Hey. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> it's ginormous. What, what does that mean, by the way? I don't know what bo, bo, bo means. Ooh, what's this? Frying pan. Bang! <laughs> Swan reporting in. We've got no sign of 47 yet, but I'll let you know if something catches my eye. Stop talking. Focus on finding him. Interesting. So this dude was here the whole time. I actually ended up walking right past him the first time. Interesting. Yeah, I was here just before. Yeah, I know. Oh yeah, I'll go that way, dude. Stay here. I'll take a look. Oh, thank you. Man, we might have a situation. I'll set the perimeter. Over. Swan, are you still there? That makes four. If any 
any of you make it out of this debacle, you'll be the laughing stocks of the ICA. There we go. Finally. So the last one has to be inside. I don't think they would have. Then again. Hmm. Something that does occur to me though is that they all have been outside. They all were outside. There wasn't a single one inside yet. Scrap sword. Ooh, what the fuck? <laughs> what in the world? Let's go down. Let's move forward. Last dude must be outside too, then. You have your ticket on you? Come on. What's this ticket shit even about? This is in an arcade. Just let me look behind the booth. No one will know whether I had one or not. If I could let you through without a ticket, then we wouldn't have a ticket-based system, would we? Right. I guess that's true. I was going to bend the rules for anyone. Maybe it's not like I'm trying to be a jerk here. I'm just doing my job. And I'm just trying to do my job. That asshole in the bar over there keeps giving me shit that he has a ticket. Jesus. It's like working for an IT company. Then you should have brought a ticket. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess. Okay, so um, one more to go, and there's a fair possibility he's outside. Sneaky. I don't know if I'm in the right spot. That's the only thing. Search the compound and locate ICA agents. Okay. Well, we're gonna go down. Go down to the water again. And then we'll see. Trying to key hacker. Very interesting. That area had the camera in front of it. I am sorry, though. It's interesting how that one's considered security. Two dudes are here. Good to know. Okay. Found some boy or
Hmm. Either the person's outside, more than likely, or um, he's very isolated somewhere in this building. Actually, back where I started. Fair feeling I know where this is gonna go. Think or no? Lost all area, okay. Stump boys. Like I'm, I'm fairly confident it has to probably do with the um. Do they have to be outside? More than likely. Oh shit! Shit, dude. quite stumped right now because I, I hmm, every single person that I've killed so far was outside that I needed to kill so ah oh shit so like fairly confident that that's what the case is going to be like the other one is outside what's this Found the wrench. Let's go ahead and climb on through. Like 
honestly, I, I've almost exhausted every area I could be in. So I'm like actually... Oh, I'm at a loss right now for words. Where do I go? Where do I go? That was the guy that screwed me before. Yeah, that was the dude that screwed me before. He walked in out of nowhere. Um, man. I am so lost. I don't know where to go. strange I don't know unless I missed like early on or somewhere but like I don't get it yeah I'm a little lost as well I've given it a good old shot Security, huh? Just remember your briefing and stay on task. Oh, uh, that was lucky. That was super lucky. I was actually trying to figure out like where, where everybody was, and <laughs> that's actually super funny. That's really funny. Okay. So that was the that was the guy that screwed me before. And he sips from that cup. Mm. 
I wonder if we can either poison him or if we can find a spot where he's uh, kind of by himself. Let's see. Okay, so he only goes to that toilet then. I feel like I have to poison his drink somehow. But I wonder where I haven't seen any um anything like poison or anything yet. So that this was that back area we were in before. I didn't really take a good firm look here. We had a frying pan here, we had a thing right there. What's this? Oh my god, yes. Okay. <laughs> Dude, yes. This is working. All right, open. Oh shit! But I can't just. Dang. Good to see you. So I have my poison, but I can't just poison this drink outright, can I? What is this? There's a juice bar here, though. Keep the gun holstered, son. Look at that, good. No way, man. Oh, thanks. Dude, there's tons of rat poison. How did I not notice all that before? That's kind of funny. Hmm. So, I need a crowbar, because I, I have a feeling I might be able to get back there. Um, maybe poison the drink. Nothing out of the ordinary. Understood. Stay watchful. It's only a matter of time now. I just want to test something. Because this dude's kind of like looking towards me. So what's this dude, right? Oh, yeah, never mind. Bad test idea. It's going to kill somebody. That I don't want to kill. I need a wrench. Oh, hello. Drop a coin. Oh, man, yeah. That's, that's what I'm feeling right now. I'm getting like a headache from it. <laughs> Alright, we're back at that very starting area. But I'm thinking there might be a possibility we'll find a... We'll find a, not a wrench, but a crowbar. I don't know why I'm seeing wrench. Uh, we need a crowbar. This area is pretty big, and there might be one just kind of hanging around. 
kind of sitting around here. Uh, look at all these dudes. <laughs> um, oh, I got a little, got a little happy there for a second. I thought for sure that that was it. Huge area back here. <laughs> oh my god. This is a huge axe is chilling there. But that's not what I need though. A random chair. Random chair out in the woods. I'm sure that's a reference to something. I don't know though. Command reporting in. No updates. Yet. Report received. Dang, I'm like, ugh. I don't know. Hmm. Very strange. Very, very strange. Oh, hello. Car battery. Don't need that. Let's see. Ah, dang. Oh. Oh, the ass. Give it to me. Give that good shit. There's a camera like right here though. Can I can I pass the door without being spotted by the camera? Oh, come on, game. Why you do me like this, dude? Well, I guess I can just hop off. Yeah, that, that, that's alright then. I can just hop off and go over. Yeah, like legit. Yeah, okay. Oh, my God. Okay. There we go. Watch out. That's considered an enforcer right there. Are you kidding me? Well, oh, that's so weird.
Ooh, jeez. Command, just checking in. I got Zilch to report. Understood. Stay watchful. It's only a matter of time now. This mission's been screwing me, so I gotta kinda save scum this one a little bit. Um. Okay, I'm gonna do the exact same thing to this guy. Oh yes, that makes yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. A banana. <laughs> I'm your replacement. Where does he go, though? Where does he go? Cool. Excuse me. You should try this. It really is to die for. Reporting in. No updates. Yet. Report received. Makes me wonder though, can I not grab that? I feel special. Yeah, wrong person. Oh, wow, this guy's weird, man. Thing is, I'm almost positive, though, that poisoning. Like going in and poisoning this guy's drink outright is uh, going to be considered suspicious. Hey, Scotty! How you doing, buddy? This is going to be a suspicious watch. Let's see. Well, actually, that kind of worked out. Uh, how you doing, bud? Turn 
know what? He's just far enough from where I am to quickly swap back into the security uniform, which I'm going to do right now, as fast as I possibly can. Because he's going to drink that water, get sick, hopefully. Then we'll follow him and we'll just murk him wherever he goes. Tired. <laughs> gotta get some rest then, man. Doing good. Just got testing the carriers on ships. On oh, is it there now, Scott? The the carriers are on the console now. Rest is the most important thing you can get, man. Don't 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 overstrain yourself. If you're tired, get some rest. Uh, get some sleep. Have a good one, Tang. Thank you so much for coming out to the stream tonight, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of, I kind of warmed up to the music in this game now. I'm kind of bobbing over here with it. Oh shit! Command, just checking in. I got Zilch to report. Understood. Stay watchful. It's only a matter of time now. It's only the Hone Show and Langley, and they, and they're a premium. What the fuck? They're premium. It's like a test phase, but they're only here until. Wait, they're premium, but they're only there for a bit. What? That's weird. Anyways, how do they control? Where's he going? Yes, thank God. It's similar to the PC, oh, but a bit more harder. <laughs> That's the only time Agent 47 said anything this mission. That's great. Uh, it's similar to the PC, but a bit harder to dial in with the controller. Yeah, I bet, right? My goodness. Because there's going to be that input lag, too, right? You're trying to go back and forth. You're trying to dial in that shot, right? I just took in. Somebody might have just seen a body. Oh, 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 I just seen that. I just seen it. Watch. He's an agent too. They're all agents right there. That's, that's them dipping out. They're all scared. That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. Um, you know what? If I would have been a little bit more quicker to react to that. Oh my goodness. If I was more quicker to the react to that. Yo, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me see right here. Confirm. Yeah. 
guess. I gotta load. Where where was I? Uh, twenty three oh eight. Okay, we're we're golden. We're golden, buddy. I might I might just pull off some bullshit right here. Let's see. If it doesn't work, I'll just load the other file. But this might work. Yo, Scott, this is fucking sick. This game's awesome. I love Hitman. It's been a long time since I've played this 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 uh, game series, man. I missed out on the uh, the new Hitman one and two, but yeah, this is this is awesome. Stop looking this way. Come here. Stay safe, man. The hunter report. Report received. Yeah, the steering for the plane is very touchy. You gotta get to. Uh, I'm gonna try and get used to. Yeah, for sure. Whew. I'm just thinking, like, yeah, it's already hard enough on the PC <laughs> to get sh to do your runs with your planes. I can imagine like how crazy it is with the uh, with the console. Like, it's there's definitely gonna be something off about it, right? I'm really sorry, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to let you pass. Order, no. you know. Come on, I have the hardest time with the with the planes in that game already. Man, I'm just, I'm honestly just imagining like just just how like wonky it is to move back and forth. <laughs> I have a great idea right here. So I'm going to kill this dude again. Let's drown him. Blah, 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 blah. Report. I feel like I can do that better. I think I can get all of them. I just, what a weird way to reload, though. I'm not going to lie. That's a super weird way to reload. Exactly. Well, sway in the play. Yeah, exactly. Ah, oh, dang it. Gosh dang it, dude. I missed it. I missed him. Bro, how was your day? It kind of sucks. I, I wish I would have. Ah, if I would have known about the re reloading, man. Would have lit him the fuck up right there in that corner. 
Would have got eight of them. I just took it in. There's more than... I, that's crazy. There was more than just the five agents. There there was more. That's cool. So I could have I could have got eight. It's just too bad the autosave kind of screwed me right there. Like, let me see. The, the, uh, should I? Yeah. 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 Let's go ahead and do it. <laughs> I want I want them dead. <laughs> These guys are trying to kill me. I'm going to kill them. I'm going to murk them. I'm gonna stand in front of that door too. I'm just gonna fucking line them up as they come through. Okay, muscle muscle shirts over there. Let's do this. Reporting in. Nothing. Uh, long ago, I dealt with a DMV all morning until noon, and then ran deliveries until dusk. Jeez. Out of the how, how did your DMV go, by the way? Was it hopefully hopefully well? <coughs> I don't know why you keep saying that to me when I can't pass there. Wow. Excuse You're me. embarrassing yourself. Taste it. Mmm, it's tasty. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. Another one. That's it. I'm pulling the plug. Get out of there now. Fuck off, really, game? <laughs> That's so funny, oh my god. <laughs> oh, thank god, man. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy that that worked out for you. Oh, man. Ah, oh, sweetheart, they're all dead. <laughs> Are you there, Agent Rose? Report. <clears throat> Here we go. All three are down. Lethal pills. Oh boy. Those were going to get earlier to use.
Oh, they still made you pay? What the fuck? Jeez. Come on. The world's not right. Oh yeah, they make the mistake. They should pay you money. Okay, so the mission wants me to exit expel right here. But I really, really hope it's gonna let me. Nah, dang it. There's an area up ahead that I could have gone through. Strat. We're clear. They got my message. Where are you? Diner. On the main road. On my way. Makes me wonder how many there were in total, because I think I got eight of them. Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, there we go. That was pretty solid. That whole mission, honest to god, the, I could have done that way quicker, but my goodness, the beginning of it was ever destroying me. My god, did that ever take forever. That took forever! <laughs> that covered uh, uh, reinstatement of the, the CDL and then change address and cover renewing so I didn't have to go back in December to renew it then when it's. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So, so there was a reason why you actually had to pay. It wasn't because of something else. Okay. <laughs> this is freaking get up, yes. <coughs> yes, it's awesome. Agent of change. You're hurt. You should see the other guy. Never killed nobody before. What you did back there. You really are all the Gray said you'd be. 47. He didn't suffer, did he? He made it count. but not broken. I'm glad. It's time we start afresh, you and me. Get to the point. You and your friends pulled off the impossible. You stormed the heavens, took down the untouchables, and yet, here we are. Status quo. It just goes to show, you can't fight power, Miss Burnwood. Power never dies, it only changes hands. Best you can do is claim it. I never cared about power. Power is a tool, Miss Burnwood. It's the thing that gets you to the thing. As the next constant, you can be the agent of change. Transform the system from the inside. You'll be transformed by it. No risk, no reward. I'll need to think about it. No, you won't. The real question is, what will you bring to the table? Yes and no, been any who how you like the game so far? I've only played the last one. It's been it's been really good so far. Um the only complaints I have about the game um so far um, and I think this is just exclusive to the PC version right now. Um, there's The game requires you to be pretty much online all the time to do your saving and stuff like that. Um, that causes quite a bit of stuttering. There's been times where I'm playing the game and it almost it almost looks like input lag, or like lag in general. Um, but it's not tied to my PC's performance. It just seems to be a combination of the always online system. And then possibly, I'm, I've said this a few times already, but it's possibly 
the anti-piracy software called De Novo that I'm pretty sure that they're using in this this game. And De Novo is kind of notorious for causing serious performance issues um, with with games on PCs. So much so that many games that have De Novo when they first launch, they will end up getting rid of it afterwards um, because of how bad of a, of a performance hit it is. But yeah, it's so far everything other than that like awesome very good i didn't get a chance to play hitman uh, one and two the last one i played to its fullest was absolution um the only thing was is that i did keep up with the story of hitman since it is one of my favorite series you know you know me scott you you've seen you, you know my past so like there's been times where i just could not have really afford to play the other games but it's been a very good experience so far really nice really great Ah, oh, here we go. End of an era. Game looks wonderful. Just gorgeous all the way through. And I found out that there's actually... Um, there's actually a pack that I could have bought, and I and I think I might, where you can actually get the content from um, Hitman 1 and 2. The, you can actually just straight up play it through here. I'm telling you, the file is trash. The Constant doesn't so much burn his bridges as blow them up. Arthur Edwards, whoever he was, don't exist anymore. His personal data somehow deletes itself from any system that records him. Way beyond advanced. The partners spared no expense to make sure their controller would be untraceable. How untraceable? Look, I did what you asked, but Gray's gone and I'm no Diana. I'm not who you need right now. You've got to be kidding me. I see, eh? I used every encryption known to man. Who are these guys? The best. It's only a matter of time before they get lucky. We need to take them down. You and which army? I know where the agency stores its files, mission reports, client data. If we leak it to the public. You want to whistleblow the ICA? It's the path of least resistance. Turns out, you are who I need right now, Olivia. I do this, and I'm out. So, what are we breaking into? Data facility in Chongqing, China. Run by a man called Hush. Of course. The ICA site in Chongqing houses the agency's data storage and analyst division. Needless to say, security is daunting. The state-of-the-art server vault is biometrically wired to the facility's two overseers, Imogen Royce, behavioral analysis pioneer, and Hush, a data security guru with a taste for fringe transhuman experimentation. Tell me about Hush. A former cyber terrorist with the Ministry of State Security in Kedanyang, who fled his country after one of the Po regime's periodic purges. He made a career doing cybersecurity for dark web deplorables, human traffickers, organ harvesters, scum like him, with no code or conscience. ICA sure can pick him. No offense. Can you disable security? A dual authentication protocol ensures that any handling of data must be directly authorized by Hush and Royce. The proverbial human factor device to make the system impenetrable. Luckily, I found a loophole. If both overseers should unexpectedly die within a short space of time, the system reverts to a temporary fail-safe protocol, which I can bypass. Take them off the board, and you'll have free access to the data core. And I'll handle the rest. And you're sure it'll work? Look, I know, Hush. If I'm wrong, we won't live long enough to regret it. All right. I will leave you to prepare sweet hmm, okay let's go right in there
Excuse me. Chongqing, China. This city is Big Brother's wet dream with more than 2.5 million cameras covering 15 million people. Jesus. Privacy is a four-letter word in this place. It's pretty ironic that a cloak and dagger organization like the ICA keeps its most valuable secrets here. You'll find Hush conducting his fringe experiments in an abandoned apartment building. While Imogen Royce, the archivist, runs the day-to-day -day business of the ICA data facility. I just hope you know what you're doing, 47. Time to attack the former employer again. <laughs> oh my god, this looks so good. Oh, why is this why I think Cyberpunk should look like this? <laughs> oh no. Oh, this is where Cyberpunk is Cyberpunk. <laughs> We're literally in China right now. Oh my man, yo, 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 yo. Oh my goodness, this is actually a pretty substantial building. Oh my goodness, okay. It's probably best to go after Hush first, I'm gonna take it. No, for a place that's literally covered in cameras, I don't see any. What is this? Why is it saying just in here? Weird. That's our building. But I'm assuming these fucks are not gonna let me through. Clearance, mister. Please, don't waste my time. Oh, it's from Jersey. I'll get in there. What's up, bro? My knee is so sore. Why that? I fell over because a homeless woman suddenly jumped up right in front of me. She was hiding in a hole with cardboard covering her. I nearly stepped right through. Wow. So I was laying back. My knee hurting like hell, and she started yelling something about me stealing her car. Wonder how do I get into this building? Jeez. Oh, this looks so good. Oh yeah, Cyberpunk should look like this, my guys. I love the neon. Wait, what? Ooh, they're literally like raped beneath me. They're so good. Wait, what's this? I'm gonna be raped. Get the hell out of here. I got this plan. And it says I can make a lot of money to be in some experiment. They don't want people like us for that sort of thing. No, they only want people like us. The flyer says so. That means it's too dangerous uh, the money for smiley people. emoji. <laughs> oh, I'm going. This is my chance. That's got hush written all over it. Using the desperate for personal gain. Maybe this is a way for you to get to the bastard. Hmm. Okay. Just need to find out where he is. Uh, the flyer has a symbol on it.
the block. Feeling left out in the cold, not sure you're needed in the world anymore. Well, think again. Your relationship with the future of reality. Proud to invite you to contribute to a once in a lifetime initiative. To give you a purpose and great reward, locate our facility by finding the icon in this pamphlet, and the future is around the corner. Just like us. Okay. The symbol is literally. The symbol is literally the original. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Um, if you guys don't know, that box icon, that was the original logo for the channel. That's actually really funny. That's that's actually kind of jokes. It's very similar to it. Oh my goodness. That's funny. Okay. So I need to find I need to find a, that box. If I'll get a house, I'm never going on the rain again. Disguise yourself as a homeless person. I see. Oh shit. Well, my best bet's gonna be this guy. He's kind of wandering off on his own. Oh, what the fuck? No. I'm gonna be rich. Rich, you hear? Then you won't look at me like I'm filled. No, you won't. You like me? I'm not looking at you. I know what you're thinking. <laughs> but who's gonna be on top then, huh? Me. I can buy shit. Food. I can take out your girl if I want to. Hey, listen. Ignore him. He's crazy. Come on. Just let it go. Why okay. not? Yeah. I should get a girl. Whatever. He's crazy. A nice one. I'll scrub up. Get real. It's too bad. A lot of society yeah. think that all homeless people are crazy. They're not. Homeless people are definitely not crazy. what happens when society and nor you see enough they ignore you and then they demonize you the only thing is this gentleman is in a really bad spot mm. If you're saying for me to show my face, I don't have uh, I don't have it set up for tonight, my uh, face cam. But if you look through the channel, there's plenty of videos where you see my face. I'm trying to think what was. Want to go to a restaurant with me? I'm gonna be rich. I'll take you somewhere nice. I don't think so. You're lost. Just don't come begging. You have your chance. I'm trying to think what was the last uh, what was the last stream I did with the uh, face cam. It's one of the last. It's one of the last few streams. If you look through the channel, one of the last few streams. Actually, it was actually it was last time. Now that I think about it, it was last time. I did a stream, Call of Duty and uh, Rogue Company. Some games I do the face cams, and some games I don't. For a game like Hitman, eh, it's not really, not really needed. Dang, this dude's going. This dude's going for a walk. Uncomfortable. I wish we didn't have to do all this cloak and dagger stuff every day to get to work. Shh, we can't talk about that stuff up here. Oh, jeez, no one's listening. I'm gonna head in and change into something more comfortable. Coming? I'll be in a second. I can exactly see where the game wants me to do this, okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. If you look at the last stream we did yesterday, you'll see my face there.
That was close. Oh my god. Find the entrance to the homeless shelter. So it's not a crazy big area. Was that the code? Is that what she was saying? I didn't. I wasn't even paying attention to that at all. Thank you. Hopefully that will be the code. That'll be sweet. That'll be helpful. Zero one one eight. Guard protocols are clearly wait. Guard patrols are clearly looking for something on the roof of the laundry. What could they be searching? Okay, A little side thing I can do. Oh hey, look, the textures are not loaded in. <laughs> look at the textures; they're all gone for the washing machines. What the fuck? This is the way. I d wait a minute. I wonder. This is probably for the a different building, but let me see. Let's see. Oh, Tang with the info. So, one of Imogen Royce's drones is down. If you find and scan it, maybe I can get something useful out of its chip. Yeah, definitely, bug. Oh, yeah. Look away, guys. Come on. Look away. Lee Hong of Pawn Shop. Ron Jun's not coming in? Yeah. I guess I can cover his shift. Will do. Hey, Rifle. Up for another four hours with me in the rain? Yeah. Thought not. You hear him above me, okay. Oh, 
I didn't even not see this. It's right here. This thing is hooked up to Royce. Pings her if it's damaged. I can use a transfer from this one, but if you take down a couple more, I might be able to piggyback the message and gain access to Royce's phone. If only you had a sniper rifle, this would be the perfect vantage point to take down some drones. Yes, ma'am. But all I do need is something to chuck at that dude's head. That's what I need. What's this? We got some ammo for the sniper rifle right here. I need something to throw at him, unless that dude moves, but I don't think he is. Yeah, he's kind of... Mm. Stupid, there's not like a wrench or something up here. Okay. Just need something to huck at his head. Is there anything back here? Oh, yes! Blessed. Okay. Like a sack of bricks. Necessarily need his uh, uniform at the moment. I guess it wouldn't help. It wouldn't hurt. Oh, I can easily slap back into the other one. That's going to do that. Drop him in there. There we go. I think it's cool. A little tram. Do, 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 do. Oh, dude, I see them. And that's all of them, okay. There's no way for me to steady this shot, is there? Oh, God. I'm in. I just need to lock down the random sequence. Give me a second. Damn, Millie had it. I need you to shoot more drones, and I'll lock the link. Oh, did I hit the fence, really? Oh my god, I'm terrible. That sway is pretty bad. Too bad I can breathe, like the whole breath or anything like that. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. I wish I could... Is there no way for me to, like, breathe in this? Like, to, to um, hold my breath at all? Wow. 
Not a single button. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try this again. Unbelievable. Thank you, Christ. Got a lock. We can now listen in on Royce's phone calls. Now I'm just angry. <laughs> I'm just shooting. Ah, whatever. Oh, it wants me. It wants nice me to shot. shoot. Keep it up and maybe Royce will make an appearance. Oh, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. For this section, let me just use my mouse. <laughs> oh my god, it still has the, the, the terrible sway though. God, it's so bad. We may get more than we bargained for if you take care of those drones near Hush. Oh, oh shit, oh shit. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, I'm trying. Buddy. Buddy, how do you even do this spot? Oh, 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 oh.
Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I love the cat. Oh, goodness, okay. So it says here, shoot the drones. Ah, uh, drones near the block. Ouch. Okay. Shoot the, shoot the drones near the block. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ah, hello there. Oh, that's weird, I still haven't found the um where the homeless shelter is. I don't know where the homeless shelter's at. I would assume it would be probably pretty pretty close to where these guys were. Um Let's go ahead and move. How's that Sorry. leg healing up? You be doing all that shit with resistance bands? That's bugging me a bit, but I'll live. This is the building where all this shit's going down. This is the building. This is all this this crazy stuff's going down right here. Uh, what's up? Dang. Ooh, this one's going to be hard. Shoot, I actually have to go towards that room. Recruitment drone. Hush has apparently found the perfect test subjects for us. You know, I just took it. I didn't even need to sneak around here. I'm really sorry, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to let you pass. Orders, you know. Asshole. You'll never come through here as long as I'm alive. Now get the fuck out of my face. As I said, I'm really sorry. Come in and take a seat. Sorry to inform you that we have all the test subjects we'll need for tonight. But you're welcome to fill in your information now and come back tomorrow. A guard is waiting outside the door. He'll escort you out of the building when you're done. Help yourself to an apple. Be a trouble. I do need my vitamins. I'm just tired. I haven't slept much lately. My back is killing me. I'm not as young as I used to be. Yo, what's up, bro? I'm kind of confused. Because, like, I thought I was supposed to come here. Oh, now I'm trespassing. Now I'm trespassing, apparently.
Now I am very much confused. Because why why did it say I can't come this way now? I come through now. I still have the apple in my hand. <laughs> There's a camera like right here. You know, I enjoy your company. That's nice. Me too. Yeah, that last guy wouldn't shut up about the experiment. A thousand questions an hour. And what are those experiments about? That guy over here stuff, but I, I don't understand half of it. Man, mind control. Just, it is a little freaky though. Those homeless. I've seen how she can pull their arms and spine. Something about his mind the machine. He talks straight to it with his brain, that's all. Yeah, he's weird. With his condition, the projects, and him being hooked up to the facility with that implant. Is that for real? It's for real. Not that big of a deal. It's where we're all going. Live long and prosper. Come on, game. Come on. Come on, game. Didn't do anything wrong here. I wonder, what happens if I just sit here? I'm sorry, I'm complaining so much. But I just think I deserve not to always be the one who works late. Weird. Very strange, very weird. But at least I know that one dude. That, that dude's attainable. Like, I'll, I'll grab him. Get him. As soon as that dude's go over there, or this guy goes over there, yeah, if you want to call it that word, I guess. <laughs> they call me Big J for a reason. Big J be big. I knew I could do it. I don't know why the game. Ah. 
to go. I was like a second too late on that. Can I be in here? Yes, I can. Oh shit, that guy's looking. Love the banter. Very good. So we're going to go over here. Yo, the amount of dudes in here is crazy. Whoa. Bro, you gotta go back to the stream. I just, I just said, yeah, I'm a big guy. I don't remember this headache. Let's move on. Where did you grow up? That's easy. I grew up in. I don't remember. What is this? Please stay calm. Have a little break, and we'll pick this up in a few minutes. We're making history. Hmm, interesting. Sup, Tang? That's what happens when you when you start when you start doing that. You don't like that stuff over here. No toxicity. That's what happens. Simple as that. Alrighty. What the fuck's is happening here? Oh shit, the camera's like right there. Modify my system. Follow the follow. Amplify. Link impulse play. Point zero two two to its final mode. Load suggestion. Motor control. Forty one point eight. Execute. Test that 
Hmm, interesting. Hmm, I don't know. Already got one, I think. Never know when you need extra screwdrivers. Oh my god, do you see? This is like a floating texture here. Identify memory lock at night. Have left. Next memory lock at four. Load gesture. Motor control. 44.1. Test route hate 109 initiated. There has to be a way I can overload this dude, right? Another way into that room, though. Wait a minute. No, there isn't. Okay. I'm sure you'll be ready in a few moments. Come out and find me, and we'll get it over with in no time. Be pilled, Dan. I'll be like you. Okay. There has to be a way I can fuck with him while he's in that machine there. Too hard, Hush. If you keep this up, it could permanently damage you. I think you need to take a break. I'll be the judge of that. First, I need to compile the results. Then, I'll see if I need a break. This would be jokes. How 
do you witness that? <laughs> How do you witness that? Is there a crowbar in your face? <laughs> Damn, man. You know what? I'm almost positive I can do this, though. I'm almost positive I can do this. That's jokes. He's like, well, you guys keep chugging change at me. Damn. There must be a way I can get that guy out of that spot. Like, silently, of course. Hey, get a load of Einstein over here. Oh my god, I fucking apple at him. Nani? <laughs> Nani? That is too funny. <laughs> he opens the door, what the fuck? Damn, maybe I can't do anything about it then. Without, without of course, shooting him in the face. Which is kind of like, not the point. Oh, shit. That sucks. Or a few cell? Okay. Confidence is babbling. I can't stand this level of incompetence. What's going on? They think he's this elite. I need some cheering. Too much of it. Interesting. I 
one directly outside. Oh, there wasn't, okay. Interesting. So I can go the one way, but I can go the other way. Oh, shit, that was close. Oh, it doesn't even matter. I missed my opportunity to do it anyways. I don't know why they all float like that. That's so weird. Dang, man. Well, that guy has some damn good vision. But I don't see um, any exposed fuse that I can that I can just straight up like use. Yeah, hey, that's what I got. The red laser was right there. Oh, that's okay. Oh, I'm confused. <sighs> Boy, I'm almost seven and a half hours here. Jeez. I need a fuse really bad.
my chance. I can't do it. It doesn't feel right. I don't think I want to do it. It just feels <laughs> I feel like I'm missing some stuff here. Like I feel like me me doing this, um, like I don't have the fuse to fuck them over on the other side, but I, mean, I don't know. Let's see here. If I go back to mirror. Unless I'm doing it too quick. That's just a possibility. What's up, bro? Came back, eh? My goodness, you must be so damn tired right now. Load suggestion. Motor control. 44.1. Execute. Oh, this headache. Identify memory marker 90. Amplify. Amplify. Link memory marker 40. Load suggestion. Motor control 44.1. Execute. Test that hit 109 in Signal strength at 40 percent confirmed. Since you left, it's this is the uh, next mission right afterwards. I think there's only four missions in this game, if I'm not wrong. And this one's crazy, man. Look how big this map is. It's massive. It's like you're literally in like a city in China. It's crazy. My target is literally right in front of me right now. I'm just trying to figure out when I can hit him. When I can strike at him. Good evening. Where's the final test subject? Everything is ready to conclude the motor control phase of my experiment. He's in the bathroom. Having second thoughts about signing up. Make him come out. I'm trying. But maybe it's good for you to have a bit of a break before you start the final experiment. Okay, here we go. There is a new game that just came out a few days ago. What game is it, bro? Check that out right now, bro. Watch it out. The medium. Um. Oh, let's see. Oh, 
dude, I've seen this on Steam. It was like on the front page of Steam. Yo, it looks, it looks creepy. Looks good. Looks good. I didn't recognize the name, but yeah, the as soon as I seen the picture, yeah, this is so cool. Oh man, it has nine out of ten stars. Wow. Discover a dark mystery only a medium can solve. Ah, like I, I actually seen this. I seen it on Steam. Um, I was actually interested in uh, buying it too. Might be a good one to do a stream on. I need that woman to come over here. Maybe I can just speak to her. Is E and I'm A. You're done for now. Come on. Right. I'm so glad you decided to go ahead with it. You know, you're gonna be part of something truly amazing. He's a genius, Hush. And Vic, he's ready for you, Hush. He looks strong. Please, I need space. He looks strong. Good. A good specimen to conclude this phase. We'll get started. So, the test subject came to his senses, I see. Good. Just a lay. Yes. We're about to perform the final test of this project. Yeah, I feel like I needed that fuse. Take I needed that fuse. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Ready when you are. Jinli, let's start at 100% signal strength. No. I mean, no, there's no need. The subject is clean, cooperative. I was thinking 25% and then adjust if necessary. 60% is minimum. We'll get no motor control below, and I'm not wasting my time. Uh, but... 60. Log concluding experiment H109 initiated. Run calibration 60%. Signal strength 60% confirmed. H109 initiated. Load suggestion. Motor control. 44.1. Execute. The signal's too low. The signal's too weak. We'll get nothing like this. Go to 100%. It's not safe. You've been working too hard. With your condition, it can cause you real physical harm. It's safe. You're strong. You can overcome it. 100% do it. Long so if this part doesn't work, then I need... Run calibrations. Yeah, they're, they're crazy long. H109 initiated at 100% signal strength. Now I'll see. Identify impulse string. Load suggestion motor control. 44.1. Execute. It's too low. He's got spirit. I can get to him. Just need to focus. God damn it. Not again. Nothing. He is a strong one. Come on. Do this. Abort. You're going too far. No. He's on the verge to break 
reach him. Go higher. It'll kill him. It's already way beyond reasonable intensity. This subject is abnormally resistant. <laughs> Nothing worth shit ever came to be without pain. I am calling it quits, Hush. You need rest. Okay, okay. A short break. Uh, I'll return with a clear head. God damn that assistant. If they've upped the signal, it will kill him. Stay here, okay? Don't even think about getting cold feet again, please. I'll stick around. Damn. There's no way for me to subdue her. Because Buddy's just looking straight at me. Mm -hmm. So, okay. So, in this mission right here, um, there's two targets that we have to take out. One of, them is con one of them is doing mind control experiments on homeless people. And the other one is, like, some, like, crazy, like, some crazy chick. Um... um the whole mission is that you have to kill both targets uh, within a reasonable amount of time to get a to gain access to a mainframe that's actually connected to them biologically, if that makes any sense. Um, super weird concept for a mission, um, but so far, like I think I may have accidentally skipped the part here. You can see that I have my stuff in the top corner there. I was supposed to shoot some more drones and stuff, but um, yeah, there's also a fuse I'm missing. Yeah, go, go, go. Leave. Leave this area. Go. No! Don't meow. Gosh dang it, dude. I wonder. Wait, I wonder. Do you think. Wait a minute. If I was to lure her into that space right there. Wait, please don't come back around super quickly. Right. I'm so Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, baby. There, you guys can mingle. I'll, I'll leave you on his on his ass. <laughs> Give me back my coins. These are valuable things. Oh, I'm so happy I got that one dude out of there. My god. Before, you couldn't get that... You couldn't get his bodyguard to leave before. I'll go down to see Sister Lin. I could technically kill him right now. There's absolutely nothing to, to stop me from that. But I want to kill him with this. This would be really cool if I could slaughter him with this. Yeah, where's your, where's your buddy? Yeah, it was your friend. You don't got your friend anymore now, do you? No, you don't. <laughs> what is it, Royce? You know very well that the protocol requires us to have visual contact every third core authorization we make. I, I can see. 
That makes no sense, Tush. Damn you. I need to fill out the forms with you acting like a The, the person that he's talking to right now, that's the other target. You benefit too. It frees up time to think and your prediction algorithms. Don't pretend you're not happy without any setup. Well, you saw me. Now I get to go. Sweet. Okay. Can I talk to you directly to start this or no? I can't. Shit. Okay, so is this gonna just cycle again? Okay, so he's gonna go down, he's gonna go talk to her, blah, blah, blah. he's gonna come back up, then we can get going. Let me get started. Sorry, sir, I cannot let you through. I've got my orders. That's pretty funny, so like I can't technically leave here, so that's that's fine. Um, the thing that kinda sucks too, um, before I got up here unknown, um, there is a room back here. It's like a therapy room where there's this fuse box right here, but I don't have a fuse. I kind of looked around the general area. I couldn't find one. There's also this weird floating texture on all these boxes for some reason. But um, I believe I can kill him inside this room as well. Like you can see, I killed the one guard that was in here as well, uh, from before. But it really does suck that I don't have... Um, that I do not have that fuse because I could have got him inside this room as well. Oh, I could have actually hit his body in here. That's fine. Cool. I also got this manual now, too. But yeah, it's kind of too bad. But the thing I am going to be doing for sure is pretty much every single mission I've played tonight. Ooh, I can gas them all, too. Um, the, uh, what I'm gonna do with all these get, all these missions is that. Oh, hi. Where's Jun Li? Never mind her. I'll take over. <laughs> Let's pick it up where we left off, Mister Lin. At the safe signal strike. Yes, one hundred percent. I feel strong. I can take him. I don't know if you can, my dude. <laughs> Unless it had to do with those fuse, but that's in another room. I'm pretty sure me doing this right here is gonna kill him. Continuing experiment H109. Run calibration 100%. Signal strength 100%. It's in danger mode right now. Sweet. H109 initiated. Now I'll see what he does. Identify a pulse screen. Load suggestion motor control 44.1. Execute. We need to go higher. Quiet. Ugh. Get nowhere like this. I don't understand. No one's ever resisted like this before. Let's increase the signal and get some results. <laughs> Do the same. Do 120%. Oh, he's gonna die. We're gonna zap his goddamn brain. Okay, big boy. Let's do it. <laughs> Experiment H109. Run calibration 120%. H109 continued. 120% signal strength confirmed. Yes. This is it. It's all incredibly sharp. I feel my mind expanding. Identify impulse screen. No suggestion. Motor control 44.1. Execute. You're dead, bud. I... I feel... I'm not scared of you. I could... You got the bastard, Hush. Huh? Now go get Imogen oh, Royce and we can get to the core. Get... Oh, don't fucking die on me. Shit. Da-da-da-da-da-da, yeah. <laughs> weren't it? You know... You know, see, I did miss that story mission, so I did skip a part here, but that was pretty damn funny. <laughs> oh, can I sneak the camera while we're following this guy, too? Uh, yeah, there we go. That's pretty funny. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, it would have been funny if they would have just done like a little piss stain. <laughs> Somebody should freaking mod that part. Oh my god. Just mod it where he gets a piss stain, a little, a little at the end there, you're good. <laughs> oh shit, this camera, regardless, this camera is seeing me. Damn it. God damn it. I'm fast. I'm the persistence. I was probably in this area for, ooh, I want to say at least 40 minutes. This this took a lot just to sit here and just wait for things to go. At least it's not like the last mission, though, where I just kept uh, abysmally failing. I think I only, like, failed, like, a, I only reloaded, like, a few times, and that was me screwing around with one guard trying to figure out if I could knock him out. Oh, so I'm just supposed to dip. Okay, cool. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. Um, there's only one problem, though. I need to actually... I do need to... No, maybe I don't. No, actually, I don't. I don't. I don't at all need to go over there. The block. Good to know. So, when I come back, when I do this mission all over again... So, it was on the opposite side of the wet cat laundry. So, pretty, pretty damn close to the beginning of the mission. Cool. I'm gonna get out of this weird garb thing. I'm pretty sure my suit's just over here, and then we can go and get the next target. Where is the other target? Ah, oh, down below, yeah, okay. Cool, so one down, one to go. <laughs> this is what Cyberpunk should have looked like. People do stay knocked out for quite some time. Um, not that I'm going to be holding on to this suit uh, or this uh, disguise for very long. Um, I do believe the, the building we need to go to, one of the entrances is just located below here. So we're going to go down there. Oh, hello. Hello, indeed. Hey, you. That's right. So, wait a minute, where was that overpass thing that I saw? This is a part of the side mission, too. So, someone is here for a tour of the facility. Might be a way to get in. Cool. Just let me know when you're ready. This is food might require a final touch. I do like that. Did you bring the P41 we left for you in the apartment? No. I wasn't informed that I should. Oh. Very sorry, Mr. Pritchard. We need you to bring the P41 to get the tour. It's procedure. Please pick it up before you come and find me. I'll be waiting by the stairs in the back of the restaurant kitchen. Just the reason I forgot to forgot to form in his apartment across the street from the restaurant. He needs to bring it to this facility before you can take him on a tour. Easy enough. Can reach out. You can reach out. He's damn. The VIP has access to the kitchen. I'll be waiting for him in the back. Understood. Hey, hurry up. The man is starving. Yes, I'll see to it. Why did that? Wait a minute. What the fuck? Wait a minute.
That was weird. I don't know. I have to re-listen to that later on. It sounded like a, the voice actor for that sounded awfully familiar. For you, man. He's probably sterilizing all the surfaces himself. <laughs> was such a, oh my god. That was such an immediate like no. <laughs> oh, look at me, I could <laughs> Goodness gracious, that's pretty funny. Oh, what? <laughs> Load. <laughs> oh, yeah, wrong floor. <laughs> Evening, ladies. Ah. I don't believe this is going to be the same code as before. Oh, my God, it was. Hello, Mr. Pritchard. I just learned that your plane will be delayed beyond the lifetime of the entry code you received for the facility. For your convenience, we've set up the new code to be 0118 to match the one for your <laughs> Right. <laughs> I hope you enjoy your stay. Hi, Chen Ping here. Mr. Pritchard, I'm just calling to tell you to bring your P41 for the facility tour. Thank you. Mr. Pritchard, I just read your report and share your concerns regarding facility leadership behavior. I fully back your decision to inspect, and I would appreciate updates on your initial findings as they come in. Good job. Oh, you got new menus. I had no idea. Uh, do you still have the... Uh... Oh, God, that's so annoying. I Oh, man, I've had that happen to me before. Right. Yeah. God, that's annoying. By the way, guys, don't do that. Don't go ahead and call somebody, then have their answering machine pick up, and then be like in a restaurant doing an order. I've actually had that happen to me. Very, oh, man. The disrespect. I'm not going to say who it was, but absolutely garbage when that happens. <laughs> God, that is just... Mm. That hits home. That hits home. I remember. Oh man, I do. I ever remember something that exactly like that happening to me. It's so annoying. <laughs> uh, I believe I got everything I can from this uh, this apartment here. So, describe yourself as the board member. I shall. What's inside here? I'm guessing this is just the washroom. And he's gonna probably come here. I'm gonna go poison him. Let's go ahead and find a chef. Now, the thing is, you know what, I kind of missed an opportunity early on, but <clears throat> there was a way we could actually grab one of their, one of these dudes on their own. So, the miss these missions do tend to kind of cycle, um, at least that's something that I've noticed, at least, at least from the last part that I was doing, that things do cycle a little bit. So, I'm going to double check just to see if the chefs came back out here. They did not. Okay. There was, like... Well, that's clipping pretty bad. Uh, there was a thing early on where, like, there was a chef completely on his own. Actually, these chefs right here. There's a stairwell that's right there that actually leads up. Interesting. These dudes are not really paying attention. The only problem I have, though, is that there is that woman just, like, looking right here. Shit. Damn. I was not counting on that, though. And I'm fairly confident that they're gonna... They're gonna hear me do do that. Hungry after the nine hour flight delay. 
I'll give him the tour of the facility when he joins me. Yeah, I'll keep you updated. Sure thing. Get off your phone. Leave. Leave the area. Leave the area. Leave the area, Spin. Same here. Mr. Pritchard is in the restaurant. Is it just going to cycle this conversation? For the tour, but I'll wait for him here. No, he's lost his luggage and wants to handle that first. Of course. I, I will. Thank you. Damn, man. She's not going to leave this. Shoot. Dang. Oh, good thing my boy's strong. My boy's strong. He can lift himself right up. I was really, really hoping that I could do that. Do, 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 do. Let's turn the corner here. Hope you're well. The boys are here. But this guy's going to be chilling here, too. Lots of people in this restaurant, though. Ah, uh, hmm. I was lucky I came in here. How am I supposed to focus while the kitchen feels like a train station? Yes, why you're eager to stand. I need for that chef to be right there. <laughs> Come on. Come on, dude. Because I'm sure I could poison his food. Serve it up. And it'll be perfect. He'll go to the washroom. We'll kill him. We'll throw his body in there. Bada bing, bada boom. And then we'll have uh, everything we need. God damn it. Well, everybody's kind of looking the other way. Okay, let's see what his next movement is. Then, then we'll act. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god, thank you. Oh, yeah. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Alrighty. So he should get nice and sick. My god, is that man taking a long time to get that food?
a hair in my suit. <laughs> I love that. Oh. Come on. No need to hold it back. <laughs> How do you not recognize this is not the same man? Like, he doesn't have a hat on or anything, he's bald now. Anyways. I'm ready to inspect the facility now. Good. I hope you enjoyed the food. Did you bring the P-41 we left for you in the apartment? Yes, I have everything I need. Good. Let's continue the tour. Continue, you may say. We haven't even started the tour yet. But we have. Without you even noticing it, Mr. Pritchard. Invisibility is the best security there is. You see, the restaurant is in fact a front for all ICA personnel alive unseen. Who notices a dumpling cook on his way to work? Dressing the part takes you a long way. ICA guarantees absolute discretion to all clients. We take that promise very seriously, as you will see on all steps of the tour. Let's step inside. Doesn't look like much, does it? Miss Chen and visitor, welcome. Please report to security desk for visitor sign in. Will do. I love the facility AI. It's really looking out for us. And we're in. The inside is a self contained modular bill that can be disassembled and removed in less than 12 hours if we are compromised. No trace will ever hit. I agree. Leaving no trace behind is the only sensible ammo. The outside shell is a building marked for demolition. We've got a hold on it with city planning. A deliberate misplacement of the order. But have people in place to rectify that. At first shift, city construction will move in. Our policy around ICA personnel is that they are a resource, but also a risk. On top of contractual repercussions if breaches occur. We perform detailed vetting on everyone. The first, blunt vetting, is a frisk. We have, of course, never had any employees trying to bring unauthorized weapons inside the facility. But we do consider the step important. I'll need to start the setup of your visitor security clearance here, Mr. Pritchard. I need your P-41 to start the clearance procedure. I'll get the procedure started. It'll just be a few moments, so feel free to have a look around. I'll meet you on the other side of the frisk. Naturally, you'll have to be frisked like everyone else. No exceptions, Mr. Pritchard. You can use your camera to hack that panel. That was dumb. Ugh. So I could dump one in, but I can't. <sighs> Who's better, 007 James Bond or Agent 47? Um, Agent 47. I'm gonna say Agent 47. You can hack that panel with your camera, 47. Dude, I have so many guns on me. No. And the reason why I say Agent 47 
is that the man literally has no emotions. You know what I mean? Like, um, for the most part, there's nothing that he, um, that he, like, holds true and dear. At least not very much. So, it's not like, it's not like Bond who has, like, that intuition, like, oh, I need to save this person or that person or this person. Agent 47 is just 100%. He's just going to go ahead and do his job. Whatever job it might be. Boys, we might have a problem here. Oh, yeah. I don't think we have enough trash bins in this building. I got many guns. <laughs> I picked up many weapons as of we've gone through. You know what, though? Um... I'm going to see. I hope this is not going to fail the mission. I'm going to leave. When it comes to, like, being suave, obviously, like, James Bond has that. You know, you get your ladies, he gets the ladies, everything like that. You know. But in terms of, like, a true, a true, like, a assassino, it's definitely going to be a... It's definitely going to be a Agent 47. We're going to see if that does it. I'm wondering... Ah, oh man. You know what? It's it's kind of conflicting because I know like older games, like when you get frisked, things like the garage wire would, would get you caught. So let's see. Welcome. Please follow the gray line to security check. Thank you. Yeah, 47, he's really like a secret agent. He don't reveal it. And on the other hand, is literally... On the other hand, Double Seven, literally every stranger he be, he loves James Bond. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, ex exactly. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> yeah, good job being an agent, Bond. You just give your your info away. Oh my God. <laughs> I never took that in. Uh, he's a secret agent. My name is Bond, James Bond. Like, come on, man. <laughs> Let's see if this fails. Okay, that Go, sir. Thank you. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. He also does his drinks wrong too. He always he always says shake and not not stirred, and actually you're never supposed to shake that drink. It's always supposed to be stirred. I was already caught on camera, wasn't I? So it doesn't matter, I have to go through here. <laughs> um, am I supposed to actually keep following that woman? I don't even know. There's no way you're getting through that door 47. It only opens for people with an authentic security clearance. The signal is encrypted. Without a dongle, we can't hack it. If you had the right dongle, you could hack that panel, 47. What is it, Jamie? What's wrong? I don't know. I'm just worried about the scan. What? But why? It's just something you walk through. You've done it a hundred times. It... Scan initiated. Scanning all body systems. Scanning hormonal profile. Scanning chemical profile. Scan complete. Thank you for your patience. That to me is... That to me is very weird. So you do this whole scan. You have this great big organization that's supposed to prevent people from getting in. Yet, how do they not have a profile on 47? 
when he used to work for this. Oh my god, that makes no sense. That part actually doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. Oh, look at me. Oh, man, I look fresh. That panel can be hacked with your camera if you have the correct dongle. I need dongly dongs, eh? Yeah, and how they don't have any pictures of the real person. You know, the biggest thing is, the the biggest giveaways is barcode. You know what I mean? From the program. I, I don't get it. And it's kind of funny, because like, I remember like an absolution. He tried to... I'm almost positive. Well, did he not try to cut that off? Was that is that no longer canon that he, that he removed his barcode? Turn on photocopier. Tier 1. Okay, we got Tier 1s now. I don't believe I need to go... Does it really matter if I go this way or that way? Okay. Alrighty then. So, she is located... down below. Interesting. Once again, silly analysis. That's jokes. Okay, that's all that was. <laughs> we have the best security systems in the world. Throws mashed potatoes at door, the door comes down. I don't even know why I took you down, dude. I just wanted to. <laughs> oh, I didn't even have to take him down, but it's fun. Dump. doing this mission correctly because you would imagine that that woman that led me in here would be like where did uh you know like where did he go <laughs> he just disappeared how about, that rain? how about that rain indeed hello hello blast oh <laughs> blast all right If you use your camera, you can hack that panel. Oh, yes, yes. Panel. You sure? Do I need... Are you sure I need to use my camera to hack it? Are you sure I can't just use my shoe and open it? Security protocol go. overruled. <laughs> overruled. Okay, where is she? Oh, my God. She's a whole another floor below me. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. Take a look, it's in a book. 
Meeting Rainbow. <laughs> Uh. I already have the tier two, but I'll grab another one. Like a plastic lunch bag can take down a mainframe probably. Let's see. Oh my god, this place is huge. <laughs> so there it is again. <laughs> I don't think I need to use it this time. We got a security office right here though. Oh shit, oh shit, uh... <laughs> There's no way she's just gonna come into this room. Oh my god. Where is he? Oh, he's gone, alright? He left. Don't make me throw an apple at you. I'll do it. He's scaring a crowbar, a camera, a screwdriver, and God knows what else. And the guard still can't find anything. Oh, God, dude. Oh, my God. I worked in security. And trust me, if you do a frisk, really, if you do a, a, a frisk correctly, there's nothing somebody can hide on them. Unless they put it in a spot, you, you know, you know where. But, like... So this dude is they're literally gonna just hang out with her the whole day. Alright. Oh, I'll get you, don't worry. You're making some changes in your private life. Good for you. If it isn't working, fix it, right? What? Oh yeah. knew Vincent's girlfriend was breaking up with him before he did. She's spying on us. All of us. Aren't you on that big social media platform? I'm not sure you have any skills. Still doesn't feel right. This is Royce's room. Interesting. Yeah, keep it real. I will, dude. I'm gonna keep it 100% with you. She's gonna die in there. I just need a way to access that room. Ooh, but I just took in. The guy did go in there with her. Hmm. There's a... Hmm. There, there's something that's in her room that I can access, too. There is a way to get in there. Unless that's disconnected. Let me double check that. Oh, wrong button. No, it's not connected. Okay, never mind. I need a tier 3 dongle for this. Or better <laughs> oh, the best security in the land boys screwdriver <laughs> tier three my ass oh that's so funny oh oh hi what's uh, what you looking at what you looking at? 
Oh, goodness. <laughs> I need one of those uniforms pretty bad, though. And by the way, it's it's pretty crazy that there's absolutely nothing triggering right now either on their security side, because there are there are you know buildings that do have secured locked doors, um, things that require things like dongles, and um, swipe cards, uh, sometimes fingerprint sensors and stuff like that. Usually, there's a monitoring station for that, and any of those things go wrong, there's usually some sort of indication. Of, usually, it'll probably come up as an error, but like, you know, like this right here, like these like things are hooked up to something else that should be reading that there's a problem here. But then again, if it was like that, the game would be pretty boring. Oh my God! Why? Why does it seem like she's always near me? Get out of here. <laughs> she always seems like she's looking at me. I was being like somebody's watching me. And I gotta go ahead and save real quick though. Um, I wanna get this dude in this room. But this is gonna be dicey. This is gonna be a little bit dicey. Okay. You. Hmm. Coin. Yeah, that's quite right, so. It's just me. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I can't I can't get him through that. Okay, let's just Strategically place them. Eh. Eh. Oh, oh, no. oh, 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 oh. There. <laughs> Can you see that from there? Let's see. Hundred <laughs> percent, you can. You know what? It would have actually been better. You know what? It's probably best. If I go ahead. Oh, there's a closet here. Never mind. You're going in here. <laughs> Do you even see the closet? Yeah, that's true. That that's as well. Like that's that's 100 percent There's barely any cameras in this building. Okay, so she's already done her little rotation, but I kinda got everything I need now. I just gotta be kind of careful of, uh, of any enforcers that might be able to spot me. But. I just need a tier 3 dongle over we're blast. Oh! <gasps> That's too funny. Literally, what did I just say to myself? And I and I messed that up. Oh, they're both in the same spot, aren't they? Okay, that's okay. No harm, no foul. Yeah, like I I worked in I worked at a mall, not a very good mall, by the way, kind of a shitty mall to be honest with you. And that mall had over 150 cameras in it. So this big advanced, you know, Star Trek looking building. You know, should have it. Should have at least uh, more than at least more than a hundred in here. Hey, check that out for sure. See, this is why I say I'm functionally blind because, like, how did I miss that? How did I miss this the first time that there was a dude here? Oh, 
no, 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 no. Just in case I flub that up again. Alrighty, uh, none of these guys are like spectre types. So far, my best bet's been her room, but this one dude. This one dude that's hanging out. Oh, I just missed my opportunity too. I got her going to her room, I just missed it. This dude though, I need to like figure it out. Like he's uh, he's definitely a he's definitely a problem. Oh, I was like following her around. Unless let's see, she came down this way. Do 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 do. Ah oh, shit. Shit. <laughs> shit. Sir. Looking awesome, aren't I? I'm looking fresh as fuck. As soon as I get into that room, I'm pretty sure that's where I'm gonna get her. It's just that guy. The guy that's following her is a massive problem, though. So I'm hoping there's gonna be something inside that room. I wish I can booby trap her. Booby trap something inside there where where it's gonna kill her. With me not having to deal with his uh, with her bodyguard, unlike the other guy where I had to. Yeah, I look, good. I look fresh, don't I? There's so many screwdrivers in this game, holy smokes. Uh, research tablet about employees. She's currently studying. Jeremy Vault, sure to arrange a secondary bodyguard before. Make sure to arrange a secondary bodyguard before firing. Well, it's only fire if Jeremy Bolt is at his post. Oh. Sharon Reed, under no circumstances can the safety mechanism be off when she is fired. Wow. Wow. Look at this person, man. She's already setting up all these plans. A Magnar? What the fuck? Jeremy Bolt, guard. Ex-engineer. Wait, whoa, we should have known this was... Fuck this up so bad. Sharon Reed. I regret to inform you that code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I may have just screw this up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh shit, hold up. Uh uh. Where was it? No, where where was it? Do you think
I don't know if I did that in the right order. Human error. Am I still holding this? <laughs> I just I just don't know um, if I um, did that in the correct order or not because there there seemed to have been you know what I'm gonna just to be sure where where was that I know it should be under Intel. That was a one-time view thing, wasn't it? I don't know if I did that, if there was supposed to be a specific order in which I was supposed to fire the people. You know what? I think that was actually the case, to be honest with you. Oh. Dude. You caught, you caught that on, like, right off the... What? Hey, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Was that when I first got into the room? Just want to make sure. I may have done it in the wrong order because it, it seemed like there was supposed to be a very specific order in which people were supposed to be fired or not. So I'm going to just double check that. Um, pick up our handy dandy screwdriver again. Let's go. Oh, okay, this tablet. Why did I not see that before? I'm blind as all. Well. I'm sorry. It was there the whole time. So Alicia Reynolds, Sharon Reed, and then Jeremy Bolt. So did I technically not already? I did it the right way, didn't I? For, no, it's first Jeremy Bolt. Screw you, bad memory. Ah, I'm so bad with it. Wait, no, where was it? So then it's Alicia, then. And then Alicia's next. status. Thank you for your service. Sharon Reed. I regret to inform you that Code 41 is now effective for your employment status. Thank you for your service. Did that happen correctly? Was that correct? I don't know. I have no clue if I did that correctly or not. Ah, shit. Buddy's still there. Did I do it correctly? I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure if I did that correctly or not. Anyways, before I get screwed, 
Let me go ahead and use my advanced technology. There we go. There's a partition that that's in between these two. Because I feel like something should be happening right now. You know what I mean? Like something should be happening. Like something catastrophic should be going down. Like the specific thing where it's like you need to have another guard in place or else this guy's going to go ballistic probably. That That's where I was thinking like, oh yeah, somebody should be like shooting guns or something. <laughs> Oh, wait, really? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Uh, which one? What? Oh, shit. It's this one, right? Let me double check that. Did you notice that you have to hire a new guard? Okay, let me see. Let me see. They all say fire. Oh, I don't know. Shoot. I really, really, really hope she ends up going behind this partition here. <laughs> Just chuck it at her head. I'm going to see what she does. I'm gonna see what she does. Oh no, no worries, man. Like I'm, I'm so bad with some games where I'll miss things. So it's always better to double check. Doesn't matter. You're out of time, and I'm way ahead of you. Combination of big data analysis and micro-targeted surveillance of defining target markers. Yeah. Do me a favor and see what that's about, would you? Copy that. Beautiful. <laughs> just cheese the game so bad. Oh, I just che cheese this game and its mechanics so bad. Oh my god, okay. Awesome, awesome. So here's the thing though. I need to I need to actually get back up. I need to get back up to where where my guns are. Oh, 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 oh it's gonna be too easy. Alright, cool. Um Okay. I need a silenced weapon. I don't have anything lethal on me that's not gonna make a shit ton of noise. So I need to go back up. Uh, hopefully I can navigate this, and hopefully it's going to let me back through those doors. Oh my god. I gotta search you, sir, if you want to come through this way. Are you for real? But I have a gun. Sir, I'm just doing my job. I 
gotta pat you down. Sorry about that. But I have a gun. He's gonna shoot me. And you are good to go, sir. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he's the first guy to get fired. He's the first guy to get fired, man. <laughs> oh, he's the first guy. So we're gonna see we're gonna see if the game's gonna be bullshit here. Oh wait, did I leave my silenced one down there? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> How do you, man, how do you do that? Oh. <laughs> okay, gentlemen. Sir, if you want to pass through, I need to check that you're not carrying. If it doesn't let me go through now, it's going to be really stupid. Because, like, I already had a gun. My mother always said I had good hands. That oh, I should have been a surgeon. You are good to go, sir. Thank you. <laughs> You're the best, bud. Thanks, man. Buy a coffee later, you fucking idiot. <laughs> you stupid idiot. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, we're perfect timing here, guys, too. Look at this. Da -da 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 -da. How are you? Oh, I'm wonderful. <laughs> Uh, oh my god. I feel so stupid. Oh, go gaming YouTube. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the chat, bro. Oh. Yeah, not nothing, nothing different about this room. Oh my God, nothing different at all. Doop. Both targets down. Good. <laughs> Just give me a second. Oh and my God. I'm in. You can now access the core forty-seven. Good job, game. Good job. Oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, I guess I shouldn't have, right? I should have just... My god, I should have walked in there with an RPG and a tank, and we would have been fine. Uh, look at you two. Back together again. <laughs> oh, what a, so, what a bad facility. Oh my god. <laughs> Could you imagine? Could you imagine, man? Like, <laughs> you ran a security company and this happened? Oh man. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the core? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. That actually got to me. That really did get to me. Like this this whole area is supposed to be like this big, you know, fortress of solitude. And like honestly, it doesn't do anything. What's even the, what's even the point of me going through this door when when Buddy there is like an enforcer? Hold up, hold up. Oh God. Security protocol overruled. You know the thing that's occurring to me, maybe possibly. Probably. Maybe it's to do, it has to do with the fact that it's the dude's uniform. Maybe he's allowed to carry weapons, maybe he's authorized for it, but Security my goodness. Overruled. Good, you're alone. <sighs> I'm sealing the room and dimming the windows 47. No need to worry about intruders. Is that poison gas? Clients, 
operatives, every hit the ICA ever sanctioned, enough to shut them down for good. But first, you need to locate all files referencing Diana and yourself. Oh shit, all the people. You go way back. I didn't realize that you. I don't know. I get why you want to protect her. So, wipe all the data referring to the two of you from their system before we publish the rest. set up a link to an information non-profit site. When you press that button, it's up there and the whole world will know. Ooh. There's no undo 47. This will shut the ICA down for good. You really okay with this? It's who you've been for so long. Yep. Maybe it's time for I'll just return things to normal. No need to alert them we were here prematurely. Shit. I missed that. We're blown 47. I can Oh really in on. Hold the doors for a little while. Use the fence to get out. Go now. All personnel. Breach protocol initiated. This is bad. That means they'll shoot on sight. I'm gonna create some havoc 47. Make the core meltdown. Maybe we'll divert their attention a bit. This is sick. <laughs> That'd be so meta if the yeah, if the game just stopped. <laughs> Done. <laughs> oh, it just removes the game entirely. <laughs> it detects whether or not you had any other uh, Hitman games on your computer and removes it. This is going to take us right up to her room, isn't it? Right 
detected. Do you think they want to frisk me when I leave? We've done good so far. Nobody's seen us yet. Nobody's seen us yet, so. Warning. Nothing here. Fire detected. Moving on. Oh, it's a dump vent. Okay. No fucking way am I coming out to the front door. No way. Was tens forty seven. <laughs> oh, that's so dumb. <laughs> that's so funny. Wow. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, it ripped away! <laughs> it's like the most, like... <laughs> like, <laughs> like the... It's such a badass, like, moment, and then just peace out the way I did is too funny. I missed a lot of stuff on this one. Look how much you could have done in this. Like, wow. I still got 35,000, even though I, I, you know, I botched a huge amount of the missions, to be honest with you. The very beginning part, there was, there was like two missions that I could have done, but I kind of bypassed it when I went straight to Hush first. So, there's definitely more to, more to, I, more that I could have gotten is what I'm trying to say. I've been sitting here for a long time, <laughs> getting tired. So yeah, I only got three stars on this one too, jeez. Yeah, sweet. Hey, BDX, how you doing? Welcome to the uh, welcome to the stream. 
Oh, you just missed a crazy, crazy mission of stupidity. <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. It's so funny. Restaurant back stairwell. Hidden stash. Okay, sick. now the balls are your court miss burnwood i do have other candidates you know most of whom have never tied me to a chair you've seen the news that was 47 acting on his own he is untethered he is unstoppable and he cannot be bargained with he will find you mr edwards and i'm the only chance you've got i'm listening 47 has one weakness me. Me. Bitch, I will shoot you. <laughs> I will pop you in the face. Yo, there's one more. There's another mission. Oh, what? <laughs> That's awesome. No way. There's a whole other one. Yeah, it's sick. I actually thought that was the last one. I was gonna leave it on the cliffhanger. I'm gonna pop this bitch in the face. <laughs> Old habits. All right. Let's see. I found something. Buenos Aires International Airport this morning. Now watch this. Harold. Trail ends at the airport, but turns out that a top Providence operative owns a vineyard in the area. Don Yates of infamous New York law firm Morgan Yates and Cohn. And get this, it's hosting his retirement. Why does that look like Trump's today. dad? That's weird. She's infiltrated them. She's sending a message. She needs my help. Next two hours passed. <laughs> Going after her. You'll need to deal with the Herald. Her name's Tamara Vidal, former CIA me, political firebrand. She's a master of surveillance and the constant's most trusted aide. She'll have eyes everywhere. You won't get far as long as she's in the game. Why are you telling me this? I thought you were out. Yeah. Old habits, I guess. Anyway, I I need to go. See you around, 47. No, you won't. Ooh, ominous. That's the objective. All right. I was, I actually thought I was going to be ending the stream here, but I'm in. Let's go. <laughs> Goodness. Okay, I'm going to be here. Uh, let's mark it. I'm going to be here for like 11 hours. <laughs> oh my god. Let's do it. You're not an idiot. Best of humor to you. Get light into this insane man. Don't be long. This is a trap. Why can't I shoot her in the face? message you'd never get caught on camera not in the 
as she wanted to be seen. So what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next constant. I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me, they know what I'm doing. The Herald, Tamara Vidal. She has eyes everywhere, and they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my side for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. You fuck me over, bitch. Which you are. You're dead. Here, I got you an invitation, just like old times. Come find me when it's done. Good luck, 47. I love how it specifically says, do not eliminate Diana Burnwood. I love how it says that because you know all of us want to pop her in the face right now. Right? Like I said, we'll talk again when it's done. Right? <laughs> uh, okay. Well. Hmm. Go on. We shouldn't be seen together. It's so specific that to say, oh man, I just want to shoot her. I want to shoot her. <clears throat> and I should. She's pop her right in the face. Yeah, exactly. Unknown. Exactly. Uh, every single one of us just want to destroy her right now. Because we know it's coming. Unless it's like, a, you know, a double twist here. Senor. Enjoy the party. Evening, Senor. Would you care for an appetite? Interesting. Flying solo. I want all eyes on it. Let's see what she does. And Luther, try deploy the birds and key in on the party to get ready. We spread too thin, too many blind spots. Anyone as much as sneeze in the wrong direction, I want to know about it. That's all done. And I see your tour guide is none other than Gabriel Vargas, the state's chief winemaker. Well, this is a real privilege. You and Yates. Yes, about 400 meters, I should say. Pardon me? Never mind. I'll just wait here for my companion now. Carry on. Interesting. Hmm. Seems like she's supposed to get a tour from somebody, but that did not indicate the uh, mission intel for me. So she's gonna just sit there, isn't she? Very crowded area. I need to figure out where this person is that's gonna be escorting her. Do you recall the name of the architect who designed that bespoke reclaimed wood dining room? So where did you think I was gonna end up? Hello there.
Huh. There we go. Got a message from the boss. Here he calls. Let me guess, the Burnwood woman. That's right. Gates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Yeah. Wants you to tag along. Not for my sparkling personality. This Burnwood woman sure has his panties in a twist. Wonder what the deal is. Gates' business is his business. Just get yourself ready and sign into the visitor center. Have a drink on my behalf. Take care, unknown man. Honestly, thank you once again for coming back to the stream and joining us. And good luck on your exams, bro. I hope you do well. According to... You <sighs> tires. Okay. I can't go past this point. Shoot. I need to either be one of these dudes, or I need to be one of the security guys. I'll get to him. She's gone. Hmm. Goodness. This one's difficult. It's very open. Um... Let's try that corridor right there. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. This isn't a corridor at all. It's a viewing platform. There's another conversation taking place here. Oh, oh, oh. Eh. Do, 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 do. A lot of side stuff that could probably happen here. These fermentation tanks are accident prone. If the pump malfunctions, the tanks overflow. This has happened before, provoking an appearance from Don Yates. It's likely to happen again. There is no possible way that I can execute this guy in this area without somebody seeing me. There's no way. There's so many people here. Oh, it's so open too. So I just need to follow this guy.
How does this guy not see me? No way, I just, oh man, I just, this, this is my workout. This is my workout, hopefully, also I'm going to have to reload that. Oh, buddy. We'll risk it. I'm going to see if I can drag him without anybody seeing this. Okay. Whew. God, that took forever.
Oh, fuck me, that was close. Now, the temperature and humidity in the barrel room is all controlled by the ventilation system. State of the art equipment. Highly efficient. What? Okay, okay, okay. I take the look. Tranquilo, Bobby, tranquilo. Stay here. Have a cigarette or something. Okay, yeah. Am I missing it? Find a wrench. Else in here, eh? Okay. Got a vent up there. We ended up getting a workshop key. More than likely, it's trying to direct me that way, so. Let's see if I can find it, though. These are all just washrooms, okay? <laughs> I am the wet bandit. <laughs>
Oh my god, this is awesome. Man, I cannot wait to do my lethal playthrough of this mission. Oh man, that's gonna be nasty. <laughs> my guy's gonna be investigating distractions for a little bit. Oh, we got a toolbox here to steal an item. And let me guess, the wrench was there the whole time. Oh, he's running. He's running over here. We got him. Oh my god, he's gonna get fucked up. <laughs> Where is he? He's almost here. Okay. Wicked. Bye. I didn't want to kill them all, but it was too good. It was too good. It was too good. I ha I had to. It was like so set up, so perfect. Me. Oh no, this is about to backfire on me, guys. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Just don't look at the dead dude in the corner. Just 
Let's just go ahead and move him. I know, like, so many people have died here, but yeah, that's, like, the one for sure. For sure. They'll be like, wait, how did this guy die if, if he was all the way over here? Okay, lovely, beautiful, we did it. Okay. They must have took his body already. That was one of the bodies they took. Where did they dump him? I would love to go ahead and put on that idiot's uh, uniform now. Oh yeah, that would have... Oh shoot, he actually... How did he see him? Oh no, dude. Oh, I gotta wait again. Ah, oh, I gotta do all that again. No! Run. Run, run, run. These guys are just about to start moving the bodies. I can do this in time. It may have been a holdover from what happened before. He might have seen it and then it was like a, a late activation on finding a body. Let me just move this guy. Preferably, it would be great if I could find a spot for his body, though. I'm going to dump it somewhere. But I see nothing in this area. Shoot, I really don't know where to put him. I, man, mm. Anywhere I put him, you know what? This might be the best spot. There's no way for them. Their pathing shouldn't go this way. There, there, there. Hopefully, hopefully that will do. That will do. Okay, so, uh, they already dragged the bodies up there. Okay. Let's see what happens this time. He goes that way. He goes that way. There's the last of the conga line here. Which way are you gonna go? Really, man. So this dude, no matter what, he's going to go there. Did that still actually count? As body found? Did that count? Oh, man, I really hope not. Oh, man, fuck. <laughs> that one guy is a right shithead. Like, honestly, a right shit. That's so jokes. You know what though? Smart on the developers because they realize that this area is very hard to, um, you know, they like hide somebody's body. The only logical place you would put somebody was kind of like behind here. But my goodness, that that's pretty cruel. Imagine if I would have ran across the map and did not know where body found. You're like, what? Come on. I need to figure out a spot where I can dump this dude. Um. The thing that sucks, it really does, is that it does not indicate to you where there's just regular people, like civilians. That's so funny. That's so funny. Come on, game. So he... Ah, oh, man. No matter what, I have to take down that one guard then. I just have to move him up a little bit more around the corner. <sighs> Who sees it, by the way? One of them. One of them up there, for sure. Guaranteed. I literally kind of screwed myself with this guy's body being here. There's nowhere I can store him, either. God damn it. 
Let's let's pull them. Let's pull them. I was making like decent progress too there for a bit, and I was like, man, it's going pretty good. And that it was gonna hiccup eventually. It was gonna hiccup eventually. Okay, we're gonna put this fucking guy right here. Where's the conga line at so far? They're up the stairs. All right. The game has kind of forced my hand on like my movement here too. One, two, he's a little bit late to the party. I'm not sure I've seen God damn it, man. Ah, it's so annoying. Ah, oh, it's so annoying. <laughs> God. <laughs> Shit sucks. Ah, <laughs> oh, like And it really sucks that like one of them is like like they're all so suspicious of me. Oh, if I want to time that just a bit better though. Okay, whatever. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Fuck, man. Oh, okay. Let's try this again. I gotta, I gotta stay cool. I gotta, I not, I can't just rush them as soon as they go for it. I can't rush them. And this guy's super annoying too, because he's just sitting there and it's like, like how many people are like watching the situation right here? It indicates search grade now, too. Why didn't I do this before? Why am I? Oh my god, numbskull moment here. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. It feels good. Oh, it feels good. Guaracho, you're not me, and I'm you. Let's take him. Just as his pals are coming around the, the corner here. Six, let's save that. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's our main guy, too. I think that's our dude that we need. Once again, they'll go into search mode. Very interesting. So how many bodies do they have left to move? They have two more to go. I just want to make 100% sure that when they come back, yeah, okay, cool. They're not going to go back the other way. Very nice. Oh, boy.
Where are they storing these bodies? Oh, we can't put on the, the big dude's uniform. Okay. Awesome. That feels good. That feels good to finally get that one completed. Okay. Okay, so she's over there. Diana is over there, too. I was an attorney. For four decades, I served the law. Now, I serve something far grander. I serve the land. I grew up here. These majestic plains were my playground, and returning here to pick up the mantle of my ancestors feels just incredibly profound. Our goal here is to get again from our state of the art winemaking facility to our carefully nurtured grapes and take the loving care of ah. the collection. Boys, it's annoying. I believe that still technically counts as the body was found. Okay. That is so goddamn stupid. How did I not notice, like, he was so far out, too? God, let's get him over here. That's interesting. They're now both like alerted individuals. Before there was only one. Oh fuck me! I almost messed that up again. You can't just leave a gun sitting on the ground. They'll they'll get suspicious of that. Okay, cool. God, man, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, uh, at least this is not like such a gong show moment as. What mission was that? Was it? Was it the third mission? No. One of the missions I really kept failing. Where I just had to continuously reload, reload, and reload. It was so bad. Okay. Yeah, I'll take you down ahead, security. You will be me. Being the head of security would be perfect. I can, I'm pretty sure with that I can go anywhere I want if I can get his uh, his uniform. It will be good. And hopefully a program that really nice where Buddy is in front of the other one now again. It did it again. See, look, look how he paths. He's gonna path this way now. Interesting. That's so interesting. What's up, son of a bitch? We're blast. We're so blast now. Wrong just ugh, what? Mm. Okay, so that dude, regardless, is gonna path this way, right? Because that's the only body left, right? Out of all these people, that's the only one who's left. 
Look at, look at this pile of dudes. There we go. You guys are having a good time, right? Because, if I'm not wrong, now that I'm looking at this, that last guy should path this way too. More than likely, he's going to path this way. So that I don't have to fucking deal with that again. Let me go ahead and save that real quick. Okay. God, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have thought that I would still be on this portion of the uh, mission after I had electrocuted all of them. But man, that one dude really did make a massive hiccup for the whole thing. But, yeah, it is what it is, right? Watch his pathing. Will he path this way too? Yeah, it looks like he is. Hello. Fuck me, that should be the last one. Hopefully that will be our last one that we have to deal with now. God, man. This is like the one kind of corner where people can't maybe not see things. Hopefully. God. <laughs> Please. <laughs> so let's go ahead and save. Oh. Okay. Where is our target now? She is up there with Diana. She's actually like super close, really nice. For four decades. Let's get up here. Oh my god, they move. They're moving though. It's a nice gesture. But a bit too cryptic, wouldn't you say? Not even metaphorically. Tell me you did it, sir. Stop. Tell me you did it. Good day to you, sir. I didn't forget your fellow Torchmigas. Thank you for your service, sir. <laughs> I love, like, the hard star, like, oh shit. Oh shit. Is it gonna kill her right next to me? This is awesome. I don't think there's a single person. I'm not gonna explain it. That can um just find another torch. Don't care how or with a laughing stock. Yeah, yeah, sure, okay. My mother prefers him, I will never understand. I'm saying no other law firm has this kind of brand. So people all over the world know that Morgan hates me. I take it Edward told you to shut up. You know what I mean. Trust is earned. Until Edwards is satisfied you're not sailing under a false flag, I will be his eyes and ears. I meant why you? I suppose I'm more perceptive than most. You're also very loyal. My guess is Edward's decision to make me a herald is not too popular with the other heralds. We were at war about five minutes ago. Some people are funny like that. But not you. I admire the class, the audacity. Everyone said Providence was untouchable and along you came. The way I see it, did us a service. That's cold. I like you more already. Touche. That's jokes. There actually is a one person that can be suspicious of me, and whoever that is, it looks like maybe the camera guy. <sighs> this is interesting, though. What's up, dude?
This is gonna be weird. Just an accident waiting to happen. Occupational hazard. Averwood? <coughs> Let's rejoin the fun. Whatever you say. Why are you here, Burnwood? Didn't you know? I have tango fever. Thing is, nobody held a gun to your head. Why did you take his offer? It was time for a change. Also, learning the truth about your partner. Harsh. Do you see? I've read your ICA profile. All those years, you never took a contract for money or glory. Only to serve your personal brand of vigilante justice. Targeting those who rise above the law, except for yourself, of course, but hey, everyone's a hypocrite. Still, it makes you wonder. I was wasting my potential. I did garbage duty for 30 years, and where did it get me? You certainly kept the world's coroners on their toes. Edwards is right. Power never dies. It only changes hands. And his hands, well... I figure the world could do a lot worse. You admire him. I thought resisting power was noble, but revolution is a young person's game. It's easy to tear down, much harder to build. I figure I can be Edward's conscience. God knows I have the practice. Hmm. Did I pass your test? It was hardly the pledge of allegiance, but it's the best I could expect from a free thinking radical. Yo, at what point do I kill this person? There's two security details at all time, regardless of where I go. And I don't think it's gonna be... That'd be pretty funny if it was. What do you believe in, Vidal? I believe most people need to be led. They want it too, mind you. They've just been brainwashed by liberal humanism to think it's something to resist, something to be ashamed of. Might is right. Is that it? Any dumb mob or chest-pounding gorilla has might. I believe in you. I see a slight opportunity here. Okay. The rule of competence. Those who are born with superior huh? skills what? and intellect have a moral oh, obligation oh, to lead. It's as simple as that. Huh? Yeah. Good point. Mm. Hey, you can't throw things around. Fucking nerd. My idea was to go ahead and do, toss two coins. Those who are born with superior skills and intellect have a moral obligation to lead. It's as simple as that. Wow. You're just a social media shitstorm waiting to happen, aren't you? Don't talk to me about privilege. Uh, when the enemy is at the gate, you want... The best man will be in charge. Privilege or not. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. The rule of competence. Those who are born with superior skills and intellect have a moral obligation to lead. It's as simple as that. Wow. You're just a social media shitstorm waiting to happen, aren't you? Don't talk to me about privilege. 
When the enemy is at the gates, you want the best man leading the charge, privileged or not. Questioning natural hierarchies is a peacetime luxury, and it only leads to chaos and decline. Providence must exist. What was that? A necessary evil. Hey, There's nothing evil about it. You ever hear a trash can? No such Say thing. What? Oh. Asshole. Oh, it's too bad you can't do like an old school like splinter cell, like over the, you know, like over the thing. Uh, I don't know if I can do it with, maybe I can do it with the uh, garage wire. Let's see. Because there's nobody looking at him. There's nobody looking at him in this position. Like it leaves me that opportunity. Ah, uh, well. Jeez. Are you kidding me, game? Why are you sneaking around? Hey, why are you being a douchebag? Now, now I'm actually like physically puzzled. Now I really am, because ah, uh, jeez, man, I really am. Those who are born with superior skills and intellect you know what would be the funniest way to do this? He's looking that way, he's looking that way, he's looking that way. I'm over here. I'm hidden, right? It was definitely not what I wanted to do. Like I'm sure there's a great and extravagant way or extravagant way to like kill that person, but my god. That is that is crazy. Two security details. And I've been sitting here for like bloody ten hours. <laughs> Are you the one that's gonna carry her away, bud? Are you the guy? That must have been a little wake-up call for Diana, right? You just saw somebody's brains get splattered in front of you. Oh, this is gonna be bullshit. Ugh. Ugh, God. She's the exit. Are you for real? It's done. Now what? Now, we strike at the heart. Edwards. You know how to find him, don't you? Why, Edwards finds you, 47. He is untraceable, and he never lets you forget it. He is cocky, and that will be his downfall. Wait, are you What's on my side or not? Too many eyes. Meet me at the Olive Grove at sunset. One last tango, 47. Uh, I don't know. Still seems like she's gonna betray. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, like I definitely, like this mission you can do so much, so much in this mission. Pff, yeah, exactly. Two stars. And I, I deserve that. Like I was, I was definitely bum rushing it, that's for sure. I was bum rushing it. I did it sloppily too. Like that that whole thing with the tanks with the one guy. It's definitely good if you're trying to go with the um lethal. Doesn't matter like who you kill situation. But that's fine. Cool. Oh, goodness.
goodness gracious. I'll get the cutscene here, see what happens. How did you know? Your deal. That kind of power always comes with a price. What's yours? I think you know. I am sorry. This is a necessary evil. What have you done? Ether Brand's neurotoxin, transposed by touch. See, Edwards learns by his mistakes, 47. And as you've clearly demonstrated, brute force is futile. It had to be me. It was the only way. To get this close. My family. I know what you did. After all these years, I finally know. I am sorry. You didn't have a choice. I did. Providence used you, but I know better. All I saw was a blank slate, a weapon to wield. I told myself it was what you needed, but people aren't meant to be controlled. This is a kindness. Goodbye, Agent. Yes, guys, it's happening. There's no way I'm not going to... After that, there's no fucking way. <laughs> there's no way I'm just going to end the stream now. Oh my god, I can't leave it on that after finger. Oh, god, okay. Bring it up. Are you still here? Is this gonna be like still a blood clinging oh. on to your self image. Agent forty seven, the apex predator. the fuck always hiding behind the headlines was perfection its own justification or a willful distraction a wall built contract by contract to shield you from the uncomfortable truth. You're exactly the tool they bred you to be. <laughs> All of them well. Quite a piece of work you are. How could you possibly function on your own? You never even had a name. Until I gave you one. It's him. Burnwood never ceases to surprise me. You really are a most singular individual. And to think she wanted me to put you down. Lucky for you, I never throw away anything useful. Prepare the serum. Forgetting's not so bad. You've done it before. What's he doing? Is he still looking at us? I'm afraid so. Poor Sap just won't accept his days are done. Perhaps I should take him out to the woods and set him free. Oh, it's a classic. <laughs> he was a loyal tool. But everything goes the way of the horse and cart eventually. I 
couldn't agree more. Are you done? The toxins are playing into your fears. Don't let them. Come on. Got to get your head straight. She wants me dead. She has every right to after what we did. But that's not what is really going on. She chose power. In the end, she was just like them. No. She found a way to turn Edward's own cleverness against him. The rest is up to you. I don't know how. You do know. Diana! Coming! Once you dispose of Edward's, I will dismantle Providence from the top down. It will finally be over. All you have to do is embrace the past. members may be eliminated okay When we go commercial, I mean, figure the thing is commercial application. We'd want to have their minds wiped. Not wiped, obviously. But that's just fine tuning. Okay, right now the serum erases long and short term memory banks wholesale. But in a couple of cycles, we'll be able to isolate the effects of individual memories. Imagine if you could pluck out childhood traumas, ugly breakups, combat trauma. You guys should be over the moon. Talking about. I love waking up in a cold sweat with a scream stuck in my throat. So, what would you call this? Detaching off the counter. I don't know. Blank plate of beans? You are a piece of work, lady. Come on. Gin, was it? It always starts like this GPS, microwave, duct tape. This serum will eventually improve lives. I've got to believe that. Tell that to the poor SOB in the rear car. Nah. When I want to forget something, I rely on my good old pal, Mr. Al Paul. You know what that means. Okay, detective report on Ether Serum, new memory, replacing neural inhibitor serum. Formula is a reverse engineer enhanced by a much older prototype created by the Institute. Okay, I remember that in Romanian 1980s. And it was produced R&D. Uh, 
file was stolen by Lucas Cray during the assault of the facility in order to unlock Agent 47's hidden memories and its current version serum. It's like one instrument completely erasing both the long and short term memory banks, but the research team is confident that in just a few cycles. Okay. This is interesting, so how do I go about this then? Can I literally just walk right by? You poster. Ah, I see. Oh. Hey, Wicklam, how you doing, man? I, holy smokes, you're still awake? <laughs> uh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. How, how how about you? How did you enjoy it? Oh. I got work right now, bro. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, really? You know what? <laughs> to be honest with you, this whole time, I, I thought you were, um... This whole time, I thought you were streaming the game. Oh, look at all these tools in here. Last time I saw weather like this, I was doing extreme conditions training. Trust me, they get some real winners out there. Anyway, this was January 12 years ago, around about. It was like this times 10, basically. Couldn't see more. We're gonna do it. 
Watching the security cams in POV. <laughs> oh, I feel you, man. I definitely don't miss those days. Years and years of, of doing that too, man. Gosh, it burns your eyes yeah, looking at cameras all night. While it's still in your nose. So cold, the air burns your throat when you breathe. All that. And we're out there dragging supply sleds that weighed five times more than a day. Hey! Thank you, gentlemen, for all your weaponry. Yeah, bro, the I love the game so far. I um I unfortunately missed the other two installments. Um I played the hell out of uh the hell out of Absolution and probably my favorite in the series was Blood Money. But um, I didn't realize until getting into the game that you could actually play like Hitman 1 and 2 on the on this game. I had no clue. I just need to purchase the pack to go ahead and do that. Which I think I might do. Like I ended up missing a lot. I know the story of the game, but my god is... I love it. <laughs> it's super fun. Yo, I'm missing something here. Didn't that dude have a... No, 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 that guy had to... I'm pretty sure I saw a guy, like, carrying, like, a... Like, a proper, like, gun here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. The fact that I'm free reign to shoot all these people the is so good. Bought this train for sample backup storage. But since the bombing of their R&D site in Johannesburg, they're refitting the car with the mobile. I might get this free because I own them before, but I'm moving on the Xbox. You'll be linked to my. Oh, that that might be the. Wait, it's not Ubisoft though, is it? Isn't it Idios? I thought that's what these games were was Idios. I can't remember. Was it Ubisoft that made this? I know, I know that for sure at one point, IDEOS definitely, <coughs> definitely owned uh, the Hitman property because if I'm not wrong, it was what it, it was what um, saved the company from bankruptcy. What the frig, really? Uh, where are you going to get the missions free if you own them? Oh, really? Oh, that's cool. It's too bad, like, I never I never got an opportunity to play Hitman 1 and 2. Um, at that particular time, I wasn't financially well. I was kind of moving around a lot, uh, working different jobs. So I ended up missing out. But I kind of kept up with the storyline by watching some videos on YouTube, like people kind of who laid down the story, which was really nice. Um, but
but I was so that's such a pleasant surprise that you know you could play all three. That's super cool. I would love it if they could do a um, if they were to make like Blood Money remastered, which they, maybe they did. I'm not too sure. That, that would just make my day. Oh my god, <laughs> Blood Money so good. I can't remember if it was remastered or if they remastered some of the missions for one of the games. I can't remember. And yeah, dude, it looks wicked. You're gonna have an absolute blast when you go to play. You're gonna have a great time. Um, the missions are so cool. Uh, craft sounds pistol. <laughs> yes. You can put that on the Steam page. There's, te there's technically crafting in it. Well, I guess it's not on Steam, is it? It's on. Uh, <laughs> it's on Epic, but. <laughs> Wait a minute, how is this locked on the other side? has to be a way I can get in there. Ah, uh, really? Dude, that'd be amazing. Wouldn't that be cool if they did that? If it was crossplay? Man, that'd be cool. I don't know if it is or not. I, I think I tried searching it yesterday, but I couldn't really find any results uh, of whether or not it was... Uh, Crossplay or not, but I hope it is. God. <laughs> Soviet Union. Oh no, she's dead. <laughs> Alrighty, gentlemen. My god. That was a slow reaction from him. Give me his gun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Is it gonna differentiate the two? Is it not gonna give me more ammo for it? Probably not, I guess. Unless maybe. Okay, I see. See, that's a bit of a, that's a bit of a logical error, logic error that they had on the programming there. Or you need to have the other pistol in your inventory to keep collecting ammo. Hopefully they'll patch that. That should be an easy patch, though. <clears throat> Sick. It's too bad. It's too bad I can't do headshots in other games, though. <laughs> oh. Well, on this one I can I can do it okay on this one, but my goodness, usually I am just hot garbage when it comes to um. I'm missing keys, man. Like, ah. I'm not missing anything on your guys' body, have I? I don't think I've seen anybody drop keys so far. No, okay, I'm not missing them yet, so I can't find those keys. There's like a fuse box of sorts inside there, I'm not sure. Right there, blast. Oh, I love how that's for like stealth. Like on this mission, you don't need to do stealth at all. A big update on Rogue today. It should be cool. They're adding new Rogue too. Oh, really? I am. What happened? <laughs> What happened, buddy? Oh no, the power's still out. <laughs> uh. Gentlemen? <laughs> it's
It is my pool table now, boys. Uh. Yeah, Wicklum, bro, when you go to stream this, you're going to have an absolute blast. Um, and the cool thing, too, is that there's a lot of replay uh, replayability on this one. Um, oh, my bad. Get hit. Oh, my oh god, that was close. Which room was that cabin on? I don't think I can even access it. Huh? Yeah, you know what? Because I because I didn't play the other ones, I um I didn't realize that they have it where you could you can keep going in and like doing other things. Like like how you can keep um tackling the mission in different ways. I think that's that's a really cool and smart idea that they did. Dang, I really I really, really wanted to go ahead and go through um Try to figure out where that door was, but that's okay. Oh, they're actually forcing me to go through it. Oh, oh. That's what I get for not paying attention. That's what I get. That's what I get. So I thought I thought that was pretty cool, like how you can do so many different things per mission. Like there's one mission, dude. You're gonna <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. You're gonna you're gonna have a fun time with it though. Um where I immediately I was like, yeah, I have to come back for, for more on this one. Why can't I, um... You know what, I am very confused because I'm assuming... Okay, let me go back, let me go back. I'm assuming... Where is that room? Oh, yeah, that's room. This room right here. There we go. Mmm, <laughs> feels good. Feels good. <laughs> the only thing is, I have a problem now. I can't get through that. Um, I can't get through that space though. <laughs> Jackpot! Ding ding ding! <laughs> The rusty nail! That's what was needed! A rusty nail! Really? Oh no! <laughs> oh 
Oh no! Look at that. Just another day for uh, pick up smoke. Just another day for Agent Forty Seven. reference this much herself because that would be funny if it was right there. I wish they had a deathmatch mode. I'm, yeah, you know what? That'd be cool. I'm trying to remember. Was there, um, um was there like an, an agent versus agent mode in one of the games? I can't, I can't remember. Like, I remember seeing one of the games from uh, somebody else playing it before, where it was like, you had Agent 47, and then there was like another Agent 47, and they were both playing on the same map, but like, the, the other Agent 47 kind of looked like, for some reason, the only way I can describe it is he looked like a mannequin for some reason. Um, I've never had this much stackage in a mission yet. Oh my god. We're gonna just blend in. <clears throat> no problem here. <laughs> oh. Like Wicklam, I was gonna stop the stream probably geez, well over three hours ago, but the, the story keeps dragging me in, I love it. One person was the target, I think. Oh, really? There was a mole behind that. I've never gone into it. Okay, I see. I see. Oh, man, we got a grenade. Forbidden pineapple. Oh, yeah. This is going to be fun. Uh, am I missing anything else? Do I have enough? <laughs> Do I have enough ammo here? You know what? I haven't saved in a good while. Oh, I don't want to overwrite that one. I definitely want to do something when I get back to that mission. That sounds like a really fun time, actually. Like you're trying, you're trying to, to outsmart the other one. That's pretty cool. The 
Hooked is hooked is definitely the right word for it. Yeah, hooked a hundred percent. Old train's full of mercs to guard one guy. You do know who he is, right? Sure, sure. Everyone's very impressed. I get it. I get it. And if you want some kind of elaborately planned calamity or a convenient heart attack, sure, he's your man. But how does he manage in a brawl? I'm willing to bet this guy doesn't hold a candle to any of us. Too much sneaking around and dressing up. Too little fighting. Dry. You feel like putting that theory to the test? I just might. I'll be back. I wanted to go ahead and fight him, for real, like actually fight him. I was gonna fuck him up, but he brought all his boys with him because you know he's a big strong man, right? Oh, there he goes. <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen eventually. What a what a what a what a strong man though, right? He was a strong man. You yeah, bitch, you can fight me. You no know, one on you. Fuck off. Run all your boys, you big pansy. <laughs> oh, I should have threw the grenade. Shotgun with a silencer. You want you want to hear like something disgusting? Um. In Battlefield 3, you could get yourself like a Remington shotgun with a silencer with flechette rounds. Oh man, that thing was overpowered. Is this a glitch now? It's a glitch, boys. Yeah, programming error, okay. It's ridiculous if you ask me. Yeah, is it, dude? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're you're so fuck you, <laughs> stupid guy. This guy was all talk about like, oh yeah, this guy's this guy's nothing. Just like in real life, I'm deadly with a pistol. Here we go. There you go. Yeah, Battlefield, man. It's too bad that the, the last one, they kind of, you know, they kind of screwed up bad with it. With Battlefield 5, they, they definitely, they definitely fell from grace 
Hey, yeah, Derek. What's up, man? <laughs> it's all it takes. <laughs> somebody, wa somebody wants to troll. Bye bye. <laughs> bye. Have a great time, dude. <laughs> like, who does that? Oh yeah, I already got him. I already, already got him. Shotgun ready to go. He's gone. <laughs> hey. I already had a situation earlier tonight like that. There was already a person earlier tonight that was kind of trolling as well. It is what it is. There it goes. I lost connection there for a second. Had an internet hiccup there. are thickums, eh? They take a lot of hits. They take a lot of hits. Holy smokes. I think I've been picking up ammo as I go. There was that, uh... This huge crate had one flashbang. That's some... That's some over-packaging if I've ever seen it. That's like... That's like packaging from, like, Amazon right there. Come on now. Oh, you boys are gonna give me everything I need. Oh, it looks like some of your guns may have actually disappeared. Like how it's like this is illegal to have out, buddy. I'm killing everybody in here. Help! Somebody help me! No. You guys were fucking with me this whole mission. You guys are all dead. Oh fuck! What happened? What happened? No life stared. Except for the women. You don't kill the women. No children. I'm like I'm like Tony Montana, no women, no children. <laughs> well, there was that one mission where I you know what no, there was that one mission where I accidentally did drown one check. That was my bad. Whoopsies daisies, but I did reload that safe. <laughs> I went to go like subdue her and then she just flew into the water and she drowned. I was like shit. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. I usually play um, 
I usually play these games very stealthily, but uh, this mission it lets you like go ham, which is really awesome. Because like Hitman games have like these new ones, they really have good like you know like good gun mechanics. Nobody lives except the women and children. That's like one of the weirdest scenes in Scarface 2. Like, he decides not to kill. Spoiler alert for like a super old movie, by the way. If you never watched Scarface, go ahead and watch it. There's there's no way you shouldn't have watched Scarface by now. But yeah, I always thought that was pretty funny. This guy does like loads of cocaine, kills a bunch of gangsters, all that stuff. No women, no children. Who would have secured his whole empire? That was the one thing he decided not to. He had that one value in his heart. Yeah, it's like really good. It's like super responsive. I like it. Um, you know what? In like Blood Money, the shooting wasn't like bad. Definitely not going to say it was bad. Um, it was a little janky though. <laughs> I will say that. It was a bit janky. Um, but for the most part, like, even Blood Bunny, like, uh, it was, it was okay. Give me a Fortoni. Hey man, nobody fucking, nobody said there was gonna be kids, man. What the fuck's this? Oh, I can kill you, can't I? But I'm not going to. Oh shit, it's it's me. Ooh, spooky. Please don't. I will though. I don't know what I've done to you, but please, please don't shoot. Huh. Excuse me. Can I get some help over here, please? She's not moving where I can subdue her. Hey, don't go <laughs> Just slugged her. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, absolutely Mike tyson her. Oh Christ. I know, I, I forgot I could actually do this. Boom. <laughs> oh, not even Sean Connery would do that. You never hit a woman with a close fish, it's always an open hand slap. <laughs> Whoever's gonna find that train, they're gonna be horrified. <laughs> like, whoever. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> it's like. It's like I was being like so. Like, so good to them, and then just BAM! <laughs> Jesus. What a massive punch in the face. This looks like trap territory. Guaranteed it's trap territory. Hey, hey, Wicklum, I, I want to give you... I, you know what, bro? I have to give you a heads up. I'm going to stand here real quick. You should not watch this part. You should not watch this part. You're gonna, It's going to spoil it for you. This, this is going to be massive spoilers for you. I'm like right at the end of the game right now. So don't watch Don't watch this part. I would I would click off if I were you. Do not, do not uh, spoil anything for you, right? I don't want, I don't want to ruin that for you. Cool, thank you, bro. Thank you, thank you, yeah. I definitely don't want to kill it for you. <coughs> I don't suppose there's any point calling for help. No. Seems I brought this up myself. Well played, Miss Burnwood. Do you really think she'll be able to resist all that power? This is not how people work. She rejects the power, not the responsibility. 
a noble idea. But please join me in the real world. I trust you already know what this is. Why not simply take it? Embrace who you were always meant to be. No, never again. <sighs> well, I had to try. Go on then. Do your thing. At least I die knowing who I am. Yeah. You think out the back of the knees, boom. Son of a bitch, get that. Black Lily. Yes. Sounds good, bro. Sounds good. Gotta get those rounds in. <laughs> God, I remember doing that. Oh my God, good old stupid rounds in that crap ball. Oh God, I'm gonna do my room inspections now. Is there another one? Oh. One year. It's been a long time. Agent 47. That's not who I am anymore. The pact is done. The past. Death. And yet, here you are. choose this path because I can. There will always be people like them. So there will always be people like us. No one is untouchable. It's good to be back. goodness oh it's so good so good oh so good <laughs> I cannot wait you know what I'm gonna be streaming this again uh, probably tomorrow <laughs> I cannot wait to go back into some of those missions and try to try to do all those challenges man like god I'm a big fan of suits like doing suit mode um just only suit very very hard but i cannot wait to do it and definitely going to be going ahead and doing um i'm going to be doing it on the hardest difficulty i love doing that i love challenges i love being frustrated like that in games where it kind of challenges you 
And yeah, I can't wait. So let's go ahead and continue. Shout out to all the programmers there. I'm sorry that I ended up, you know, skipping through. Last mission is so satisfying. looked at it the, the one loser that goes to spam the chat goes ahead and leaves a dislike <laughs> oh yeah go, go have a good time bud what a loser <laughs> people who go out of their way to go out and troll other people you're losers i'm sorry I'm just gonna say that right now like are you trolling for fun with your buds completely different story but you're gonna go ahead ah. don't need you here buddy don't need you here leave your dislike i don't care <laughs> Go get mad. Go get mad. Like, what? I was going to let you just spam the chat like that? Get out of here. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Gotta love people. Gotta love how people are. Ooh, jeez. Ah. <laughs> oh so good so good and there's like side missions too isn't there carpathian mountains that's where that last one was okay okay i see yeah there's mission stories too right oh wait a minute these are from the other games right this is from number two right Oh, that looks epic as fuck. <laughs> that looks amazing. It's so big. Wilton Creek. This looks so good. Mumbai. Santa Fortuna. Miami. Yo, 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 what? Oh, Bangkok. Marrakesh. Oh man, I know I'm yet yeah. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried. Yeah, these these must be from the other games, correct? Like if I was to go ahead and like, click on hers. Yes, okay. Yeah, I um considering that getting the full pack is actually not that much, I'm definitely gonna go ahead and do it, because that's pretty cool. Yeah, side missions, right? There's side missions too. Campaign patient zero, campaign, uh, bonus missions, and then special assignments. And then we have the game modes. Game modes is contracts, sniper assassin, store. Oh, I see. I see how they're doing this. Okay, I see. Standard edition. We got the six destinations. Yes. That's the one I have. That's the one I ended up buying. But yeah, see, like, that's the one I'm interested in, because I'm seeing... Those are those are definitely from um, Blood Money. Right? Like, 100%. Yeah, I'm going to have to look into those. Um, I, the one thing I'm wondering is, where is the... Uh, there, there is like the multiplayer, isn't there? Unless, unless I'm wrong here. That's contracts. Game of Sniper Assassin. What's this? These are to get access. I have to get access to all these. I see. Cool. Okay. The only thing I'm a little bit confused on is, um. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh, cool, okay. Uh, well, 
Well, I'm just wondering where where is the um where is the multiplayer mode? Hmm. I don't know where the multiplayer mode is in the game. It does have multiplayer, does it not? Anyways, I'll definitely figure it out. Yeah, I'm, I'm super excited to come back into this. Um, 100%. Like, that one mission right here. This one, Death of the Family. Dude, 100% we're going back into this. I can't wait. We're going to do suits on that one. It's going to be pretty fun. Uh, that should be pretty cool. Yeah, this was a fun stream, everybody. And honestly, thank you so much to everybody who ended up coming out uh, to the stream today. Except for the two trolls. You guys can you guys can not come back and we're good on that. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you guys all for who came through. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, uh, liking the videos, uh, checking out the streams. You know, we appreciate that. Um, if you're new, definitely subscribe. Uh, like the video. Um, yeah, we try to do streams pretty often here. Um, yeah, until next time, guys. Uh, I'll see you then. Like, uh, I am here almost... I'm five minutes away from 11 hours. This was a one heck of a stream. Super fun. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we're going to catch you guys next time. Thank you all for coming on through. Uh, take care, everybody. Be good to each other. <laughs>